And uh, yeah, thank you once again for all the subs and gift subs. I always very much appreciate that. I very much appreciate you all. And um, I hope you all enjoy tonight. Let's do it. So injected smooth jazz directly into Shady's veins. If you guys actually started saying shit like Shady, you're just imagining it. It's not even there. There's a chance part of me would have actually believed you a little bit. And my controller's stuck. I... <laughs> What a, what a fantastic start. I'm sorry, my controller has to reconnect now. God damn it. Give me one second. This happens sometimes. Writer's block is annoying. I just want to finish another chapter. Take that take take that big old break, Nat. I promise. You take a big old break, it'll come back to you. Um, as someone who gets uh, uh, burnt out on art things a lot, uh, best thing to do is take a step back, even though your brain will be stubborn and tell you to keep going because if, if you don't do it now, you won't, you know, you're running out of time. Don't worry about it. You'll actually be saving time in a way. But anyways, welcome back. Let me know how the volume is, if it's too quiet or too loud. Um, but yes, we are on hero mode, so the entire game is mirrored. Um, and uh, it is harder. You don't get heart drops from anything unless you drink a potion or go into a hot spring. So um, yeah, it's going to be it's gonna be fun. It's going to be great. It's going to be great. Uh, Silver, for the, <laughs> to the, the gift sub to Ghost Jazz. Thank you very much. I very much appreciate that. <laughs> Ghost, honestly, that's a sick name. I kind of want to make a song just called Ghost Jazz and make it like a spooky swing song, uh, which I do have. It would be it, the old song, The Visitor. I wonder if I want to keep that name or just actually just call it Ghost Jazz now. Damn, that 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 that, that slaps. But also, hey everyone, well, once again, I am waking up from a nap. I woke up really late. Now, I, I, let me give you the reason now. Um, but I literally woke up and then started this stream, so I'm a little frazzled. Um, but. Uh, Wait, this is GameCube the Wii version. This is the Wii U version, which is a higher uh, a higher resolution version of the GameCube one. But Hero Mode is basically the Wii version, but also Hard Mode at the same time. And I've played both, so I'm like half used to this. Like, I, I had the Wii version originally. But also, I hope you're doing well, Perella. I actually really like that name. I don't know why, but Perella is just a really nice name. Um, but yeah, the Wii version slapped. It slapped. Is that why it's normal to you? Yeah, so if you've played the Wii version, this is going to be fine to you. With Link being right-handed and everyone else being left-handed and shit. Um, but yeah, the the, the real quote-unquote canon version is the left the left-handed version. So the GameCube. What? They remove some of the Vaseline eye bloom. The Wii U version like adds more, I believe. I could be wrong about that, but I do love how the Wii version like I love the Wii U version the most. It looks fantastic to me personally. There are some times where the faces on some characters are a little messed up. Especially Ilya, poor thing. But um I think it it's it's great. I want to see this on the Switch still and uh Wind Waker maybe one day. Um but anyways, yeah, the reason I started so late is I had a dream <gasps> That's a blue choo choo! Wait, 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 get it, go, 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 go. No, Epona, no! Stop, stop, don't fuse, don't fuse with that thing. Don't fuse with him, don't fuse with him, no, no! You've got. <laughs> if, chat, if I bottled that blue choo choo juice, that would have given me so much more than the red potion. God damn it! God damn it, you can't, it, purple juice does nothing to you except hurt you. But also, yes, those are choo choos in this game, they're very cute. Also, thank you for the gifts up to Retro Silver. I very much appreciate that, and Retro Mad deserves it. So thank you so much. Y'all are goddamn lovey. Lovey? Lovely. Jesus. That's a whole different term. Um, but yeah, yeah, it's a full heal. That's it. God damn it. It's okay. Uh, thank you. It's actually a thing from... Yeah, I, I... I, Okay, I was gonna ask you about that, Perella. Yeah, it's the it's the fish peeps. They're literally called the Perella, aren't they? Um, yeah, I, I saw that, and I was like, oh shit, yo, wait. Another Zelda fan coming on in? Hell yeah. Uh, Zelda's my favorite series ever. I, I, I have a bunch of, I mean, I have all the games, a bunch of merch, limited editions. I have all the Historia stuff. I, I, I love telling chat about all the lore. I just passed Blake Hylia. Christ almighty. Um, so I love talking. I'm actually having a lore stream, I think next month, hopefully. Or I'm just telling chat about like the entire timeline and like theories, but also like fun facts about stuff and like what carries over into the other games. So, um... I feel like it's going to be a lot of fun. Oh, we could actually go through this way. Th this could work. Um, thank you for the gifts up to Blue Choo Choo Jelly. Thank you. Thank you. I'm only I'm only going to cry a little bit. I'm only going <laughs> to only going to cry a little bit. But thank you so much, Ralph. What the hell? Wow, you like Zelda? I do like Zelda, Carly. Also, Carly, Carly, Carly. Are you um are you getting Pokémon? Are you getting Pokémon? It's it's coming out on Friday. I'm asking for reasons. Um, 
But, uh, yeah, the, yeah, the info dump stream, basically. But I want to have, like, funny PowerPoint stuff to go with it. Okay, asshole. I'm going to win your challenge, and I'm going to do it amazingly this time. I'm going to get as many rupees as I can. I have I have PTSD. I played I played this guy for, like, 40 minutes last stream. And chat saw me going, like, nuts. But we did get the heart piece and stuff, which is good. But this time, I'm going to get all of these and land on the top island. You are getting it. Okay, hell yeah. I am also picking it up. Okay, you hate this guy's face in HD. <laughs> do you? He's a man of style. Thank you for the gifts of the purple choo-choo. They don't deserve it ever, Helia. But you know what? Thank you so much. <laughs> I very much appreciate it. Been watching you for a while. Just haven't talked yet. Oh, well, shit. Well, thank you so much for coming on by and just lurking at times. I always appreciate the lurkers out there. And, uh, well, welcome in to you talking. Oh, my God. First try. First try. Holy shit. <laughs> what? Where did these skills come from? I guess because I'm not tired and sleep deprived. But, like, oh, my God. Let's go. Let's go. Multiplayer stream? Maybe one day, actually. I keep talking about all these community nights that I have to do, and I keep forgetting to do them. But yes, I would absolutely love to do that. And Monster Hunter. And, um... I mean, we still gotta do Smash and stuff again. Maybe Mario Party would be cool, actually, as well. Anyways, let's do this. Let's do this. Um, also, I might do some uh, online stuff with friends soon as well. For all of that. I do my water bombs, right? Okay, thank God. I want to blow this up real quick. Actually, I don't think I can. Yeah. Right, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Anyways, you guys know me and water temples are... I, I, I'm not good with them. Um, nor are they my favorite. Okay, never mind. It floats up. Yeah, I'm an idiot. <laughs> Smash Bros? Yes, I will be having a Smash Night eventually. Uh, we used to do it more often whenever like a new character would get announced. But we will do it soon. And um, you guys, everyone here can take part in it. Uh, there's literally only one rule that I have people follow, and it's if if you lose, or sorry, if you win, um, you have to get out of the ring because I need to come back in. I want to play every match. I don't want to spectate um, because th th my commentary would be absolutely god awful. And also, I want to play the game. So the only thing is, is like make sure I have a turn during matches, and I'll but I'll make sure to, like I, I I face everyone. So everyone wants to take part. I usually face like just about everyone. Uh, when Salmon Run night, though, would you guys want to do Splatoon Salmon Run with me? If so, then, um, yeah, sure. I gotta get back into Splatoon again. I haven't played in a hot minute, because new games keep coming out. Like, Pokemon's coming out soon. Callisto Protocol, which I'm gonna stream a bit of. Which, by the way, speaking of Callisto Protocol, um... <laughs> that game is so violent, it's banned in Japan. Um, the ratings, the rating board there said, hey, you might want to lower it. They said, no, we want to keep our project intact. And then they said, okay, you're just not going to have it released in Japan. And they said, okay, I guess we won't. For real? That's real. It is not coming out in Japan legally. Um, so I can't wait to see what that's all about. I cannot wait to see what that's all about. We'll be seeing on stream. I don't know if we'll be playing the entire thing on stream, but I do want to try it. And also because uh, my scared ass will absolutely want to um, take some time out and have some company. Because of this, uh, yeah, it's got to be the dismemberment beheadings. Like, Japan is really against uh, that specific type of violence. So, um, yeah, I guess we'll see. And also, De I, I love how Dead Space Remake comes out a month after. And it's like, oh my god, this is going to be awful. What game? Callisto Protocol. Which looks great, if you guys don't know. It's sci-fi horror. And uh, mm, what team were you in? I actually didn't play the recent Splatfest, hell yeah. I, uh, I was playing God of War, so I didn't get a chance. I would have been fire, though, which I know didn't win. <laughs> big man sweep, so I'm, I'm, I'm pumped for all the big man fans. You know what I could do when I kill these chews, chat? I could drink a potion to heal and then bottle it again. You know what? Maybe it won't fade away in time. Maybe I can do it. Hang on. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Let be quick, be quick, be quick. Oh, God, it's fading! It's fading! Oh, my God. No, wait, grab it. Grab it, grab it, grab it, grab it. <laughs> I got some water bobs. Yeah, these are, to those who don't know, these are choo-choos in this universe, in the Twilight Princess universe. So no faces and stuff this time. I got them. I got them. It's okay. Red shoe jelly. It's the same thing as a red potion. You see? All good. All I have to do is take damage, which uh, just it made everything redundant. So whatever. Purple jelly hurts you. So you don't want to drink this one. But I love them. I love, I just love jellies. This is actually Noma's currency on her stream. This is what, this is what you're spending, chat. This is what she's harvesting as currency. All right. Do you understand now? Do you, do you see your sins that you are committing? 
I would like you to know that I was watching one of your videos from like two years ago. Another segment in which you told us to check your Twitch. So I opened Twitch out of curiosity. And now here I am. Well, hell yeah. It's good to have you in here, man. And uh, I hope... Pa I, I, I'm glad that past me uh, pulled out for me. Which that doesn't sound right. <laughs> pulled through. Pulled through. Jesus Christ. <laughs> but yeah, thank you. I, I hope you enjoy your time here. And if not, hey, thanks for even swinging by. I very much appreciate that. Yo, Kelp, welcome back in. Hope you're doing well. Uh, what's popping? Not too much. We're in the uh, we're in the water temple, so I'm absolutely gonna get my ass severely lost. Yeah, she. <laughs> I'm sorry. I made it. I made it sound like I avoided like pregnancy or something. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Um, which I didn't. I have 11 kids. I'm also pregnant. Uh, whoa, that's treacherous. Why don't you think you ought to knock down those stalactites hanging off the ceiling first? Thanks. I'm glad you. I'm glad you told me how to solve a puzzle. Uh, they don't look to be very stable. I bet they break pretty easily if you hit them with enough force, don't you think? Oh, okay, you know what? Maybe it's a good thing she told me that. Because, uh, that's bomb arrows, isn't it? Hold up. ZL. There we go. I probably gotta do this. Oh! Maybe I'm just stupid. Maybe I did need Midna at all times. Whoops. Is that not... Oh, you gotta shoot the actual lumpuses? Alright. Pragment? Yeah, I'm, pr I'm, pr I'm pragmatic right now, unfortunately, chat. I'm gonna take a few uh, months off to take care of the kid. What are your kids' names? Uh, Blippus, Blorbo, Schmorbin, uh, Woodwood, uh, Skleeb, Svensson, um, Mario, Pl 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 Plibson, uh, E, 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 bub, 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 and, and lastly, how could I forget? How could I forget, chat? Scorn. <laughs> and, and hate. <laughs> How many goddamn children do you have? You know, it's, it, it, it's rough out here. It's rough out here. Let's just say that the, the whole entire next generation of humans... Or, or, or I guess my children now at this point. Uh, thank you for the gifts up to Skleeb. Skleeb. I'm glad that they uh, get, get a get a sub. That's great. And Plibson. How are... How are... What? <laughs> I'm so... How? How? I, I mean, I know you guys always find names on here, but all of, like, all of these goddamn made-up names you guys are still finding on this Twitch directory blows my mind. But thank you so much for the gift subs. I very much appreciate it. I, I'm, I'm not killing this little pig, man. I'm going to leave the little pig man alone. By the way, when you... Those pigs, the sounds they make sound like angry bunnies. They do sound like pigs sometimes. It's kind of amazing. Yo, Channel Knight. Thank you so much for the... Uh, the, the actual just... Not a resub or gift sub. Just a straight up sub. I appreciate that, dude. Hope you enjoy your time here and get that ad-free experience. Thank you so much. Um, do it left for five minutes. Yeah, uh, Shady. Shady has children now. Yeah. Also, all the Lumas count as my children, too. Because Rosalie is my wife. Scorn! <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for the gift sub too. Wait, I can do this. I can do this. Scorn. There we go. Yo, is that Noma? No, sorry, I thought it was a jellyfish. I thought Noma was here. This would be the Noma dungeon. Shout out to VTuber Miss uh, Google Chroma. All the children you have with Uwu. That is true. That is true. There is Apollo and Arya. Mm. Any children aren't even subscribed? Sad. I'm a bad father now, aren't I? <laughs> Style on them. Style on them. Why? 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 See, you see, why would I need to do that when my kids are so impressed by me pressing the A button at the right time to do that? You know what I'm saying? They just know I'm Pog, and that's all That's all I need. I'm a Pog pro gamer. That was definitely Noma. <laughs> I love... I love Rosalina. She's great. She's great. I don't know why I brought that up out of nowhere again. Nomo's actually omni omnipresent. That's not a good thing. I talk. I I, I we I, I do um, I do bully her when she's not around. So if she knows about that, it's not a good sign. <laughs> nice Germa reference. Did I make a Germa reference? Because I I didn't mean to. If I did, that's amazing. I actually speaking to Noma, I had to tell her who Germa was. She's like, I know, like I know he's like a person. I hear people talk about him, but like, well, like what what's up with Germa? So I like I told her about what makes Germa so amazing. Yo, Perella, thank you for the two months. Damn, you weren't lying. Not that I doubted you, by the way. I told, I definitely didn't doubt you. But also thinking, thank you so much for the resub. I very much appreciate that. And I hope you continue to enjoy your time here. Let's see. 
Um, okay, I don't got no fire, so that's not even for fire, is it? Scorn is a German reference. It is? <laughs> I said it because the game showed up in the Game Awards nominees. Amazing, though. God. I was about to say, imagine having a word be a streamer reference, but I was like, you know what? Literally, the, the word wood could be construed as like a meme here with Woodwood and Gummy Worm. If you hear Gummy Worm, like that's our dumb meme too, so... It, it, I, I see it. I see it. Streamers have too much power. Content creators. I'm still here, you know. Who? Who is that? Who are you? You seem neat, but I don't know. I don't exactly know who you are. Okay, I'm kidding. Hi. How you doing? I wasn't saying anything bad about you. Also, Noma, you should totally vote on um, on the Game Award stuff. And uh, for best role playing, you know, you know, you maybe, you know, after everything I told you about Xenoblade 3 and how the whole story uh, starts and ends, you know, maybe, maybe, you know, maybe you give it that vote. Maybe, maybe you give it that vote. It would also make me really happy. Are you playing this on the Wii or Wii 2 U edition? I am playing it on the Wii Woo, Wii Woo, Wii 2 edition. Um, this is a legal version though, by the way. Like, no, no bullshit. I bought this on release day. I have the Midna Amiibo. Um, but yeah. Okay, wait a minute. I, can I do anything here yet? I don't think I can. No, I think I know what I got to do. It's been a, it's been a long time, but I think I know what I got to do. Um, doubt? No, no doubt. No doubt. No doubt. Jello soup. You know what? You know what, Helia? I'm okay with that. Because truly, that is just juice. With like a little bit of, you know, a little, uh, just a little bit of powder. Some, there's some powder in there that does a little bit of trolling. It might coagulate in your stomach. It might not. It probably won't. It's probably fine to just eat jello powder. Um, so I'm all about that. You know what? You know what? Jello soup? I'm okay with that one. Because it's just juice. Disgusting wording, but it's fine. I'm about to get lost already, aren't I? And you're gonna vote for Plague Tale? I don't even think that was on there for best, like, JRPG. Oh, you mean Game of the Year? No, Game of the Year, do whatever you must. I just meant for best JRPG and best soundtrack. Best soundtrack, too. Alright, alright, okay, okay. You got the best soundtrack. Shitty, do you like pulp? I actually do. I do like pulp. For like orange juice and stuff. I I, I I used to hate it, but I don't know what it is now. I, I love slurping that down. Ice cream soup is just melted ice cream. Probably. I hate melted ice cream. If my bowl is full of it, I won't eat it. I genuinely do not like it. Too mushy and weird and gross. I know, I know how picky that sounds. I know some people in chat are going to be like, you what? Because there's a lot of new people in here. I genuinely hate soup and like liquidy foods and mushy foods. Or like foods that are too mushy. Oh boy. Oh boy. All right, welcome back, chicken Oh, free at last. Gracious, you're that nice fellow who helped me out the other day. How nice to see you again. Well, now that we found each other again, let's stick together for a bit. Hmm? No! Go away! I'll be right with you, so if you want to warp out, just let me know. No! No more Uku, please! It has titties. Wait, I... <laughs> I blurped that out so wrong! I bleeped that out so wrong. <laughs> <laughs> it was not perfect. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm actually gonna die. <laughs> That's like the entire word. You think my music should have better timing than that? Yeah, I know. I know. Oh my god. <laughs> oh man, I'm so sorry, chat. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. All right, let me get let me get back to video games. It's very very cringe, I know, but we got to play video games now. So wait, what am I doing here? I uh, uh, can you believe? I, listen, I'm sorry. It's because I just woke up from a nap. I, I I am fully blaming it on that, but truly, I already am lost. Hang on. No, I think I know what I got to do. I think I know what I got to do. Um, if I lower that side, because there's there's gates blocking, right? So if I go down through that way, it'd be a new path, P possibly. Ah, shit. Wait, no, wait. Hang on. This is this might actually be good, unless this is the intro. Do you think Oku feels cold no matter where she is? I don't want to think about Uku feeling cold for very, very... We've been here for very specific reasons. Uku feeling cold is something I, I genuinely do not want to experience uh, seeing. And you all know why. 
Okay, I think I know what I gotta do. I think I know what I gotta do. Sorry about that. Let's try this now. I stayed in the school gym where uh, the other people turned to jelly and I babysat them all. Where other people- wait, what? Oh, like in terms of like just like being like healthy and like running around and shit? Okay, so we, we've been through both of these, correct? So if I spin this and go back upstairs, this should do something for me, yeah? So let's do that. How can Uku be cold when she's nice and warm in your pocket? Good point. And her son, whom I, uh, I'm afraid of. Eight specific reasons. I like how you have to g even give me the number of the t***s. There you go. You see, I did it right this time. All right? Okay? Be proud of me, goddammit. Okay, so... Now we can spin it this way if we want, which would lead to even newer shit downstairs, correct? Correct, I think. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, no. I think I'm doing this correct now, chat. Definitely. Have three proud points. <laughs> always living for the proudness. I'm always all about that proudness. If you're cold, they're cold. Let Uku inside. <laughs> are we... Oh, oh my god, are we talking... Oh my god, no. Baby jellies. And baby jellies. You should call that... You should, you should call your chat a bunch of little baby jellies. Which would be a cute thing, because they're all lovely. Yes, give me that treasure time. Let's go. Be a key. Be a key. Come on. Come on. What do you mean there's 16? There's not 16 of them. You lie. You lie. Is there a handle on the back of this map? Oh, it's so you can wrap it. That's cool. It's leather. All right. All right. I think we're doing it. I think we're doing good now. I don't. I was gone for the past few streams. Tell me why. What with the number? Pigman! Little pig boy. Helmerock. I love him. I love him so much. He's a little bastard, though. Nope, gotcha. Ah, oh, goddammit. Hang on, hang on. I'm gonna get him. I'm gonna get him. God, little squinker. Oh, wait. I have a roll move. Let me just... Hang on. Let me... Let me just... No, but Link, please. Okay, maybe he's too small. I... He doesn't have enough circumference. I roll around him too fast. He is small. I want this man as a Pokemon. Anyways... The reason I did that, chat, is they are a, uh, they are a problem. Like, a, they're an invasive species, and I have to take them out. But also, I needed practice, just in case. There's 32. All right, now, y listen. You all listen here, you little shits. <laughs> I know, I know when you're playing me. I know when you're playing me. R really? Yeah, that's my own fault. Okay. Good there. Good there. Um, that's basically Laron. Is that a Pokemon? I don't know enough Pokemon. I'm kind of lame. I'm only now getting, like, back into the series a lot since uh, Arceus. So I'm, like, super pumped. And, like, to see that um, uh, Scarlet and Violet kind of play like Arceus makes me happy. How's that little guy invasive? He was just vibing in a temple. Exactly. Now you might be saying, why did you just say exactly? Well, here's why. You understand? Gla I'm glad. I'm glad. There's 64. How many? What kind of? Why do you guys just want a booby monster chat? I, I I don't put it past. I don't put it past some things after things the chat have said in here. But w why? Sometimes sometimes more isn't better chat. Sometimes it truly is the quality over the quantity. You know what I'm saying? Shaylee is a, Sh Shaylee. I called. I just called myself Shaylee. Shady has incredible uh, rhetorical abilities. It's true. I'm, I am fantastic. I get you thinking. I am deep and with it, and brooding. Is Shady gonna need to start speaking in bleep so he doesn't miss a word? <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna have to start making sure. Let's see. Um. Yeah, that's a bad idea. Um. Let's see. Also, to those who don't know. Tektites are my worst enemy in every Zelda game. This is the first time I've been able to fight them so well, but I always get hit by Tektites in every Zelda game for some reason. I can just never figure out their pattern, even though it's literally just hopping towards you. Um, so they used to be a hot meme back in the day. Shady in a gender-bent universe. Shaylee Cicada. Is, is that what we're going with? Um, I always said... <laughs> That I would call, I, I always said if I was like, you know, let's say I had like a wife or something, they'd be Lady Cicada. But also, anyone, you know, it, it's obvious. 
I already know that person wouldn't be happy with it. Like, no, n anyone I call Lady Cicada will not be happy with it. But, it's kind of great, isn't it? Isn't it? Isn't it? It's kind of dope. It's kind of hilarious, isn't it? Anyways, what am, I, what am I doing in this room? I gotta get to one of these. Do I have, like, a floating thing? I don't have, like, a floating thing. I mean, I could carry it if I, if, if only Uku would be here and just, like, let, like, just, like, let, just let me be carried. It looks like I gotta fill the water here. I gotta, I gotta send the water path. I did get a key, so we can, we can leave with the key. I can be your lady cicada. Yeah? Yeah, chat? Milady cicada? Oh my god. Milady. Yeah, I'm not married. Except for, except for with Rosalina, of course. But other than that, I'm not married, chat, so, you know. What about the gay shady husband? If I was gay and I had a husband, what would their name be? Well, I mean, I... <laughs> I... I... Would it... Uh, my brain literally said gay D cicada. And I'm like, I don't think... I don't think they... I don't think they... You know what? They probably would. They probably would be like, yeah, that, that sound that, that works. But no. No. What would it be? <laughs> yeah, everyone's saying it anyway. <laughs> Segata <Cicada>? chat. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Mm! Their name would be Prince Sidon. <laughs> yeah, chat. I guess since I do uh since I do have a crush on Mifa. I guess if I was into uh, if I wasn't to the same gender, I suppose it would translate over, wouldn't it? It would only make sense. I'd still be made fun of for, um, liking a fish person. Yo, Snorks with the 16 months. I gave you a shout out earlier, by the way, because for a uh, racing game, for video game award nominees, I don't play racing games, so I gave it the fours. <laughs> and I was like, shout out to Snorks. This one's for him. <laughs> How you doing, bud? It's good to see you back. Hope you're doing well. Thank you for the 16-month resub. I very much appreciate that. Very much appreciate you, and I hope you have been well. And if not, I hope this stream is very pod for you. There we go. I'm actually, I'm kind of glad Minda told me about that fact, because I honestly would have forgotten to do this. I'm almost sure I got stuck in this temple more than once in the past, be solely because I forgot I could bomb those things. All right, let's get you moving. Thought of a good name, but you can't say it on Twitch. That's pretty bad, yeah. Yeah, if you can't say it, uh, I'd probably not say it. <laughs> Which I know you aren't. Uh, what do you mean, uh, Gran Turismo? Forza wasn't nominated last time I checked. Oh yeah, Gran Turismo. You see, that's how that's how much I know. Uh, that's how much I know racing games. That one, that one. Hope you're doing good. I'm actually doing great, dude. I actually got my um, I got my website by the way. I finally have Shady Cicada is now a domain name that I own. Thank God. Um, and I could finally get the merch and stuff going. So I'm, I'm really pumped. And the VOD channel is going to be going soon because I'm going to be taking a big holiday break uh, from commissions. Uh, I told a lot of my clients I'll be starting back up in January. So uh, there's a lot going on. Um, also, also, I wanted to mention this. I have to get the right date because I kind of forgot it. But one of the games I worked on, uh, I made like a few songs for it. Like a, like a small, small handful for this one. But it's I still have music in it. Uh, it's coming out this December, like December 13th or something, I think. It's one of those dates. And uh, it's coming It's coming to consoles. It's coming to uh, Switch, uh, PlayStation, Xbox, PC, all of that. So you, you'll you be able to hear my music on a Switch uh, in December, technically speaking. Which is really cool. Which is really, really cool. That is a bucket list thing for me. And it's a really cool looking game. It's called Infinite Guitars. It's an RPG, but it's like a rhythm-based RPG, uh, turn-based. And it's all like hand-drawn stuff as well. Um, and this, as soon as I saw it, I was like, yeah, when they when they when they emailed me and they were like, yo, would you like to uh, would you like to do some songs for it? As soon as, as soon as I was like, yeah, absolutely. I want to do some for it. There's other there's other musicians on that, too. I just don't really I only know like a few of them, but I know there were some other guest musicians on there. Um, Consider it purchased. Oh, dude, I really appreciate that. Once again, you guys, and I'm, you know, you guys don't even have to do that. You know what I mean? Um, it's more so just me announcing it. But if, if you absolutely like how the game looks and you play it, not just because I worked on it, but because maybe, you know, it looks cool and you know you're going to enjoy it. Because, of course, that is the number one thing I want. I don't want to force people to do anything or try to. Uh, then absolutely go for it. Because, honestly, the dev or devs. 
Um, they're, they're, they're honestly fantastic people, and they were super friendly and amazing. That dude just died. He literally... How, why? What is happening? He died inside of the platform. I... What is going on here? I... Huh? He just got shot out by the gear! What? I've never seen that in my entire life. Every time I stream a game, every time I stream a game, stuff like that happens. It's unbelievable. My god. But, wow, great. Good stuff. I'm glad, I'm glad we got to witness that. Gee, wow. Um, also, yes, Noma, you are correct, by the way. Uh, my song is in their trailer. Yeah, one of them. It was so good that they asked me to do... Or not so... They, they liked it enough where they were like, Hey, you want to do some more music for this? And I did. I, I'm not going to say what I made the music for, but it's music I haven't shown you guys at all. Not even a preview of. So you get brand new music from me that I'm very happy about. Yo, Web, welcome back. Uh, welcome back, Mr. Cicada. Hope everything has been well. This is truly a greater birthday seeing you back streaming. Is it your birthday today, Traveling Web? Okay, hang on. Well, first of all, thank you for the resub. I hope you very much enjoy your time here as always. And, and let me, let me give you, hang on. You got a shitty happy birthday from me. Hang on. The classic shitty happy birthday. There's a little, there's a little plushy red bird on my, um, on my tuning knob for my guitar. He just chills there for Christmas. All right, here you go. You ready? For Traveling Web. And yes, I do play it bad on purpose. Uh, uh, uh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. <gasps> Where's it going? Where's it going? You know what you know where it's going. <laughs> oh god, please. Without a pick. There you go. Happy birthday, traveling web. You are lovely. You are uh, very wholesome and cool, and your art and your your whole art style brings me great happiness as well. So I hope you uh, have the loveliest of birthdays and get that fat, thick cake. And of course, we are talking about the actual food cake. But there you go. Thank. Uh, good. Happy birthday. Um, but yes, yeah, yeah, my tra- my- my music is in one of the trailers, or more- In their main reveal trailer, uh, most of the music in it is from my song, or one of my songs. Which I was very honored to see. Um, but, uh, some other updates that some of you may or may not know about, since I'm just talking about all these things going on, because I guess I'm really excited. Um, one of my songs is in a horror movie. Uh, I was asked forever ago by the team to, uh, if they could license one of my really old songs, like really old songs from like 2014 or 2015, I think, um, to be used for a bit in their horror movie. And then I got an email back a year later, so a few weeks ago, and they were like, hey, uh, it's in, like, it's in the movie now. Uh, hope you get a chance to, like, check it out. And they are, like, waiting for my impression, so I do want to have, maybe our movie night could be that. Um, it's the horror movie. It's, it's actually has discussion threads on Reddit and shit. And like, it's got like an 80% on like Rotten Tomatoes, I think. On IMDb, it's like a 6.5. So it seems like it's, you know, it depends on the person or whatever. Either way, I'm looking forward to like seeing it. Um, it's called Deadstream. Um, and apparently my song's in there somewhere in the intro. But it's Deadstream. I, I think it's literally like a live Twitch streamer whose career- What is that? Oh. Oh my god, this is- wait, a bug and a jelly? This is me and Noma fusing. But like in- like if Noma and I were like absolute like- uh, like awful gremlin people, this is what would happen. This is our mech. I'm leaving by the way, I don't even think I could kill him right now. So I'm just gonna- I'm just gonna- yep, yeah, I'm out. But yeah, it, it's like- it's like a dude who like- I think he gets like half cancelled because he was a shitty prankster, which- uh, hilarious. Um, but he's trying to get his career back by doing these live streams by going like haunted areas. So it's kind of like a found footage-ish movie mixed with like, you know, a fake chat on the side and stuff. But then it gets like, uh, it gets even more horror-y and like fictional looking. Why is bug mean? I don't know why this bug hates me. Do I have a key? Oh, I do. I can just go through here. Um, but yeah. <laughs> Can't be this stream. This stream is vibing. Absolutely. We ain't dead here. 
we ain't dead here. To me, a dead stream is if there's literally no one at all talking ever. And even then, I'm still keeping it alive, you know what I'm saying? But you know. Anyways, I'm gonna need some health soon. We're gonna have to find some red shoes again. Angry Cicada. Not that genre. I actually love found footage uh, horror. It is one of my favorite things. And for some reason, it doesn't make me motion sick. I don't understand how. As someone who gets motion sick pretty easily. But yeah, so that's all going on. I have a lot of bucket list things this year. Had a song in a movie. Had, uh, there's a game coming out. One of the games I'm working on is finally coming out. Um, uh, website stuff, hopefully. Merch stuff, hopefully. VOD channel. I keep thinking I didn't do a lot this year, but I, I feel like I did a lot more than last year. So I'm pretty happy with that. Are we still in the water temple? Pretty much just starting. Um, in case you're sad about missing anything. If, if you're, if you wanted to miss things, you're, you're out of luck. <laughs> well, welcome back in, Yeshua. Hope you're doing well. Speak for yourself. You don't know if I'm dead or not. I feel like you're alive. There was a lot of life in your voice when I heard you, at least, during those, uh, during those game nights at DJ stream. <laughs> last year doesn't count. Yeah, last, yeah, honestly, like, the COVID years, they don't count. We, we skip those. Infinite Guitars, we should have wish listed on Steam. Yeah, that's the name. Uh, Infinite Guitars. I believe it's December 13th or the 11th. I really don't remember. <laughs> I know I'm going to be picking it up too. Be solely because I genuinely actually want to play it. Um, it's just a game I would have played in the first place. So we will see how it is. Great. Can't get that right now. Um, let's see. I, I forgot how cool the song is here. There's not a lot of song happening. But the brr, 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 with that weird synth sounds really, really cool. Okay, what? I could jump down to um, there, right? No, I, I, that's definitely not the way to do it, but we could try. I'm sorry, Link. Where are you, why are you diving into concrete, homie? Are you good? I know you're wearing the swimsuit, but it doesn't mean you gotta, like, you know, swim. <laughs> this man. Will you stream infinite guitars? Maybe. I was considering at least, at least streaming, like, the first few, like, like, the first part of it. I would love to try. Grab it. You better. He's not going to grab it. He's not going to grab it. God damn it, Link. God, you little bastard. I got to fill this place somehow, don't I? Okay. Well, I, I mean, I put a key in here for a reason, right? It's like there has to be something I can do. Yeah. Water temple. Everyone's favorite. Yeah. Everyone's favorite Aussie, man. Yeah. 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 Okay, abso absolutely. Absolutely. I'm definitely not going to mold over this in a few, uh, in a few minutes. No, I won't mold. I won't mold. Am I the type of person to mold chat? No, come on. You've never seen me get irritated or angry over stuff ever. Come on. Ever. It's got to be an amazing feeling having music in a Switch game. Yeah, it's... it's it, 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 honestly, it... it the, the excite... I think I still don't fully believe it. I don't think I will until it, like, actually is out and happens. But it's... it's Yeah, it, it's sure, like, 100% a big deal for me. And, um... I'm very happy to see so many people, you know, supporting me over it too. So I'm, thank you all for, um, <laughs> thank you all for being just great people who always root, uh, root for me. A lot of this is thanks to you. I mean, these people would have never found me if you guys didn't give me a chance and give me the level of quote unquote popularity that I have now, you know? Like, of course, yes, I put the hard work into the music and everything, but that doesn't mean, you know, nobody could have ever seen it. You know what I'm saying? So thanks for helping people see it. There's ladders right here. I'm an idiot. Here we go. A reminder that his entire di diet is jelly and soup. He doesn't need those things. Who, Link? Actually, no, you're right. <laughs> this homie's a jelly soup haver. Yo, Chim Chim. Oh, shit. Welcome back. Hope you're doing well. Oh, my God. Welcome back. Hope you're doing well. And thank you so much for the resub. Almost a whole year of Chim Chim content. I don't know why I said Chim. You know what? I have been We have been getting Chim Chim content in the past, though. You do amazing things in the art uh, section. So thank you so much for that and being here you're very lovely and i hope you continue to enjoy link only eats soup no he better eat more god damn it listen I, I i love link all right he's great he's one of my favorite video game characters ever I, I think he is all right actually no that's shulk shulk is my favorite video game character ever but still i want to have things in common with him that isn't just he's left-handed or used to be all right okay he, he better eat more than just that could not go to dinner with Link. It would only be soup and rocks. He would eat rocks. You know what's funny, though? I tried to. I, I've literally told chat I've seen delicious looking rocks before. I mean, I know better than to eat it, but I want to. Oh, shit. Wait, it's time. I can get my health right here. 
Can you bomb the water bug? I don't think so. I, I like, so if there's one thing I do remember about this game, it's how to kill that dude. And I don't recall. Don't bottle the water, idiot! Oh no, it, it died on water. This is gonna be a problem. Scoop, 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 scoop. There we go. <laughs> sorry, Link, sorry. You legit, uh, you could get, you legit could get chocolate rocks. That's true. <gasps> oh, I have Reese's Pieces in my, in my kitchen. I've been eating so many of it though. I've eaten like, I've eaten like 20 in one day, but chat, but chat. Okay, it wasn't 20. I'm, I'm prone to hyperbole, but still. Do I get more? Nah, maybe not. Nah, nah, nah. I mean, I could spoil myself. It's a celebration night, but still. Nah, nah, it's not. Nah, nah, too much. Time to snack? Mm. I don't know. I do have kiwis. Maybe I'll just stay healthy and have my little kiwis. How's it going? It's going great, Sanj. Hope you're doing well, man. I, um, I was just telling chat that one of the games I made music for is finally, uh, oh shit. It's finally coming out uh, in December. And I have a song in a horror movie and some other shit. My, I finally have ShadyCicada.com. So I'll finally be making a merch site and everything with that and other things on there too. Um, so yeah. Maybe if you really want. Yeah, maybe I could. Maybe a little bit. Stay healthy. It's true. I, I've been, I started working out again. It'd be, so I'll, I'll keep my diet going. I want to start my birthday off with subscribing to you again. I hope you have an amazing night. I'm sorry. Two birthdays tonight? From two lovely people who are both creative? I'm sorry. We got two birthdays? Does that mean we need another one? Are we going to? Yep. One second. One second. Here you go. You have a song in a horror movie. When did that happen? Wait, Deb, did I not tell you about this? It's called Deadstream. They asked me, they, they asked to license out one of my songs like a year ago. A really old song of mine, like super old, uh, but it's in there. And uh, it's getting some pretty good ratings and it's had discussions on uh, Reddit and stuff. And uh, it looks like people are enjoying it for what it is, whether it's fun or, sh you know, actually spooky. Anyways, here you go. Here you go. All right, crappy bird. I'm going to make this one faster. This one, you, you got a speedy one. No, no, I'm using no pick for this. But here, for Cheem Cheem. All right. Ooh. Now, can I tremolo pick with my finger? Let's see. Can't go too fast with my finger, but... All right. <laughs> can I... Uh, it's sore through my finger. Ugh. No, screw that. Screw that. Oh my god. Oh, ow. Owie. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Hang on. Hang on. You can hear my finger? <laughs> I had to learn how to use it with my finger, because I used to drop my pick a lot when I played live, so I learned how to sweet pick with my finger, too, a little bit. Uh... I'm, I'm too rusty right now. There you go. A little bit through the fire and flames too. Oh, wait, right, right. Uh. There you go. There's a shitty happy birthday just for you, Chim Chim. Happy birthday. Oh my God. Okay. All right, we're going back. We're going back. We're going back. Hang on. Wait, that's not happy birthday? It, it is. It is where I'm from. Happy birthday is absolutely through the fire and flames. Best birthday ever. Uh, I'm glad. I'm glad. I'm glad to hear. You don't got to thank me for nothing. Thank you for being here, Chim Chim. You're a lovely person here. You literally always have something incredibly nice to say to me. And um, you mad. You mad deserve it. You're very lovely. Can I just jump down there? Do we even need to be here anymore? Let me let me look just in case. I don't think I do, but the fire and flames are the candles on the birthday cake. It's true. It's true, the song is actually about the breath you take when you blow out the candles. Because through the fire and flames, it carries on. You know, that breath continues. <laughs> that breath be breathing. But yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, actually, Depp, my, our first movie night on Discord is probably going to be that movie. If you want to if you want to join in on that, I'll, I'll, I'll hopefully announce when. But I think it only plays for like a few seconds, but it's still in there. It's still in there. We can be like, oh my god. For the record, the song is called SRX, like a really old song of mine. But, um, it is in there. But apparently, from what I got, I, I might be wrong, but I think it's a found footage movie. But it's a streamer going doing IRL streams in, like, creepy places. And, it like, it sounds fun for what it is. Okay. Um, so we got the stairs and everything now, which is good. Let's go check out the chandelier shit. Link, I don't know how he does that without breaking his goddamn fingers, but you know what? Respect. Respect, homie. 
Listen to XRX early today. Good song. Yo, I'm glad you liked it. Um, oh yeah, there's your Discord link, by the way. Thank you for doing that so I can name the name. Um, I'm glad you guys like SRX. It was literally a birthday present for one of my friends. So, um, I still haven't told him yet, but I think he'll be happy to know too. Like, the SR, um, actually has to do with him. Because he's also just, he's a really, he's one of the most supportive friends I've ever had. I mean, all of my friends are lovely and supportive and amazing. Um, he's great though. He's, he's like <laughs> three years older than me, and for that I just, I call him Grandpa. But man, nah, he's, he's absolutely just a fantastic human. Shoutouts to Ramiz, you're great, dude. Okay, let's see. Hell yeah, hell yeah, hell yeah. Oh, baby, give me more of that, give me more of that. Finally got up to 10k channel points after spending it on Luigi's Mansion. Oh, hell yeah. Good, good, build it back up. Build it back up, Toby, because... Uh, crowd control streams happen, what, once every, like, three months now? At least that's what I'm going for. So we'll be, we'll be back on that. Next year, probably. Unless something, you know, new comes out I really want to do. Yo, Frosty! Thank you so much for the resub, dude. I very much appreciate it. In just over half a year. Hell yeah. Hope you're going to enjoy your time here and the ad-free experience. Crazy, I know. And Jam, and have yourself a damn good night. Thank you for the raid. And uh, enjoy my second fave. My second fave, too. Um, I will. You know I will. Have yourself a damn good one, dude. Thank you for the raid again. I was over 100k before that stream. It's honestly, like, it's so funny that we always have memes and jokes about how, like, we we never spend these points on anything. I don't have any awards. And then we finally, like, just use it all on one stream. I'm happy about it. I'm happy. I'm, I'm savvy. I'm savvy for that kind of chaos. So, what exactly am I doing here again? What do I, what, what am I, what am I doing? Let me see. I don't know if I checked all the rooms proper. Um, yo, Morley, how you doing? Welcome in. Hope you're doing well. Good to see you as always. Oh, I got the key. I got the key. I got the key. Hell yeah. Saving up the points is nice. Yeah, it's cool to just have that good old nice number. And then one day you know it's going to be used for something. Alright, let's see what we're dealing with. Yo, it's Noma! Hello, uh, VTuber Miss Noma. How are you doing? Oh, leave me alone! Oh god. Oh god, it's actually like Noma. <laughs> it's straight to bullying. Straight to bullying. Great. Great. It's time. Oh, is it time for guessing? Are we close to a mini boss? Sanj. Did you just do it before we did the guessing game? Did you say what it was? I can't believe this. That's five years in jail. I, I can't believe you would do this. It's okay. It's okay. No, 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 no. No, Sanj, it's okay. We usually guess what the main boss is. So I'm just messing with you. We, we hardly ever guess the mini-boss. I don't know when the mini-boss is coming up. I don't know when he's coming up. Actual jail? <laughs> yeah, you know what? Never mind. Let's put him in jail anyways. Nah, you're good. You're good. We, we guess what the boss is. And no, I'll tell you guys now, the boss is not VTuber Miss Noma. Well, well after we do the mini-boss, we'll do the guessing game and see. Also, Link's outfit... Like, when he has the mask part on for this, it, this outfit looks amazing. With the, with the iron boots, too. I love this look. Oh, God. Off the boss jail. <laughs> for being a boss. Is Frogbert thirsty? I think he's hungry for worms. Sanji's going to throw Shady in the dungeon. It's true. I don't even have one of those. But I'm going to do it. I feel like there's a lot of streamers I know now that have the quote-unquote basement slash dungeon. And people are always locked in it. Just got my second book set up to go on pre-sale. Yo, really, Marley? That's a big deal. Congrats. Hell yeah. We're all about people releasing their art out there. And I hope everything goes amazingly. Very, uh, very, very, very good news. Big congrats. Oh, God. Well, do we really? We don't got to look up. There's nothing up there, chat. Come on. Come on. Oh my <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry, rip it. This thing's music is amazing by the way. It sounds like you're fighting like an evil chef. As far as I remember. Let's do it. Weaponized babies once again. Never mind. This is this does not remind me of a chef. I might have been wrong. Oh my god, no. 
Too many babies. Do I even need to fight the babies? Or am I just killing babies for fun? Oh god, wait. I, I forgot I can't get my health back. Okay, what do I do with you? What do I do with you? Tail? No? Hmm. Uh, I'll figure this out. I'll figure this out. What do you mean, sexy froggy? What do you mean it gives up to sexy froggy, chat? Explain. Explain that part for me. Okay, I do have to kill the babies. But also, thank you for the gift sub. I very much appreciate it. Blip! No. Nope. Alright. It's just tongue, huh? I'm not killing the babies for fun, I swear. I swear. I swear. I don't even know why I said for fun. For glory is what I meant. Alright. I walk in here about about killing babies for fun. No. What a t why do I- Whenever I say the worst things, that's when people join. Oh, no. But welcome. Hope you're doing well, foolish. <laughs> Oh, oh god. This is not good on hero. Link, do the spin. Do the spin, do the spin. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Bombarded by babies. Babe barded. Bomb babied. This is not looking good for me. Rule of three is not gonna happen here without me dying. Okay. No, come on, Link, please get in there. Get in there, Link. Oh my god, Link, you idiot. Link. Oh my god, what are you slashing? What are you doing? Oh boy, I'm dead. Um, what do you mean, frog mommy? Um, what do you mean? What, what do you mean? I mean, you know what? Don't tell me. I never want to know. Chat, I, I just put a bomb down. I just remembered. A bomb barded, chat. It was, the answer was here the whole time. Oh god, wait, hurry up, hurry up. I put that bomb down too early. <laughs> Thank you for the gift sub to, what do you mean, frommy? What do you mean, a gift sub to frommy? Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. It's, it's, it's Toho. You guys say I never played Toho. Look at me now. Look at me now. Wait, what? Chat, when did I take damage? Why is my fairy here? Did anyone see me die? I don't know what happened. How many frog? Okay, no. No. Chat. What, what, is, what is the matter with all of you? Oh, God. Stop. But also, don't. This is amazing. But also, thank you so much. But also, I hate you all. I am a frog butt. I like that one a lot. I am a frog butt is a good one. But also, oh my god. Fr I, I gotta say, Frommy is killing me. I I, I don't think any <laughs> anything could be Frommy for me. Jesus. Why is this? Why am I having such a hard time with this? I'm genuinely surprised. There we go. That's all I wanted to do. The controller would just not let me do that. <laughs> Oh god, okay, okay. Start from the bottom now, we're here, we doing it. Filth? <laughs> Filth? <laughs> Frog I light? Yeah, really? Really? How do you guys even come up with this shit? What did you spit? Oh, ew. Stomach contents, I'm good. God damn, that's a good one too. Filth and Frommy are amazing. Oh my god. Well, thank you for- uh, I'm surprised, honestly, if the boost train didn't happen earlier, you guys would have started a boost train off of frog names. Absolutely disgusting. I'm so disappointed in all of you, but you know what? I love all of you at the, at the same time. <laughs> good, good, good show, chat. Absolutely good show. Thanks for ruining my childhood. I don't even know how you did that. Because, like, I, you know... My child had nothing to do with frogs, but you, you managed it, chat. You managed it. Chain shot. Yeah, this, by the way, the claw shot here, I like it more than the hook shot. Yeah, that's right. I'm, I'm saying it now because you can hang from shit like this. This is my favorite, one of my favorite Zelda items of all time. It is very pod. And yes, it is also in Skyward Sword. Might even be the same one. Um, but I love it. I love it. Anyways. That was awful. Shall we move on? Claw shot superior. Yeah, exa exactly. Exactly. I feel you. I feel you want it. I wish Shady was real and drank milk. I have good and bad news for you. But I'm not going to tell you either. Look at all this goddamn money. I hope a fairy's in one of these. That would be really cool. Need this IRL for high shelves? I'm saying... I need this to get around my city, so people can, like, be really scared. But if they're scared, they'll leave me alone, correct? And oh my god, there are some people in Toronto I wish would leave me alone. Hookshot stick to anything wood? Yeah, well... It... Yeah? Well, guess what? 
You're a you're a goddamn tree. How about that, huh? Huh? Speaking of wood. Yeah, I bet that hurts. I bet that hurts. I bet your whole day is ruined now. Tempest has some of the best items in the series and also the spinner. I'm not even gonna lie, I unironically un un love the spinner. I think I love it because it's so stupid. <laughs> but you're right, it does have some of the best items in the entire series. I agree with that as well. I want to style on the pigs when I kill them, the Helmer rocks, but I, I, I can't. Helmosaurs? I think there's a Helmosaurs, right? I could be wrong. I'm about to give them Helmosaurs, if you know what I mean. Boom! Bam! Boom! Dead. Alright. Spinners goaded. Spinners go. I'm not- you know what? I'm gonna leave it vague for now, but yes. To those who don't know what, what we're talking about when we say spinner, uh, just be- be prepared for something later in this playthrough. Because you probably don't fully know what it means by spinner yet. You, you probably, like, you're like, okay, it's a spinner. But, like, how does it work? What does it do? How does it spin spun? You'll see. Okay, I feel like this has to fill up more. And no, it doesn't. We could probably just jump to it. Or, um, jump to it, right? Helmarox or the burbs? Yeah, like the Helmarok king. Oh, God, tech tights. No, God, leave me alone. Was Breath of the Wild the first game without a hook shot? No, there's a few without hook shots in it. Actually... Oh shit. Okay, it it's the first 3D Zelda without a hookshot. Yes. Thank you for the face, Sanj. I was waiting for it. The tech tights are here. You had to do it. You had to do it. Oh. Um But yeah, it's the first like 3D Zelda without like a a thing shot of any kind. Yeah. Should Daddy do the spinny? I <laughs> I'm banning you all. I'm banning you. I'm banning you it all. It's a thing from Hyrule Warriors. Did did Hyrule Warriors have the goddamn spinner in it? I don't remember, but if it did, then yes. Oh, in fact, a lot of cool items in Hyrule Warriors actually do come from this game. Or at least some of them. There's another there's another Twilight Princess weapon in there that is really good when Link uses it. Or, I mean, Link can only use it. Only Link, but you know, still. Shadaniel, please. Shadaniel's a good one. I like that one. I don't like filth. I'm still thinking about filth. Y'all, y'all really, y'all really just like said that word. Y'all just say words, you know? Yeah, we ain't sticking to that. I think it wasn't Hyrule Warriors. That's amazing. No! Thin's fire! Okay, let's figure out what we gotta do. Do we have a key? We don't have a key. All the 2D games don't have the hook shot. No, that's wrong. Uh, some actually do have the hook shot. I can't remember which one it is. I know it's one of the Game Boy ones before Game Boy Advance, but one of them actually does have a hook shot. It might have even been Awakening. I could be wrong about that. One of them even had a hook shot that let you swap spots with things. Um, so there were a few. Link to the Past does. Well, there you go. Link to the Past as well does. So, yeah. Breath of the Wild really is an outlier in that sense. In a big way. Yeah, it was, it was Link's Awakening that I'm thinking of, right? Yeah, okay. Switch hook was found in Oracle of Ages. That's where you swap spots with objects, right? I love that one. For puzzle solving, that was such a cool uh, concept. Which, hilariously, I want to see that work in 3D because it would look very funny. Switch hook was goaded? Absolutely. I think you, you, like, the way you kill, you have to kill a boss with it, right? Like, you, it, like specifically, like, you had to use that, right? I think it was, it was hilarious. <laughs> Switch hook was so cool. Absolutely. We still got to do Ages, by the way. We've streamed almost every Zelda game. We did get a bit through Ages, but I got busy and forgot to stream it. So we're probably going to restart that at some point. Um, but we're getting close to streaming every Zelda game. Kinda. Sorta. Oh, we never beat Phantom Hourglass as well. God damn it. Schedule was not helping me at that time. Okay, we can move the water. Okay, I see what we can do. We have to get over there, though. No walls? No walls blocking? Gangster. Let's go. I think the hookshot rage is because of the parry ladder. They they actually did say that they, they at one point they did have the hookshot planned, but it just didn't work out like game design wise. Um and honestly I I kinda get it. It would have made this whole traversal. I will say in the sequel, maybe it would be cool to have it. Maybe you can make it a rune thing so it has like a cooldown time when you use it. Um I wouldn't mind having it in the sequel. If it's used tastefully and doesn't ruin the whole exploration feel, which I don't think it will. If they do it right. And I mean, I fully trust the Zelda team because they're absolutely fantastic at what they're doing. Breath of the Wild is my favorite game ever. So, 
Um, plus, it would work. It would work so funny thematically with him having that ghost arm because he could like maybe use that ghost arm and it like just extend it out to like latch onto something, you know? Yeah, it was a scrapped idea in Breath of the Wild. Yeah, that was one of the things they were planning uh, pretty early on. That and the whole futuristic vibe with aliens invading Hyrule and shit, which is wild. They still have an actual like, um, they have a uh, a CG trailer of that. Like, CG footage of that. Like, a concept. And it was, like, Link running past this, like, weird alien tower thing that was shooting at him or something. I can't remember now. It was neat, though. There we go. Stretchy arm pause. I'm saying. Yeah, Bionic Commando Link, except it's not his wife this time. But, I mean, the arm could be someone. The arm has to be someone super important. Like, there's no way, but, like, who? Someone we know? A brand new character? Who knows? I would still love if it's a whole past hero thing, but we'll, we'll see. We'll see. There's there's really no telling with that, especially how the arm is so gangly now. For all we know, the arm is the evil thing. And and it was using Ganondorf as a pawn or something. Or it wanted to keep Ganondorf as a power source because maybe they ran shit off Malice. I don't know. There's like a million theories out there, but I'm, I'm pumped. I'm still, like, I'm still slightly sketched out by the whole plot that they should, like, the plot that they implied a little bit in the first trailer. It makes me think there's going to be more to it. Which, I mean, there always is, but you'll, we'll see. Zelda became Link's arm. It, that would be that would be so wild, but I think the arm is there as Zelda's still kind of there. At least from the trailer, but the trailer could be so, like, not trustworthy. Oh my god, I'm running out of life really quick. Tears of the Kingdom is a wild thing to say, because Tears of the Kingdom could, be, could mean... Uh, it could mean Hyrule. It could mean Hyrule of the past. To, like, maybe it's like, you know... Something happened, the kingdom's not happy about it. Or it could be Hyrule now. Something happens during the beginning of the plot that makes Hyrule absolutely a hellscape. We don't know yet. We don't know yet. I mean, Hyrule's already a hellscape in Breath of the Wild, but... I'm, I'm excited to see where it goes. Or what that name implies. Because they said it's a spoiler name. And for real, has anyone figured out what that even means? Has anyone, like, figured it out through, like, theory videos? I've, I'm, I'm a bit behind on, like, big theory videos from, like, Zeltic and all that, but... Um... That doesn't really give us anything, does it? Tears of the Kingdom? Because they, they were scared to put out that name. Unless they changed it, but I don't know. Oh, we've got to go over there. Slow up and there'll be segments where he plays Zelda exploring. Yeah, I feel like, once again, if there's Zelda, I still feel like Zelda would be cool for, like, linear... Like, if they have to make her playable, because, once again, she's not a full, like, combat person like Link. Like, she would not play like Link, because Link is, like, the best swordsman in all of Hyrule. But she'd still have that, and she'd still have, like, have her magic. Maybe she has the, the Sheikah Slate as well. It'd be cool if, like, instead of, like, flashbacks to give us story, maybe we have, like, linear moments with her to get through the story. Uh, and she can, like, solve puzzles and do, like, minor combat or something. Um, I'd be okay with, like, that. But I don't think she'll be playable. But if she is, I mean, I'm all about it. I'm all about it. I'm not against anyone wanting that at all. Um, but I really think it's going to be a solo adventure with Link. Never know. You never know. Oh, we can go this way. Here we go. Yes, to get more story-based linear moments would be cool. Yeah, exactly. Something to help the narrative come across. Because, like, as much as Breath of the Wild is my favorite game ever, and, like, I still love the way they, like, you know, had the story, I, I still think a more linear approach while keeping it open world, if they, if they can even manage to do that, would be a really cool mix. And, of course, traditional, like, more traditional feeling dungeons. Anyways, this is how you kill this weird abomination. You pull them out of the slime. You pulled the bug, you pulled the, <laughs> you pulled the bug out of the, the little jelly there. There we go. I used to believe that it's been 10 months. Me too. What's it? Oh, holy shit, Frico. We well, you know what? It's been a pleasure having here for almost an entire year, which is wild to me. And uh, it's been nothing but absolute fun. <clears throat> fun. I like how I stuttered there. Nothing but absolute fun having you in here. And I hope you continue to enjoy Frico. Thanks for being an absolutely amazing lad. And, um, you know. I hope, uh, hope you kind of, get, as I said already, hope you continue to enjoy your time here, man. Thank you so much for the resub. There we go. There's a path for us. And welcome in. Zelda as a freaking wizard. I wonder if she even retains her magic powers. From what I know, like, it it starts going away at the end of Breath of the Wild, right? Because she, uh, actually, no, it, she just said she can't hear the voice anymore, right? I don't know if that's... I don't know if she mentioned it because of her powers waning. I can't remember anymore. But I, I, if she got to keep some of her powers, I'd be very happy. But that's also the reason why I think that she's falling down that cliff in that trailer. I feel like if she does have those powers, she would be OP. 
and that's their way of getting rid of her. Who knows, though? You ever play Okami? No, but I, I did tell chat that one day I'd at least try Okami on stream because it's been recommended to me forever now. And um, I, I thought, why not do a blind playthrough or at least try it once? So eventually, maybe it came dormant. Yeah, could be. Because, I mean, she didn't really do... I mean, okay, the, Ze the, the Zelda and the hero of 10,000 years ago didn't necessarily do their purpose either. You know what I mean? In the sense that they stopped the Calamity, which we already know is not the boy. So it makes me think that even after doing that, the powers could come back. Because technically the real evil isn't gone. But, you, you know, who, who knows? Who knows? Okami is pretty. I, I, like, I've seen that game a few times. Oh my god. I've seen that game a few times and it looks absolutely uh, beautiful in its own right. So yeah, I would, I would totally give it a try sometime. I've always been on and off about it. Because the wolf segments in Zelda are not my favorite. And I felt like that whole game would be just that. But I've been told it's not that. And also, I mean, I'm not, I don't want to just assume before actually playing the game. Also, I hear the music's great and the atmosphere's great. There we go. Okami still holds up today. And that's good to hear because there, there is that remastered version on the Switch, correct? So I could just get that. Well, don't tell Noma. Oh my god. Oh my god, never mind. Don't tell Noma, but I, I, it looks like, um... Well, it looks like her family's gonna... <laughs> I look in chat, first thing I see is kill Noma. Oh no. I don't wanna, I don't wanna kill Noma. I saw that. No, wait. Go, go, go back to work. You have work today, right? Go, go, uh, go, um, do the, do the thing that the, that they want you to do. The, the business thing that they, they, go business. Go end business, but also. <laughs> I didn't mean to. I have to. I have to. They have to go. They have to go, Nomer. Nomer Simpson. Oh my God. There we go. That's a new one. I got it. Nomer Simpson. Hey, are, are you streaming tonight? You are streaming tonight, right? I'm gonna drop that on you. Noma, more like no more. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. I didn't actually want to... I didn't want to kill Noma. Okay, just let me die. No, no, I, no, 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 no. Come back, come back. It's fine, it's fine. <laughs> I didn't mean it. Oh no. That's a misnomer. You all just figured it out. You figured out her ploy. You all just solved it. The boss of the entire corporation of Noma Live. To be honest, this boss looks like it would be. You'll, you, you'll all understand the minute. Stream cancels, streamer dead by Shady. Yeah. Yeah, that sounds about right. No, it doesn't, actually. No, it does not. But at the same time, yeah. When did this bridge break? Is this a whole different room or... Wait, hold up. Garden Noma. Huh? Huh, what? Oh, you mean... The boss of this is the... Is, is the... Is the, um... It's the amalgamation of Noma Live. It's the manifestation of Noma Live. With that being said... Now's our time. We do this for anyone who's new to this uh, series. Like, there's a lot of people who are watching this game for the first time or don't remember. Mostly people are, are watching for the first time, but we usually guess. We I get you to guess what you think the boss of the dungeon is gonna be, cause it's fun. Um, what do you think it's gonna be? Out of all the enemies you saw so far, what do you think the boss will be? I'll t I'm telling you now, it is the calm. It, it is a Noma Live culmination. That doesn't necessarily mean it's a Noma though. Um, let's see, a bigger filth, lean jelly, jelly. I am the boss. Are you? I can never forget the boss of this game. Yeah, th this boss is one of my favorite bosses, by the way. And I'm glad that uh, Channel Knight agrees. The boss is fantastic. Um, in terms of a <laughs> cinematography sense as well. It is very uh, dynamic. Why would Noma want to kill Link? To be fair, to be fair, when I say I play Link in Smash, she goes, basic. That's one of the first things, one of the first conversations we ever had, by the way. Um, I mentioned who I played, and she said basic. And to think I still choose to know her now. <laughs> you want to unlink. Oh my god. Is the boss the friends we made along the way? This thing is pretty much- This this thing is very much an anti-friend. This thing is not very friend-like. I, I will also drop that on all of you. 
Um, but I, I am liking the guesses so far. Uh, Link, Sheik, Zelda, and Inkling Girl, my mains. Uh, my mains are Link, Ike, Dark Pit, Piranha Plant, and... Did I say Ike already? If I didn't, then Ike. Maybe it's not Noma who wants to kill Link, but actually Link who wants to kill Noma. He, he was like... You know what? This whole stream is literally him going, What did you call me? What did you call me? Also, I... I all of this... All, all Like, Noma shit talking my mains. I very much want Noma to face me in Smash. I won't even say anything bad. If, if I win. I just want to face Noma in Smash, just like, in general. Okay, I will... I will absolutely drop, though, like... Uh, basic who? Basic, huh? But after that, it'll be fine. You made Ness? Ness is awesome. I love Ness. I can't play Ness for shit, but I love Ness. But like, oh my god, I suck at Ness so much. My main is Kirby and no one else. Kirby's a great character to use just in general for that game. He's just such a well-balanced character in my eyes. I don't know a lot about Smash meta and I don't care, but like, I love Kirby. I love Kirby. Rob DD Plant Incineroar. Okay, I forgot Incineroar was even in the game. Jesus. I, yeah, pran oh, thank you for another Piranha Plant main, by the way. Goddamn, love Piranha Plant so much. Do I really want to go in the Tektite Chamber? Now, that's the real question. I really don't. Let's go around the other way. DDD funny. DDD is a funny character. Absolutely. Wait, you like... Okay, Corrin and Kirby. Okay. Okay. About to make you part of my Thanksgiving meal. Get it? Because Corrin. Corrin. But, yeah, no, actually... Okay, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna kill Noma this time, unless they attack me. Oh, oh my God! Oh my God! Oh my God! Oh my God! 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 Oh my God! Oh my God! Oh my God! 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 There we go. Kirby's in bottom tier. He's top tier in my goddamn heart. Who needs tears when you're a god gamer? The only tears I'm interested in is the gamer tears when I win. Yo, what's going on, Raid Era? Welcome back, dude. Hope you're doing well. Welcome to a water dungeon type of night. If I do this fast enough, we might even make it to the next dungeon, but we'll see. We'll see. There is a... Uh, I think there's a lot of story that happens after this, which, great. You guys get some a little bit of that hot, hot lore. And one of the best songs in the series, if I recall. Could be wrong. You're not interested in Tears of the Kingdom. Oh, you're right. You're right. That, those are the only other tears I'm interested in as well. The Tears of the Kingdom. <laughs> Come here, lizard man. Lizard. Lizard. Oh. See ya. What if I hit finish just now? Would I have dove off the goddamn cliff? I should have tried. There's so many glitches. We've actually, we've only seen one glitch so far, but it was a, it was a wacky glitch. I hope someone clipped it. I've never seen that glitch in anyone playing this game. Okay. We've been, we went up to that door. So this, this would be a new door here. It looks like only one way to find out. I should have done it. What about tears of cake? That's true too. Tears of cake. Uh, is good. Lasa I was gonna say lasagna. Like, I don't mind lasagna, but if I had the choice to not eat it, I wouldn't. It's a little too much going on for me sometimes. Like, a thin lasagna, I like. If it's thick and has, like, five layers, it just starts be becoming, like, a little atrocious to me. Oh, no! Don't fuse! Oh, I, w I needed that potion bad. Like, I needed that potion really bad. I'm, I'm not bottling the goddamn purple fluid. Not doing it. So what's the point of doing this? Does that make it any better, or is it just to get there? We've been here, though, right? No, no, wait, no, we haven't. I don't know. Hang on, hold up, hold up. Red jelly, no. He has consumed. He has been consumed. Okay. Um, looks like we're good here. We can go through here. Check it out. Bold words for someone in Poripe distance. <laughs> Chad, oh my God. I love the Poripe is still a thing, by the way. That makes me incredibly happy. Actually, did I even tell you what my dream... I I told, I forgot to tell you the story of why I started so late. I had a dream I was streaming. But it was really weird because it was a mix of... It was an IRL stream, right? And I could see the chat in my eye. Like, I had a, uh, I had a special contact lens that let me see it. And... Um, but here, he, it, it, it's it's really strange, all right? You're going to be like, what the hell on this stream? So it, we were in a water dungeon, funny enough, which makes no sense. It, 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 it was a music and water-themed dungeon, but it was real life. I was actually there. 
and I was solving it. And I had party members. The party members were legitimate, like, friends. I don't remember any of them, except Noma was there. I will say that. And uh, one of the rooms was a room that looked like a concert hall, but you couldn't tell because it, it was still, like, a lot of underwater vibes. You had to kind of, like, suss out that it, it looked like a concert hall to, like, help yourself solve the puzzle. And you had to, like... Oh, by the way, I also had Mamir. Mamir from God of War. I had I had his head strapped to my um, strapped to my waist, and he gave me hints. Uh, I guess because I've been playing a lot of God of War. But Mamir was there, and he was giving me hints on how to solve it. And he was like, "Those fish over there, brother. You gotta like, you know, you gotta figure out which one goes and where." And I had to figure out which fish would eat the other fish. So I had to go down the food chain, and I had to make the smallest fish get eaten by the next fish, and then get that fish to be eaten by another fish for some reason. And then the biggest fish, I had to stuff it in a tube. And when it got stuffed in a tube, there was another fish in there. And then they made it. And the babies started flying out of the tubes, which made music. Which is the most stupid thing to ever for a puzzle and makes no sense. But then I had to do that for other fish to activate other instruments and make a concert hall thing happen. And then I solved it. So I solved it. And Noma was like, how did you do that? And I was like, I don't know, Mamir told me. And then, um, yeah, Tad Tones, basically, but like, kind of, kind of, um, and then, um, the next, the next area, this is where it gets funny, the next area was an outdoor swimming pool area, had a patio, everything, it was really nice, and the only way we were able to make it to the next area was for Noma to do a photo shoot with a photographer. There was literally a dude there being like, oh my god, I need to take pictures, would you allow me? I'll open this next door if you do. And, um, he was, like, a professional photographer, and Noma had to just be, like, a model. And I just sat there. And he's like, I'd include you, too. But I only want to do one person right now. And I was like, I didn't ask to, but okay, thanks. Thanks for letting me know, I guess. <laughs> it was great. It was great. There was more, but I can't really fully remember right now. But I thought that was hilarious. You did agree to it, Noma. <laughs> I saw this. I want to see what this is all about. We can leave the boundaries here. Quick, someone JavaScript this. <laughs> Make it happen. Make it happen. If anyone ever makes a Shady Cicada fan game, uh, you have a million stories to, to go off of now. Shady be like, I was literally just sitting there. I was just sitting there and being like, this is neat. He was literally like, I like the way you're posing there. Because I, I I was just sitting and I had, like, you know, my fist to my, like, face. You know when you, like, lean your head on one of your hands and I was just watching? And he's like, it'd be cool to include you. But I really just want to take pictures of one person right now. I was like, okay. Is there really, like, what's the whole point of this area? This just feels like a pit of doom. Photos. What? It's, it's yours, my friend. You play as Woodwood the Wizard? <laughs> I was I was 100% a lovely bard. Let me tell you. Let me tell you, friends. Chat. I, how do I um? I'm gonna I'm gonna get dizzy. I don't know. I I legit don't know what I'm doing here. Let me look more. You don't need to be here. The why 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 would it show me such tempting vines? I hate this. All right, fine. Let me go back. Why would it do this to me? There's probably like some little fun thing there. There's gotta be. Ah shit. Okay, hang. Hold up. I could do something. Maybe I'll go back later. Do you remember any of chat's zingers? It was literally, um, you guys posting cicada blinds. For some reason, you guys understood that puzzle. To this day, even in my dream, I will never, I, I, there's no way you guys, listen. You guys are smart as shit. But how? How, how, how? How would you guys be like, you gotta go down the food chain, Shady? There's no way. There's no way a, a human could solve that. It had to be Mamir. I have some amazing fan art. Hell yeah. Although when you say that, I get a little scared. Your fan art's always amazing. But then I gotta wonder. I gotta wonder. If Centipede Chan makes a return or not. Which, by the way, I'm excited to see anything you do. Dude, I'm serious. Your art is so good. So I cannot wait. He doesn't know about the fish bottle. I hate you all. Don't you, da don't you dare make this some kind of meta. Don't you dare. Small fish to big fish, Shady. Oh my god. Here we go. Here we go with this. 40 months. Oh boy, that's almost a whole year. You've been way overspooked. <laughs> thank you for dropping that hotline. Oh my god, Lucent. Thank you for the 40 months. Jeez. The fact that you have survived here this long really means a lot to me. But also, thank you so much for being here, dude. You are a wonderful company. 
and I very much appreciate it. So I hope you enjoy your time, as always. Thank you for almost having a whole year at 40 months. And, uh, yo, thank you for the gifts up to Mimir. Honestly, I love Mimir. He is, he, he's probably my favorite character in the whole goddamn, like, God of War series. Mimir is Pog. Oh, I heard it. Oh, boy. <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> um, thank you for the gifts up to the big fish, which did help me solve it. That is true. Big fish was pretty Pog for it. Won't lie. Won't lie. Oh, I gotta wear some boots, don't I? I gotta weigh that down. Tech tights again! These bastards are all, they always, they always come back for me. Shade uses bardic inspiration to seduce Rosalina and take over the galaxy, fathering Woodwood and, uh, fathering Woodwood the wizard, the protagonist, but casting that as a child because plot. Now Woodwood has to team up with Twitch chat to traverse all the redonkulous dungeons and every, uh, and eventually defeat his father. I love it. I love it. Publish it. Publish it right now. I, listen, uh, listen, I don't, I don't even necessarily want to become a villain, but publish it because Rosalina. Wait, is this not what I'm supposed to do? Was I not supposed to weigh it down? And not the inspire. No, Shady. So this isn't what I'm supposed to do, huh? Inter, in, interdasting. I can't swing. You are looking in the wrong direction. Wait, what does that mean? Oh! <laughs> what the hell? What the hell? Cicada blind. Cicada blind. Oh, you got played. He got played. What are you gonna do, little man? What are you gonna do, little man? I knew that looked weird. I thought that. I thought that that's why I had to stand to target the ceiling. I thought they were trying to like, you know, do that. Which, by, oh, by the way, speaking of Mimir, one of my complaints with God of War. Oh, thank God, health. One of my complaints with Ragnarok was it backseats you so hard. I've never had a game hold my hand as bad as God of War Ragnarok, and I played like, you know, some easy ass Nintendo games. That will, they will not give you time to experiment with any puzzle. It's basically just go through the puzzle and see how cool it is. But you'll know how to solve it no matter what. There's no accessibility feature to turn it off, by the way. I love it. I'll just like look at a thing and they'll be like, you have to push that, brother. You have to hit that with your axe to move this thing. It'll activate that torch. Do it, brother. And I'll be like, I, I know. <laughs> I know. And then they'll, um, they'll, uh... Like, I'll be set on fire, and they literally go, You're on fire, it'll pass. Every time. And it's like, bro, I know. I know. I love their commentary in this game, but that is, that's a lot. That is a lot. What did I even get just now, chat? I don't remember what I just got. You should play Gartic. Oh, yeah, 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 you're right, you're right. Noma gets backseated in Gartic so much. Which, imagine getting backseated in Gartic phone. It's true, someone did call her, like, incompetent and shit for, like, not using a tool that he wanted her to use. It was the fill bucket, I think. <laughs> heart piece. Oh, right, it was that heart piece. That's right, that's right. Do you see that gap in the fence over there? Oh, is that... What? What is that? Is that something that they said a lot? They probably said it a lot. But yeah, they, they do... The backseating is insane in God of War Ragnarok. A, a warning from now. Still a great game. There are some things I'm very unhappy about. Not... not no, sorry, not... I, you know, no, yes. There are some things... That where the more I think about it, the more I'm like, why did that happen? But it is still a fantastic game. But I, w I would give it like a like an 8. Um, which isn't bad or anything. Maybe, no, I'd give it like a 7.5. But it, it's still a really good game. I'd say the first game is like an 8.5 or a 9 for me. Um, but it, it is still great. I'll give it that. Of course, it's the fill bucket tool. Yeah. Yeah, no one got backseat hard. It was really funny. It was really funny. It was infuriating. But it was really funny. Because, like, how do you even do that? Let's see here. Some Sometime, you know, maybe I should stream Gartic. I want them to be a guest person here. I want I want them to show up. <laughs> I'd have a lot of fun. Okay, let's see. But no, I told myself I'd be less bitter. I told myself I'd be less bitter. So I, I, I won't do that. We won't do that. But I want to do a Gartic phone stream one day. I am very bad at drawing, though. That's the main reason I haven't done it, but also because um, it would have to strictly be Discord only. And even then, like, I don't have... I have to get, like, that extension that Noma has where I could block, like, racist or, like, not safe for work drawings. I'm just too scared about all that stuff. And this community is so goddamn, like, big now. But at the same time, Noma's community is huge on that, too. And, like, she manages, she manages it fine, so... Um... 
I could have. I, I maybe I could ask Noma to help me out with that. All right. Let's figure out where we got to go real quick here. Hm. Not enough, boy. Actually, one thing you're gonna love about Ragnarok is the amount of times Kratos says no. Someone will drop a paragraph or a whole sentence, and he'll just go no. And honestly, it's not even a complaint. It is the funniest thing ever. Or there, there's one. There's one that was amazing. Because you, you expect these big conversations when you're in the boat sections. There's one part where it traces like, Dad or Father, you think I'll get a beard like yours? Five second pause. No. <laughs> it's like, shit, let the man think he's going to get a beard at least, Kratos. Damn. Damn. That shit, that shit killed me. That shit, he's, he said, hell no. Hell no. It's great. It's great. It's a good game. It's a good game. The only thing, without spoiling, is retcons. Th there's there are some where I was like, oh, that... For a plot that was amazing that I've been waiting four years for answers for, there were a few things where I was like, wait a minute. Did that change? Possibly? Anyways, I won't say more than that. But it, it's still great, and I recommend you play it. It's, it's fantastic. It's okay, Trace. Beards aren't that great anyways. Beards are goddamn annoying to have. I've never had, like, a full-on beard beard, but when my facial gets a little too long, it's like, oh my god. Especially, with, like, I have really thick facial hair. It's prickly as hell. So. That's how you know Kratos is a good dad. Honestly, Kratos is, like, I... I the whole... That's that's one of the things that you love that game for. The whole father-dad... <laughs> the father-dad. The whole father-son relationship in Ragnarok is done extremely well. And the, uh... Without spoiling, of course, uh, the ending is still great. Gotcha. And Brock and Sindri are way more fun in this. Like they were already amazing in the first game, but I think you're gonna love them more in this one. Uh, in this one. To those who actually play the God of War games and know what I'm talking about. I know there's not a lot of. I know there's not like a ton of um, Western cinematic game players in here. Shit. Although, you know, as someone who doesn't play a lot of those, if there is one I have to play, it's absolutely... Or one, the one that I love playing is absolutely God of War. Last of Us 1 is also fantastic in its own right. Um, even God of War 2... God of War. Even Last of Us 2 is fine. I'm just not a huge fan. Um, Uncharted is cool. Uncharted is cool, but it, it's, a, it, it's a game I would, wouldn't play again. After playing it once. Uncharted 2, maybe. Uncharted 4, I wouldn't play that one again. As good as it was father dad relationship <laughs> father dad father dad Th there you did wow there's the gift sub manifested amazing thank you for that listen chat i can't speak okay how did a bat do this what how's the bat continuing to do this okay i okay i see what i have to do well we're, we're gonna go the long way oh spider-man's no spider-man's great spider-man is also fantastic I, I don't even know if i'd fully count that as cinematic it it, it, it is but like that is straight up that like that the gameplay in that man, that is prioritized gameplay absolutely. Um, I don't know. I just feel like there's a lot of games that do feel samey in terms of the whole cinematic and and old man with gruff oh no gruff man with small child goes through a war torn world together, uh, and things are depressing and the, the the gruff man has to teach the young child the ways of the world and protect them and and this and that. Um. Which, it, there isn't a lot, lot of those, but there, there is, there is more than, like, two. <laughs> you know what I mean? And that's okay. But I think there's points where I'm like, I'm good on this genre. I don't need more. A movie game. Spider-Man is a movie game. Would you guys actually call it a movie game? It, it is fantastic, though. Alright, if it is a movie game, then it's a good movie game. I feel like there weren't a lot of movie-level things in there, though. Like, a lot of side quests were just straight-up side quests without going through a lot of that there were some story moments but i don't know if i don't even know about it personally i wouldn't call it a movie game but if it is then um that's okay too it's a good movie game um but yeah spider-man ps4 is like genuinely amazing i love it more than spider-man 2 and that game was great if i had a nickel uh for every time a grunt man had to teach a child about the world i have two nickels which isn't a lot but it's weird that it happened twice yeah there's um I mean, what, I mean, what, okay, let's actually count this. So I'm not, you know, so hopefully I don't, it's not a bias point, you know? Um, there is God of War. There is Last of Us. There's that Pragmata game that we've seen nothing of that got announced 50 years ago. There is, 
That that is that really it? Or am I forgetting like some big ones in there? I mean, there's like Lisa, which I haven't played, but I hear Lisa is genuinely its own unique thing and is wonderful. Walking Dead game. Yeah, that's true. Which, by the way, as someone who doesn't play those kind of games either, the, I, I really like the story in that one. That, that story made me very sad. At least the first volume or so. Walking Dead does count as well. Yeah, Miles, Miles Morales had a good story too. Absolutely. Lisa, I do want to try Lisa. Lisa the Painful, whatever it's called. Play Lisa. Uh, that one messed me up more than a Mori. Really? To hear that something messes someone up more than a Mori is wild to me. I think that game out of most messed me up. I, I, I think... What is the game? That, I think the game that still messed me up the most is probably like Crisis Core. But that's because... And that was way back. No, you know what? It was a Mori. It was 100% a Mori. Omori's plot I felt for like days. I mean, the end of Crisis Core I felt for days too, because I didn't know what was going to happen. I never played Final Fantasy VII at the time, so like I knew it was a prequel game, but I didn't know what like actually happens. So, oh my god, when the things happened, I was like, what? What? Did this is how this is going to- yeah? <laughs> um, but oh my god, if it's not a fantastic game. I'm more maybe suffered first time in five years. It's 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 it it's hard, man. It's a hard game emotionally. <laughs> I was not expecting the ending we got. Like I knew we I knew it was gonna be emotional, but that was a wild ending. I actually didn't see some of the stuff coming. Which was nice for once, because I usually guess plots way too easily. I played on Mori and never had any uh, direct recommendations for it. I, I take shitty word as a law those and I have the new number one Steam purchase. Yeah, hundred percent. 100% play it. And if you don't enjoy it, you know, that's absolutely fine too. It's not for everyone, but I will say that that game is genuinely fantastic. Like, chat's been recommending it forever, and I was like, fine, I'll give it a try. And we did it on stream, and oh my god, if it wasn't some of the wildest shit I went through. Um, and like, chat was really into it. By the final stream, there was like, what, like 130 people here just like waiting to see what happens. Or they knew what was going to happen, but they wanted to see me be in pain, which honestly, I get it. It's been- I've been watching other uh, people stream Amori as well, just like lurking. And uh, it's been interesting to see their reactions. Have you checked out Sig Signalis? It's generally so awesome. I heard the name, but I know nothing about it. Survival Horror? Okay, I will- You know what? Let me- I can write that down right now. I have a notepad open just for game recommendations that people ever give it. Sig... Nalus. I'll check it out. I'll check it out, Deb. I love me some horror. Speaking of which, uh, Callisto Protocol next month, hopefully. I should be streaming it. Uh, at least a little bit of it. So if you want to see some absolutely scary sci-fi shit, uh, stay tuned for that. And once again, to people who don't know, that game is banned in Japan now. Uh, it, too violent for Japan. I'm not even lying. So this should it should be interesting. It, but like chat said, uh, it, it's absolutely because of the whole dismemberment deal. It has to be. Have you played Five Nights at Fredders? Fredders. <laughs> Fredders. I'm trying to find this one path on the map. The one that goes off to that little snaking point, and I can't find it. You guys see what I'm looking at, right? It leads to something, but, like, where is that? What? I'll find it. I'll find it. I, uh, I'm... You know what's funny? I'm actually not a fan of Five Nights at Freddy's. <laughs> Watching Noma play it was fun. But I never actually, like, cared that much about it. Even, like, the lore. I think at one point I cared for a little bit when, like, the first two games were out. And then I was like, eh. Okay, we probably need to use the, the claw shot. I'm gonna call him Fredders. Five Nights at Fredders. Fried, f fry, 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 five Nights at Federico's. Okay, I think I know what I gotta do. I think I know what I gotta do. <laughs> Yo, Five Nights at Fredders! Yo, okay, what's going on? Welcome back in. I hope you're doing well. How are you enjoying uh, Age of Calamity, by the way? K is my uh, K is my recent uh, fellow Breath of the Wild fan slash friend, and um, she she just beat Breath of the Wild for the first time. Now she's getting into Age of Calamity, and I'm I'm very uh, I, I gotta catch one of those streams if you end up streaming it or if you have been streaming it. Have you played any of the near games? Yep, I played Replicant. I didn't get all the endings because I. <laughs> I, I'm really sounding like a hater today. I didn't like Replicant that much in terms of video game pacing. The music was great, and the story was absolutely amazing. And I did look up the rest of it. The, the actual gameplay, though, I was not a fan of. But 
uh, Automata, Automata. Love it. Fantastic game. All around, that game was great. Um, but yeah, no, the Nier games have some of my favorite stories in all of gaming. Like, I, I, I can't even deny that. It's, it's fantastic. Okay, I think I found the way. Yeah, here we go. Five Nights at Fritters. My fingers are hurting from smashing all the buttons. Yeah, it's it's painful. It's painful. I will tell you now. Make sure you... Um... Actually, I don't remember the tip I was about to give you. Oh, no. All I'm going to say is 100%ing that game is wild with all the DLC and everything. But it is it is a very fun game to 100%. It can, get, it can be very hard at times. Make sure you level up properly. Make sure you put on good perks on your weapons and stuff. Oh, my God. That, that, that bomb is... That bomb's alive. What? Mortuary Assistant win. Oh, do you guys still want to see me stream Mortuary Assistant? Because I'll do that. I forgot. I actually forgot. Uh, we could even do that this week, maybe. To take a little break so we don't do, like, constant Just Zelda. But also, welcome to my second favorite Zelda game ever, Kay. It's Twilight Princess. I love this one so much. Um, we're in the Water Temple right now, and it is it is a time. I'm also playing on hard mode, so there are no... I can't get any health. <laughs> But Twilight Princess is a damn good one. It has my favorite boss fights in the entire series. I was recommending which ones for Kay to play next. And I told her if she's going to go for like Switch Zelda, she's got to do Skyward Sword. Mm. Link's Awakening is great. But Skyward Sword. 100%. Especially since it's so connected to the Breath of the Wild's lore. Ever played Outer Wilds? So uh, I haven't. But Imamura Cross went into an hour rant on why I should play it, and he sold me on it. So I've, I'll probably stream that at some point, too. From what he's told me, it sounds like it's right down my alley as well. She's got to do Ocarina? Oh, for sure. But if she's going on Switch for now, absolutely on that Skyward. And as much as I love Ocarina, it's one of my favorite games ever, and one of the best games I've ever played. It do got that dated gameplay. But, but once again, it's still absolutely playable and totally solid, and I love it. But those modern Zeldas. Got that smoothness. That peanut buttery smooth. It's on Switch? Oh, you're right. It's on the online thing. You're right. You're right. So it is playable. He's far from the only stream I've heard rant about how amazing that game is. And that is a good sign. I'm pumped to try it. Water? What's going on, Riggle? Yeah, we're in the water. We're in the water. Your dated gameplay? Maybe. But my ga my dated gameplay is my gameplay is so good you want to date me. <laughs> Like, dated gameplay. Like, I, you know, I, they, I, I am dated. You know what I'm saying? I really don't want to die here because I don't remember how I got here. So let's be very careful. Oh! I thought that would kill him. I didn't want to pull the fish to me. Jeez. You know what? Solid strat. So my princess is probably my personal favorite Zelda, but I didn't have the budget uh, for any of the remakes and I don't have any old hardware anymore. I keep hoping it'll come to Switch. I hope so, too, for all of our sakes, bud. It's honestly a crime that it hasn't made it to Switch. And it's, it's also a crime... If they put it on like an online streaming service, I want to own. I want to own the game on the Switch, please. Um, I am sorry to hear that though. It sucks not having a way to play some of these games because this and Wind Waker are some of the best games I've ever played in my life. Skyward Sword, yes, yeah, go for it, K. Do it, do it, <laughs> do it. No pressure, but do it. Reactions are late because I was purchasing tickets for a convention. Oh, no worries at all. You don't. You don't have to respond at all. If you want, if you if you have to lurk, that's totally fine. But, um, hell yeah, convention? That's exciting. Are you gonna, like, just, like, chill there? Or are you gonna cosplay as well? You've only played, uh, Wind Waker? Oh, you gotta try some of these other ones. Uh, uh, you gotta try some of these other ones. They are fantastic. Okay, how, how, do, how am I doing this? Skyward Sword is your next Zelda game? Okay, good. Do it. And you can finally learn things. You can finally learn about the voice in the sword. You are doing cosplay. Oh, shit. Who are you cosplaying? Who or what are you cosplaying? For all I know, uh, maybe you could cosplay a chair. I don't really know. Oh boy, do I gotta fill the water in this area? Or do I really gotta aim for a target up there? Or am I missing something? Hmm. Scarlet Sword is really good. It's one of my favorite Zeldas. Even back when it was on the Wii and there were some complaints about controls, it was my favorite. Sponge Daddy? Wait, are you actually going to be the Scrub Daddy? There's no way. You're not cosplaying Scrub Daddy. That's a lie, right? I mean, if it if it's real, then that's amazing. But there's no way. Ah, oh, damn. Yeah, I think I gotta fill it up. Just start pissing. It'll fill eventually. <laughs> yeah, Frico? Yeah? Oh, my God. 
I still want to cosplay Claude from Fire Emblem Three Houses. Oh my god. No, Noma, why would you shock me like that? I'm close to dying. <laughs> Noma, why? You need to get back up. Oh, god damn it. What was it all for? What am I fighting for? Claude, my beloved. Best Fire Emblem character, hands down. Best. Do it. I'll do it. Only if you do the thing you promised. Noma's humor is shocking. I will say that Noma's humor is shockingly good at times. I mean, she's always funny, but there are times she drops something where I'm like, oh my god, that was out of pocket. That's amazing. See, look, I don't bully. I give credit. I'm dying. I'm dying bad. Sarah's so solid game controls frustrating. Yeah, that being said, the the remake version with the with the with the stick controls, it, it it's honestly really solid. Like I love the controls in Skyward Sword, but I love it even more now that there's a controller option that isn't motion. Um, it made it way more way more fun. Annette and Ash. And that and that is I love Annette. I love I actually like Ash a lot too. Uh he is OP as hell in three houses if you use him right. Not even use him right. He's easy to use right. You can almost like not... It's hard to use him wrong. Shady compliment my humor. Something's not right today. I literally always compliment you. I mean, I, I bully too, but you know, still. MFers looking like chain chomps. I'm saying. I'm saying. Okay. This is giving me anxiety. I hate this beep. Please, God. Please, God. Oh, also, K. Okay, another great thing about this game... Uh, you can run and use your sword at the same time in Toilet Princess. I love this so much. And also, check out all these moves. I can do this. You see that? I can also stab people when they're dead. Or like when they're dying, I can stab them on the floor. Like, the moves in this game, I hope I hope any of these moves come to Tears of the Kingdom. Impa is cute. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Young Impa is my wife, Kay. I love Young Impa. And Young Pura? Wife. Sorry, like, sorry. I guess... She <laughs> Older Pura, technically speaking, but like younger, older Pura. Stab people when they're dead. You can jump in the air and stab them in the ground. You can do it in Skyward Sword as well, by the way. And thank you for the gifts up to low health. Great. I'm <laughs> blit. Blit. I hate this low health. I hate it so much, but thank you. I very much appreciate it. Uh, is there something I have to do? Okay, Sanj, do you remember? Is there something I have to do in that room? You know, before this goddamn beeping drives me insane. Pura is very nice. Pura is, yeah. Absolutely. Absolutely. Luna's here. Oh, hi, Luna. How you doing? The pings of doom. Yeah, I... One thing about older games. The pings hurt. There's gotta be something I can do in here, man. There's gotta be something I can do in this room to get that boss key. I've done, like, everything. There's no water path or anything either. I gotta get in that door. Maybe. Let's... Let's figure that out. We can do this. Okay. Okay, I can do this. I can do this. No help. I'll, I'll, I'll figure it out. It's just because it's beeping is just like... It's a little bit of a sensory overload for me. I love Pora's little red streak in her hair. Oh yeah, it's... it's I love it. Her whole style is great. Whole style is great. From the top. Yeah, I had a feeling I have to get it from the top. Okay, so definitely that door then. Check your map. No, you... No, you. No, I'm kidding. I'll check the map. Alright, let's see. Oh, another fun thing too, Kay, is that there's some lore in this one that connects it to past games as well. Like, okay, I don't, I, I don't want to say what it is. Or do I say what it is? Let, let's just say there might technically be more than one link in this game. Except the other one might be a little uh, different looking. Sort of, maybe, kind of. Eyes emoji. Come on, Noma, do your shock thing. All right, fine, don't do it. Take your damn nucleus. I'm glad the pings have been phased out and replaced by mostly tense music. Yeah, I like, like, it, in Breath of the Wild, it's a really soothing, soft noise when you're low on health. And I'm so glad everyone is learning. Society is healing, truly. <laughs> sort of, maybe, kind of. Yeah, sort of, maybe, kind of. Um, also, I think the final uh, version, the final volume of the Twilight Princess manga is happening in April. The English version, at least. I would also, if you end up liking these games, Kay, I would also highly recommend you read the mangas because they're really good. And the Twilight Princess one apparently gets like really dark and violent. I'm pretty sure Link just, there's a, I, I saw like Link like, I, I mean, it might have been a dream or not, but there was, there's a frame of like Link losing an arm or something and actually bleeding out. I, I could be wrong about that. There's manga? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I have a box set of all of them except for Twilight Princess. The Ocarina of Time one is really cute. 
Um, there's four swords. There's, I think, Minish Cap? I don't know. There's Majora's Mask. Um, you got the most recent one, September, the volume. Oh, hell yeah. Yeah, I hear, I hear it is like the best one out of all of them. Oh my god, please beeps. Please beeps. <laughs> I need these to stop now. I will buy your mangas for five proud points. Hell no. Hell no. My, my box set comes in a treasure test. And when you open it, it does the da 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 sound. There's no way I'm giving that up. Well, consider me confused. The peeping's anxiety inducing. Yep. Oh, you're, you're going to have to deal with that in old Zelda games too. Uh, it, it's even worse in the, in the, in the N64 ones. The N64 low health noise is actually like the worst thing in the world. It makes a sound. Yeah, it plays. It has a little speaker. You can use Uku to escape and get some health. You're right. Okay, let me try looking around a little more and then we'll do that. Thank you for reminding me. We can even go get potions and stuff. Some potions, as Sanj would say. How do I get to that mid path? What the hell? Path kind of mid, not going to lie. You know, let's do it now. I can't handle this. Be right back. All right, chicken. Let's get out of here. God, this baby freaks me out. Oh, you know what? I'm a little hungry. I'm going to break up my kiwis. Hang on. I got my bowl of kiwis here. Don't die on your way to Castletown, bro. I'll be fine. Chicken to... Yeah. Yeah, you can use a chicken to teleport out, and you can use its child to go back. Okay, give me a minute. Give me a minute. I need, I need a slice of kiwi. Hang on. Hang on. Uh, in the meantime, you can look at, um... Look at, um... Let's see. It's me as Link, eating fruits. One sec. Alright. Your channel night. Uh, if you are actually leaving, have yourself a damn good night. Always a pleasure to have you around. And, uh, or, I say that. It's your first time here, right? But hey, it was an absolute pleasure to have you here. And if you did enjoy the stream, hope to see you again. But if not, hey, thanks for just coming along, man. And also, I think I might have forgotten. I'm so sorry if I did. I swore I said goodbye, but if I didn't, uh, goodbye, Snorks. Love you. Hope you, had, hope you had a good time here. Can't believe you're eating the people of New Zealand. Sorry, Sanj. Unless you don't like New Zealanders living there. That I'm doing you a favor, I guess. I don't want to talk to you. I don't care. I don't care. I'm taking. I'm taking. I'm taking the short way up. I'm going. I'm going. Give me that. I have money. I can do this. Screw the rules. I have money. Or whatever Kaiba says in the thing. Go to the pool. What? What pool? Oh, you mean the fairy? God damn it, the fairy fountain! You're right, you're right. You're right, that actually is a good idea. I'm gonna do that, I'm gonna do that. Anyone has rhythm game? Yeah, Crypto Necrodancer, big rhythm game recommendation from me as well. 100% you gotta play that, or Cadence of Hyrule, which is literally Crypto Necrodancer, but it's Zelda, made by the same people. Um, uh, what else? What other rhythm games do I like? Beat Saber if you have VR. <laughs> Um. Uh. Oh god, it's been a while since I played like rhythm games. There's one that I was looking at that looks really good, and I can't remember the name. We actually saw it at um a summer games fest once. Does anyone remember what I'm talking about? That's way too vague. It, I know it was also like it also looked like a hand drawn thing. It's not the one I'm working on. But uh, P Dad streamed it once. Um. Shit, I don't remember. Um, what else? I mean, I would try Metal Hellsinger. I got the demo of it. I haven't tried it yet, but it's literally Crypto to Necker Dancer mixed with Doom. So it's like first person shooter, but it has metal music. It's like Doom, but you have to actually shoot and attack to the beat. And the enemies do it as well. Um, that game looks really cool too. It actually got nominated for the Game Awards, but I couldn't give it a point. I haven't actually tried it yet, but they have like 
like actual like straight up uh, big metal artists on there as well. Like System of Down, like Surge is on there. Dude from Trivium. Uh, the girl from... Is an M on M Martha or whatever? I, I don't remember if it's that band, but what, there's one metal lady singer in there as well. There's a few big names. You play that one? Oh, you play Metal House Singer? It was cool? Oh, hell yeah. Nominating? We should have a... Oh, we should have... Oh my god, that'd be adorable. Like a Noma Award show with nominees. Nominations. That would be amazing. Rhythm Platformer. Uh, 140? I never heard of that one. Interesting. Wait, this. so this is a healing pool? Oh, thank god. Alright, goodbye anxiety noises. There you go, chat. You're free. You're finally free. The Gnome Awards? Yeah! The Noma Awards. Oh, so you can't heal when you're inside the water. In huh? Interesting. This Met fan art can go to bed. Yo, no worries. I look forward to seeing it. You can hear again? It's back. You're good, chat. You're good. Chests? Chests? <laughs> in my video games? Yeah, chests. But have a good night. My mom says it's my turn on. Hope you have a damn good one. Hope you enjoyed the stream. Hope to see you again if you did. Anxiety noises are still going off. Starting at my new place tomorrow. Oh, shit. Well, I wish you the best of luck, Frico. There's always going to be some nerve wracking with that going on. But 100%, you're going to kill it. Give yourself, like, a week. And it should totally be fine. Um, but I hope everything goes well, nonetheless, Frico. Very big good luck to you. I mean, this game definitely has chest in multiple senses. Oh, absolutely. Absolutely, positively. We caught Link. We caught Link looking. We caught him copping a glance. Man said, Telma? Sorry, what's your name? All right. I'm not even going to go for potions. I'm, I'm confident I will no longer lose any health. So we're going to go in with just this full thing of hearts here. It'll be fine, chat. Oh, god damn it, really? Super term to get this game totally, absolutely legally for PC because my PC, uh, we went and break itself as my favorite Zelda game. Do it. Honestly, this game has aged incredibly well in the sense that, I mean, it's one of my favorite games still to this day. I have not felt any kind of, like, datedness through it. You know what I mean? Wanna go back to my mama? You got it. Mama, here we come. Time for more kiwi slices. Have a good night, uh... Gaming apostrophe period. Uh, thank you so much for coming by. I hope you enjoyed the stream. Hope to see you again if you did. But if not, hey, thanks for swinging by. And uh, it was a pleasure having you here. Okay, let's figure this out without low health, yeah? Sorry to any VOD watchers who have to put up with that. Any lurkers who had to hear that for like an hour. I'm so sorry. Alright. Thanks for pulling through, uh, chicken. Now... Can I just jump to that? Can I just be a gamer and, like, just climb that? No. So there's got to be a way to get to that middle path. And there's no way to drop from the ceiling. There's a pool. I don't know why it took me so long to notice that. I'm so sorry. I guess because I was talking about Zelda games and why I love them. And I forgot what exactly I was doing. But I do see there's a way to rise up in the middle. Rise up, gamers. The graphics are so beautiful even when they're a little gritty. Uh, maybe it's just my nostalgia talking, though. I, I feel like like art design in Zelda games are usually pretty pretty goddamn amazing and memorable in their own right. Like even Ocarina of Time is beautiful to me. And Majora's Mask. So definitely, um while they can be dated in ways, um, they are fantastic for what they are. This is not the way to the door. Son of a wait, hang on. Hold up. What is it? Where does this lead me? What is the whole point of this side? Oh, I know where I am, but let me let me just get up and get a good feel for where I am. Just real quick. Yo, Dragon Quill. Oh, sorry. Nyx? <laughs> I almost went by your whole government-issued name. Uh, welcome back. Hope you're doing well. Good to see you. Welcome to the Water Temple. Have you been reading Heresy recently? Is that an anime? Or a manga, I mean? Because I, I have no idea what that is. If it is, then no. If it isn't, then no. <laughs> Would you recommend, though? Love the Ocarina of Time graphics so much. Same here. When, when it hits sunset in that game, it's genuinely so pretty in its own way. Okay, we're gonna go up. We're gonna rise up on the other side again. I really don't know what I'm doing here. I have one more idea. One second, one second, one second. Let me go back this way real quick. No, it, that's a shit post video. Heresy? It's a shit post video? A shit post on what? 
Is it like is there like a new big meme I'm I'm like out of the loop on? Thank God. <laughs> I only half kid. I the new the new meme I've been into is everyone bringing back the whole Koopas dancing to new Super Mario Brothers music stuff. Where it's like when you're a Koopa and you just find out your old family died, and then when it gets to the bop bop part, they stop they stop crying over it and they do the little dance and then they go back to crying. That meme is that meme is killer right now. It's a 2020 meme. I'll share it in chat if that's okay with you. Go ahead. I think it'll allow it'll allow it. Hopefully it does. Unless someone wants to give a permit. If a mod wants to go, do do a if a mod wants to goo, if a mod wants to permit. Um, Freako. All you gotta do is exclamation mark permit space and then their name. But they should be fine. The memes are so funny. I love it. I love. There was one where it's like. My reaction when I couldn't make our POV, you didn't make it into music school because of your bad rhythm. And he does the dance like too early. It's it's amazing. Mod goo is the worst thing I've ever seen, but thank you so much for the sub. I very much appreciate that. Bleh bleh. Bleh bleh. Alright, I might... Why? What am I... What am I doing wrong here? Thank you so much for the gift sub. There's a hole at the bottom. Really? Really? Maybe you meant the other, like that side over there. There might be a hole, not here, right? But let me let me check down here, anyways. Yeah, there's gotta be like one hole I didn't go in yet. Yeah. We went in that hole. You guys remember the movie Holes? The book Holes? Ah, shit. It was a movie and a book. But you guys remember the book called Holes? I don't remember what it was about. I, I swear it was like prisoners just digging deep holes. And that was it. And they wanted to escape from digging deep holes. That's all I remember. I remember hating this room. Yeah. My ADHD is not helping me. Right now. Streaming and doing this. But we'll, we'll, we'll figure it out. Oh my god. Please. Please. I'm leaving. I'm, I don't, I'm not dealing with you. I'm, I'm ditching. I'm ditching. Ding dong ditch. I lied. I lied. You're dead. I played you like a fool. Played you for the fool that you are. That's right. Gangster for that. All right, there we go. I think that's it. Thank you for pointing that out, everyone. Jesus. That took me way too long. Oh, camera. Oh. All right. That book is great. Yeah, I remember a lot about it, but I do remember enjoying it quite a lot. Um, I remember it being, it being really good. I need more kiwi. Hmm. Okay. We made it. We're good. Now, how do we open it? That should be an easy one. Probably a ceiling. Probably the goddamn ceiling, yeah? Yeah. <laughs> yeah? Nomo Cicada time? That really is the Nomo Cicada. It's like if we messed up the fusion dance, we would become that thing. No offense to that thing. All offense to that thing. Grungly bastard trying to kill me. All offense. Fun thing about those bubble enemies, bombs work too to get them out of the bubbles. So they do work. Okay, yo, sorry. I think it was Silver who was asking that earlier. Um, you were right. You were correct. Turns out you could use the bombs. Interesting. Okay, I didn't know that. I guess it makes sense because it is like a water bomb, yeah? Was that the mod goo? Oh, wait, did you? Oh, wait, you posted the link, right? Hang on, sorry. Let me see. Heresy. What is this? Oh wait, wrong window. That's my nominees still. Nominees, <laughs> nomin, knees nuts. Good job, Shady. You did good. There's the tabs Nomo was asking about. I do got fifty million. Have you been reading heresy recently? <laughs> Unacceptable. <What? laughs> I didn't expect the gun. That's amazing. That's good. That's really good. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I love when people dress up as like those knights and do memes. I don't know why it's such a memeable format, but it works so well to just dress up as a knight and then do something funny. There's a whole aesthetic behind it makes me very happy. Wiggly boy destroys the bubble entirely. Oh, it just blows up the bubble. Jesus. Okay, nice. Well, if I see one, I'll probably try doing it for fun now. Just to, just an extra prank on them. 
Shout out to the Templars. That's the word. Shout out to the Templars. Forgot about bread boys. I love the one at the dinner table. Bread boys? Dinner table? I'm a bread boy. I am a boy. For, I'm a slut for bread. Don't even get me started on pastries and shit. I am a slut for pastries. I'm a slut for just sweets in general. You guys have seen it. You guys have heard it. I'm gonna go get those Reese's Pieces anyways. I don't care. It's fine. Once they're gone, I won't buy any more. You know? You know? That's the way to do it. You know? Because then they're gonna go bad. <laughs> I've been I've I've been being healthy. I, my diet's been great. The food I've been cooking is great. I can have a little candy. It's fine. It's fine. Mm, pastries. Yeah, shady. I'm not even I'm not even I'm not even pulling back on that one. I am a slut for sweets and pastries and bread. I have eaten. I have eaten. Okay, sweet boy. I'm shady, sweet boy cicada now. I have eaten cake and <laughs> I'm choking oh god <laughs> Jesus I've eaten cake in front of people and have like actually made sounds of pleasure not not in like a really weird way that you meant but I'll be like, <laughs> you know what I mean well it's like my mouth is just like I love I, I, I love sweets chat so much love me some cake who doesn't love cake god damn it all that health we desperately needed do we really though I, I always opt to visit the local bakery in any new town I vacation to. Always the best place to go. I, uh, I mad vibe with your decision. That is a, that is a smart one, let me tell you. It's better than the old days. Ba ba you know, in the old days, you had to be careful there wasn't sawdust in your, uh, branded bread. Because, yes, they used to brand bread. So you'd be responsible in case you did fill it with sawdust. And then you'd lose your bread-making license, which they had back then. Um, Fantastic. It's great. Oh my god, look at me dodging the bats. Look, check this out, check this out. Ooh. Ooh, ooh. I've been eating well at all. I will eat all the cake on your behalf, Shady. You know, god damn it. You know, there I I I'd probably here's what here's how it'd play out, Nyx. I'd probably be like, Nyx, please finish this for me. I don't want to eat this all. I I wanna be healthier. And then while you're eating it, I'll get jealous and I'll be like, why the hell are you eating all of it? I want some. <laughs> so so it'll be it'll be an interesting experience, is all I'm gonna say. Great, I'm almost dying already. This has been a fantastic experience on the sh Shady Cicada, on the Shibby Sakibi stream. We might have to leave one more time. Shady branded bread sold at ShadyCicada.com. It's funny because theoretically, I actually could do that. I'm not even like, I can make custom products on the store too that I can ship myself once you buy it. So if I really was like, hey, yo, Shady Cicada bread come through. I, I like I could I won't that sounds like a terrible idea and it would absolutely go stale by the time it reaches you but I could shady canned bread oh no not the canned bread not the canned bread shady toaster toast, toast, toast. I think the only like real like custom things I would like send would be like physical albums if I ever do album releases which I would like to do soon Soon as in, like, within the next year or two. I have, I have plans. I've been writing some songs for it and everything, so. With vocalists. Like, not yet, but I want to get vocalists on all of them. Um, so, but we'll see about that. We'll see about that. Also, one thing I will be selling, by the way, chat. Guitar tabs. Those are going to be on the store. So if you, ever, if you ever wanted to learn how to play some of my songs on guitar, you will get Guitar Pro and PDF tabs. Finally. Uh, patrons still get it all for free, by the way, but, uh, yes, I'll, tabs will be up for sale. Which also means potentially way more tab leaks of my music, but whatever. It, it's, it is what it is. Alright, let's do it. I'm gonna do the boss now. I don't care. I'll be fine. Alright. Send me a Polaroid picture. I could, I could, I, I actually could put out sexy Polaroids and sell those too. Shady bagged milk. <laughs> See, the problem with that is I'd have to make it myself. And I, I know I'm not even trying to sound wrong with that. I just couldn't resell another product. You know what I'm saying? Anyways, here you go. Here's the boss. You guys are all taking guesses on it. Let's see what it is. Also, we joked about it being an amalgamation of normal life as a whole, like as a living being. So, um, here you go. I hope Noma doesn't see this. She'll judge me. I know she will. But here you go. Time to ranch cow shady. I'm saying I got to set up that farm, Luna.
See, it's just a worm. Literally just a worm. Thank you for the gift sub to Noma Live. What the hell? It's real, real. Thank you for the gift sub, but also what? Oh my god. Thank you all so much for the support tonight, actually. Yeah, it's just worm. Or is it? It's Verm. This is one of my favorite bosses. You'll see why. But there you go. More feel. Yeah, it's Wiglet. Anyways, let's go. This is kind of, you know, it kind of plays out. It, it, it's a play on words on the Morpha thing as well. A boss from Water Temple in, uh, in, uh, oh, in Ocarina of Time. But also, oh my god, please. Stop! But also, the fight kind of plays like it. It's more feel time. I don't want it, to... It's morbing. Oh my god, please, I gotta take off the boots! Wait, I forgot the button! Oh no, thank you for the kiss up to O-Worm on God. Okay. Okay, well, we're already almost dead, so this is gonna be a great fight. That's cool. That's cool. I'm not mad. Alright. I never get mad at video games, chat. I never get mad over anything. Smile. You guys have never heard me irritated. No, let me pull it. <laughs> Worm! <laughs> I'm dead. I actually died. Amazing. Hero mode throw hands. That wasn't even Hero mode's fault, by the way. That was just me. Hmm. Let's try again. I'll eat another kiwi for good luck. Three hearts, no problem. This is what they meant by horse re rewormer? Oh my god, it, yeah! This is the horse rewormer! Oh my god, it reworms your horse! Alright, let's get in there. <laughs> I think I know what I gotta do. Oh yeah, the choo-choos would be back too, you're right. I could get potions, but this will be fine. I'll, I'll, I'll be fine with this. It's not your fault, Shady. It's mine for believing in you. <laughs> Absolutely messed up. <laughs> Okay, chat, I'm doing my bestest around here. I'm doing amazing, okay? Okay? Looking at pictures, I kind of want to try canned bread. What? I'm done with this, chat. My horse is feeling pretty wormed right now. <laughs> Toby. Oh my god. Tobernicus, please. Eel. Is that supposed to be for an eel? Oh my, I hate that. But thank you for the gift, so thank you. Okay, I'm doing- I'm doing it now. You're doing great? I- Thank you, Nyx. I'm gonna do it this time. I think I know what I was doing wrong. <laughs> I have to swim to the tentacle instead of standing here faffing about and then having him grab me. Let me be smart this time. Here, I was thinking- Oh yeah, easy boss, because Nintendo, right? No, I got this. Okay, that eyeball's gonna appear somewhere. Remember how I said it's one of my favorite bosses? I take it back. I take it back now. No, Midna. I don't want to hear it, Midna. I don't want to hear it from you. I want to hear it from you. I like you. You're cool. Looks like the eyeball is pretty important to him. See if you can't ZL. Okay, thank you, Mimir. <laughs> I see you all laughing. <laughs> I'm definitely not going to cry. I definitely won't. Not like it affects me, you know? It's whatever. Oh, I can do it while flying. Gangster. Okay, I got it this time. Don't you worry, chat. This is it. I'm gonna target it. No, you don't. I'm getting out of that. You absolute bastard! No! No! I can do this. How am I doing this so bad? I don't think I've ever had problems with this fight before. This might be the first time ever that I'm having issues with this. I need a minute. I need a minute. Okay, here we go. Yeah, can bread K. You want some? <laughs> Okay. Not what I meant to do. Hold up. Let me back up a bit. Okay, I can do this. It's just a dumb eyeball chat. Come on. Got you, you little bastard. Come on. Come on. Oh my god, really? <laughs> what are you doing? What are you doing? No. Ah, that's fine. I can deal with that. That's easy. Come here. Come here, little scrimblows. More like you scrimblow, like you suck. 
Like, you, you, you're terrible. I hate you. They can't see. See, they, they're not even doing anything. They're just, they're just vibing. Let me just grab the eye. That's not the eye, Link! You fool! Link! It was right there, buddy. Buddy, you were so close. Anyways, this is what normal life feels like. <laughs> that part was still accurate, I will say. You can you can hit the tentacles. I'm an idiot. I forgot you can do that. No wonder. No wonder I was like, why is it suddenly hard? Just hit the tentacle. I'm... Wow. Shady, please. What is wrong with me today? <laughs> what is wrong with me today? <laughs> okay. I looked over in chat and someone said canonical milk. No! Ah, oh, damn it. Excuse you, normal live is amazing. I get paid in head pads. <laughs> exactly. You don't get food, Justice. You're going to die. Is this also including weaponized babies? It has to be. It has to be. Come here. Get over here. There we go. Oh my god. No, leave me alone. Okay, cool. Thank you, cutscene. Anyways, that actually wasn't the part that I liked. I lied. It's not a bulbous mouth. It's actually... <laughs> it's actually this. No one said eel, but hey, if you said big jelly, why not? This thing is terrifying, but I love it. Let's do it. Rest in peace, Buffcat. Buffcat's dead now? Alright, worm time. I guess I wasn't lying about worm. It's just, it was a bigger worm. That's not the worm. That's not the worm. The Alaskan bullworm. I was just fighting its tongue. Thank you for the gifts of the O worm again. Another O worm. Hell yeah. Thank you. Also, this part is sick. Look at this. Look at this. Yes. Yes. Come on. See, Breath of the Wild is my favorite game, but can you do that? Can you ride an eel in the water and smash its eyeball? I want to see shit like this in Tears of the Kingdom. It's so pog. It's so good. All right, let's go again. Let's go again. All right, asshole. All right, asshole. For all the death and all the goddamn grabbies, you're going down, fool. You're going down. Think I'm going to give something to you, wifey. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. Come on. All right, we, we got we to gotta gank it, as the kids say. I don't even know what that means, but I'm going to gank it right now. Check it out. Yeah. Come on. Come on. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. Okay. All right. Link. Link. Come on. All right, it's fine. It's fine. Gank? I don't know. It's some kind of League of Legends thing. <laughs> I think it means, like, flanking, but not really. All right. One of the most ep uh, yes, more epic boss fights in... T yeah, right? This shit's hype. And it only gets... It gets even crazier than this in this game. Whoa! I didn't know you were eating! I didn't know you were trying to go for a snack! Jesus! I love this horror music, by the way. It's so good. Oh, God. Okay. This might... This could actually still be a close one, huh? I was shit-talking, but this could be bad. Got you. I got you. Come on. Come on. Finish him. Finish him. Yes, Link. Oh, my God. That felt good. Get your ass out of here. Dumb eel. Such a cool fight, though. God damn. Anyways, play this game. <laughs> Hero mode More like zero mode Sorry, I can't Eel Your Feelings anymore Got him Looks like I Sealed the eel Got him um, um, looks like he was not the real deal. Got him. Congrats. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Think he's ealing down. God damn it. You're not supposed to have a better one than me, chat. <laughs> the seal the eel is like a four to ten. I hate you all. There it is. The last few shadow. I'll just take that. Thanks. Now, don't resent me for all I put you through. I need this thing. Besides, we have to do something about Xanth, the one who thinks he's the King of Shadows. His power is a false one. I'll prove it using these. Get ready for a bunch of lore, by the way. You're gonna have a fun time here. 
it's it's a time after this if I if I'm recalling the right thing. So I've done everything I needed to. I'm sorry for dragging you all over the place with me. I don't know why I said it like that. Sorry for dragging you all over the place with me. She apologized. That's a start. She didn't necessarily want to put us through this. Ah, uh, no worries at all. Take off. You have to go straight to bed. No worries. Have yourself a damn good night. I, I always appreciate people coming by and saying hey. And I hope you enjoyed the webcomic you're reading. Lower time. They're not feeling well anymore. You know, even as something as basic and amazing as that would have worked so good. And I just didn't do it. You know what? Just for that, I'm taking some water. I'm taking some of that eel water. Never mind. I know, I know someone chat wanted it. All right, here we go. The boss in this dungeon doesn't seem like it was a deformed enemy like the two dungeon monsters. What is Morpheal? Morpheal's a messed up eel. It's a it's a morphed eel. <laughs> I hope that helps. Want to go outside? Are you all done here? <laughs> no, but that I'm pretty sure it's just that. I'm pretty sure it's just that. It could even be one of those bomb fishes that got messed up since it spawns them. The eel ate the few shadow. Yeah. Morbeal. I was waiting for a Morbius joke in there. I showed it. Yeah, no worries at all, take off. You come whenever you feel comfortable to get in here, and you're always welcome. Have yourself a damn good night, dude. I missed 10 seconds ago when this didn't exist. <laughs> get ready for. <gasps> Oh, shit. It's never good to meet the big bad early in the game. Come on, Snake. Do something. P please. Oh, my God. One shot kill, mind you. Or fade away, but still one shot. Oh, no. Not the twilight again. Yeah, it's not. This is. This isn't looking good. Ah, oh, shit, wolf. I'm giving him serious voice for now, because I'm sure that's how he's trying to show himself right now. Uh, <laughs> it's just gonna sound like me for now. Did you honestly mean to take an ancient and withered power like this and turn it against me? You are a foolish traitor, Midna. Why do you defy your king? My king? You, who do nothing but abuse magic of your tribe? You must be joking! How dare you? Are you implying that my power is our old magic? Is it not? Now that is a joke! Oh my god, leave her alone, holy shit! This power is granted to me by my god! It is the magic of the King of Twilight, and you will respect it. His god, huh? Um... What did you just implant into my brain? <laughs> my Midna, did you forget? That beast is one of the Light Dwellers who oppressed our people. No matter how much you may desire otherwise, you will never be more than a shadow in their world. You cannot consort with their kind. But if we can make their world ours, Midna, light and darkness will meet at last. Our tribe will take back their realm, and sweet darkness will blot out this harsh light. And that, Midna, is why. Ugh! I need you. <laughs> Zan! Oh my god! Yeah, there's a freaky face in there. Thank you for the kiss of the brain shard. Dear lord. Not just for me, but for all our people. Lend me your power. <laughs> Yeah, he's pretty freaky. Not like, not even like the Girahim level freaky. He's just freaky freaky. Thank you for brain rock. You guys had the same brain. So be it. I'll return you to the light world, you covet. Covet? Covet. Why is he so slobbery? <laughs> Dirty man. I don't remember any of this.
I... Did you just make her get eaten by the light spirit? Oh no, just... Pretty sure that's like poison for her. That was a good song though, but Jesus. This dude's kind of, You can see he's kind of an asshole. Like a big asshole. Oh wait, where... Oh no, he might have just teleported us out. Actually, the snake might have pulled through. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. Thank you. Thank you, snake. No problem. Hell yeah. Yeah, this isn't good. How are we not human? Why are we not human, chat? Link, hero chosen by... Reverb. <laughs> hero chosen by the goddesses. Goes to the princess locked away in the castle. That princess holds the key that can unlock you from your shadow form. Yeah, this song's a big deal for a lot of Zelda fans. This is, some people call this one of the best Zelda songs ever made. And I agree. This song is really nice, so uh, I will stay a little more quiet for this part. God damn it, enemies. Don't ruin it. Don't ruin it. <laughs> never mind. You're not going to hear it. You're never going to hear the song. Sorry to say. Here you go. While it's raining, too. Like, this part is amazing. But also, Midna's dying, so we kind of got to hurry. Oh, God. Sorry. I'm trying to avoid the enemies and give you guys music. It's like you'll know our names in Xenoblade. Absolutely. Just getting cut off. I hate it. <laughs> Here you go. This is Midna's theme, by the way. This song is called Midna's Lament, by the way, to anyone who want to, like... To any people who want to uh, go and listen to this on their own. It's really, really damn good. Gosh, that's so pretty. It's super pretty. It, it, the chord progression gets crazier, too. Like here... Come on! Where was there even an enemy? This part where it rises, chromatically. So good. So good. It's no Song of Storms. Yeah, this is better. <laughs> In my opinion. And I love Song of Storms. But I like this one more. Way more. But it's really, it's really, really good. Very, very good song. Oh! Don't be scared, I'm just a dog. Why, why are you afraid of dog? I guess I'm a, I, I'm a big wolf. Yo, Snowy. What's going on? Thanks so much for the raid. I hope you had a good stream. And uh, hello, hello everyone. Welcome to Zelda stream. We're in a pretty pivotal moment. As you see, I have a small friend dying on my back. It's not fun. But this, this music's amazing. But hi, Snowy. I hope you had a good time. Uh, what are you up to, if you don't mind me asking? Um, I really do appreciate the raid, though, and I hope you had a great stream. Can I just go straight to the castle? I don't think I can. But um, I hope you're all doing well, and I hope you had a good time. Yo, thank you. Yo, we got mods doing the shoutouts now. Hell yeah. <laughs> I forgot y'all could just do that. Some Overwatch? Oh, hell yeah. I hope you uh, uh, got, the, got the rank up, or whatever it's called. I, I think I made this joke the last time you played Overwatch. <laughs> But I hope, you had a, I hope you had some good games. Um, but yeah, thank you and welcome everyone. I'm Shady Cicada. I'm a variety streamer. I play just about anything. I'm mostly a fan of Nintendo stuff, but I play whatever. My favorite series ever are Zelda and Xenoblade. And my full-time job is video game music composer slash YouTuber. And this. So if any of that sounds like a stand your alley, feel free to stick around. If not, thanks for coming and saying hey. Always appreciate you. Also, th there, this is a cat stream. There's a lot of little kibbies here. So that's a good thing too. I don't know how to... I don't know how to, uh, get to the castle. <laughs> I, I, like, I'm here, but I know that's not the way. How, what's the other way to the castle? There was an underground route. Where was that? Maybe the cats will tell me, actually. They can talk, right? If you don't know about this town, you should ask Louise at Telma's. Oh, the big fat cat! Okay, hang on, hang on. The chubby cat. Hang on, hang on, hang on. My rotund little friend who was like staring me down. Let's see. Stop screaming! I'm just a little dog. I'm a little. I'm, I am literally friend shaped. 
I can't believe the kibbies help. <laughs> Ribbit, normally I live in an underground passageway, but I came out because of the good weather. Have you ever been below this town? It's really spacious. After all, the underground passage was made so that Hyrule soldiers could escape. Ribbit. <laughs> Quality voice acting. Yeah. Not fat, she's just fluffy. I didn't say fat, I said rotund. Listen, listen. No, but, but but for real. But for real. If they got a lot of fluff, to me, they are a big cat. And I love them for it. Let's see. They're highly oopy phobic. I know, why do they hit on the oopy so much? There we go. Maybe I shouldn't be taking my time here. Yeah, you know what? Let's go to the bar really quickly. Oh, wait. They might not like me in there. This might be a, sneak, a sneaky way in. Yeah, I don't know why they don't like the oopy. Can we go through there? No. Maybe I do just go through the front door like a just, just like an idiot. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's check it out. My cat is also big. Then hell yeah, beast, get out. Oh, okay, never mind. Yo, what do you mean you're gonna kick the dog? Okay, fine. You there? Oh wait, this is the cat, isn't it? <laughs> Look at them. I love them. That is that is a that is a that is a friend shape. You're Link, correct? They know. They, they, they know what I'm cooking. Hmm, yes, I thought so. I could just tell, you know. You hear them as a southern lady? I'm Louise. Do you remember meeting me in this shop before? Though I don't think we were properly introduced like that. <laughs> in any case, I must tell you. I'm a bit puzzled on why you look like that. Really, dear, you can't blame the humans for tossing you out the way you look. <laughs> oh, another patient. You certainly are a curious sort. Please. Princess Zelda. Do they know? <laughs> they know! This way. You like that? <laughs> Probably meant more of the classy Southern Belle accent. Ah, shit, I can't do that one. <laughs> you guys get the silly. You guys get the silly one. Here, get in through the window. I'll make it even so. The attic is connected to the castle's waterway. An old waterway though so it could be a rough trip <laughs> well i suppose that's uh i suppose that's left to do all that's left to do is to make sure the humans don't notice you <laughs> southern bell i'm so sorry i gave you just like full south <laughs> i gave you the south south damn oh hey by the way chat i'm getting a new phone tomorrow after like four years, I decided to upgrade because my Pixel 3a is finally like the battery's finally dying out, and I'm like, you know, this one comes with that little stylus, and I could use that to use uh, Cubase on my phone because there is a Cubase for mobile, and I can make music in bed and stuff, and it would run it. But also because the phone is just really nice and the camera's really good, I got the uh, the uh, Samsung the S22 Ultra, which yes, pricey ass phone, but traded in. What? What was that sound? Um, oh my god. I actually had to convince myself so much, like, it's so hard to get it. Like, my, my mom was like, get it, go enjoy your life, like, just, just get it. And I was like, but do I need it? And even Nomo was like, get it, get it, get it. And I was like, on the, the buy page until like, four in the morning, and then I was like, okay, fine, I'll just do it. That vase with 200 rupees? That's ah, fine. It's fine. Oh god, I forgot about all of this. Got a, I, and I, yeah, I got like a little tripod for it for like little videos I might want to do when I don't have my camera around. How do I put on my senses again? All right, never mind. I was using the D-pad like I was playing on the Wii for some reason. Finish him! Mmm! Delicious ball. Got it. Poo? Wait, what? My phone is going on six years old now. I feel that. I usually wait till my phones are that old too, but I was like, screw it. Let me just get the phone. I hear it's amazing. I've seen amazing things. I did like a lot of research and I was like, yeah, this is the one. I was going to get the flip, but then I was like, nah. Oh, thanks for beating the ghost. Can I call you doggy? I don't know what this voice is. I'm so sorry. I'm Giovanni. I was be I've become... <laughs> I became consumed by greed long ago and sold my soul to a dark creature that did this to me. It's so hard to read this. Like, I can't I can't do the... I keep hearing Midna in the left of my ear and it is sensory overload. I can't move. I can't go see my girlfriend. My pet cat, Gangle is frozen on my head. I don't think I could be more miserable. Oh my god, your cat is frozen on your head. The Midas touch. I have a favor to ask you, doggy. Can you find and defeat 20 ghosts that lurk in the dark for me? 
If you can free the pieces of my soul from the ghosts that hold them, I'll be free. Oh, but it's raining out now, so I don't think you can go outside directly. I'll open a door to the underground waterway for you. It's in the chest. How did you do that? You can't... You know what? It's okay. Thank you, Giovanni. Once the rain stops, you can come back in here by digging <clears throat> around the front wall where the cats gather. Understand, doggy? Okay. I wish I could do Luigi from TV show. I can't do impressions that well, chat. Not good at it. I wish. I wish. Oh my god, please. Get in there, Link. You have to. You must. Get, go, Link. The cat takes priority. True. We, we'll, we'll save the cat. Maybe. Maybe not. <laughs> Side quests on a stream? I don't know. Maybe. Okay, I don't like these big swimming rats that bite me. I do like rats and mice. I think they're cute, but like... Nah, man. Not these, not these big ones swimming around trying to give you plague. I know these ones have plague. I just... I feel it. I feel it. Back to some crazy good music, though. Okay. What's next? Skull, skulltulas, skulltulas, skulltulas. I feel like that's all like a Brooklyn man would say. It. He's like, yeah, my son had to fight these spiders in his Mario game or something. Skulltulas. I don't know. The freakiest, the freakiest shit though. If they were real, let me tell you. Let me tell you. You know. I have to stick. They question where their friend is, knowing, not knowing they'd be turned to gold. Oh, the cats do that. They question where their cat friend is, and it's that cat. I didn't know about that. That's interesting. Damn. Also, random nostalgia moment. I, I, I just had a flashback. I remember the last time I streamed this game, and I remember being in this exact room. And I'll tell you why. Because... <laughs> I, when I, I was going to a convention the next day, and I remember it was my first convention where I was meeting internet friends, and I was kind of excited but also nervous. And um, so I was streaming to, like, you know, do that. And then when I went the next day and I met Jules, he was like, yeah, I was watching your Twilight Princess stream last night. And, like, some of, my, some of the other music friends, too, were like, yeah, yeah, we were checking you out, like, before the, the convention and stuff. And um, it was this specific area right here. It was very fun, though. That Oopy got a stick on fire. That Oopy is a menace. Arson. You're telling stories, I remember, too. Yeah. Good times. Good times. That's not... That's nothing, right? Okay. I lit these torches. What am I doing? Is there a torch I'm not seeing? Am I... Am I... Am I blind gaming again? Yo, Maniacal Gamer with the raid. Hello, this looks like a good place to find some lucky emblems. Alright, what are lucky emblems from? I, at first I thought I thought this was like a fire emblem thing, but I know I I know I know I'm capping here. But hello, Maniacal Gamer, thank you so much for the raid once again. Always love it to have you here. Welcome everyone. I'm Shady Takeda, I'm a variety streamer. I play lots of things. Xenoblade and Zelda are my favorite series ever. I love Nintendo stuff, but I play whatever's fun. My full-time job is video game composer slash uh, YouTuber uh, and streamer. If that, any of that sounds like it's down your alley, feel free to stick around. And uh, if not, thanks for coming and saying hey. Thank you for the shout out, by the way. My Nickel Gamer is also very pog. I'm pre honestly, anyone who, anyone who raids me is, is pretty much damn pog. I don't think anyone malicious has ever raided me. So <laughs> please go check them out. They are fantastic. And they always show up with a unique raid message. And it's always really fun. And I always try to figure it out. So you're playing my favorite Zelda. It's a fantastic one. It used to be my favorite too. Until Breath of the Wild. But even now, like, this is still one of my favorite games of all time. So, uh, I'm glad, I'm glad you like it too. You have a good taste, my man. Kingdom Hearts 3 is what, is what the game is. Okay, that's what Lucky Emblems are from. I, w my guess was going to be like a Tales of game. I never played those, but I remember, um, my god. I picked up a, a, a an item called the Lemon in, like, Tales of Symphonia, I think, when I played, like, a tiny bit of it. And the picture was a strawberry. And to this day, I still laugh about it. It was just like, you have lemon. Strawberry. Oh, wait a second. I think I know what I got to do here. There we go. But also remember, uh, remember not to backseat unless I ask chat. So please, if you can, do not tell me what to do in the game. Um, I will ask you if I need it. But I do appreciate you trying to help. Everyone. 
There we go. You take photos and get rewarded. Uh, wait. Oh, basically, Mickey Mouse marked his territory everywhere, and people think it brings good luck. When you say marks his territory everywhere, what the... What the... Uh, what do you mean? Because my my immediate... And it's probably not the right way to think about it, but I'm thinking... I mean, I'm playing as a dog right now. So, of course, I'm thinking Mickey pissed everywhere. Hidden Mickeys. Okay, so he did... <laughs> Mickey didn't piss all over the realm of Kingdom Hearts 3. Okay, gotcha. I'm a simple man. I see Wolvie. I cheer. Hell yeah. Thank you so much for the bits, dude. I very much appreciate it. Devil Hunter Wolf. And, uh, yes. I absolutely... Love... Love... Wolf Link, Love Link. Love Link's a whole different type of thing. Wolf Link gives me a uh, great uh, opium. Not opium, Jesus Christ. What is my words tonight? Uh, serotonin? Dopamine, dopamine. Opium. Opium. Good one, Shady. Marks his territory. <laughs> oh, I pissed everywhere. It's like. Uh, <laughs> great. Love it. Maybe I gotta play Kingdom Hearts. Mmm! <laughs> Can I finish? I can't finish him. Dopium. That's what I'm on right now. Jeez. I never fully woke up from that nap, did I? <laughs> Wolf Link's uh, my dealer. He gives me opium. No. No. You still haven't seen the end of that game? Uh, what? Kingdom Hearts 3? Oh! You know what? I'm not dealing with it. If I jump attack him, I'm leaving. Oh, God. No, wait. Stop. <sighs> all right. All right. All right. If you, if, you, if you want to play like that, little man, we'll play like that. We'll play like that. But yeah, welcome nonetheless to lads coming on in. That Mickey impression, it's pretty bad. It's pretty bad. I can't Mickey for the life of me. I can go, ho oh, oh. That's it. That's, that doesn't sound like him. All right, I was trying to do a Midna move, and I'm like, wait, Midna's dying. Oh, no. We better hurry. Oopy with the oopium. The puppyum. I still, listen, I still think selling dog food containers called Pupperware is an amazing idea, okay? I don't care what anyone says. I know it's still just normal Tupperware, but it could be shaped like a, a dog bone, and then you put treats in it, and it's Tupperware. I don't know. I think that's great. Mickey is sus. He's pretty damn sus, but thank you for the sub. <laughs> Very much appreciated. True. You see? You see? People agree. That that That's one of my two business ideas. By the way, if you make it, you have to give me uh, half of all the money. If it, if, it, if it ends up being a success, you have to give me half the money. Not legally binded, but uh, f friend friendly binded. You would do that, right, Chet? That sounds amazing. Wait till you hear about the micro rave. That one's my worst idea, but also people like it. <laughs> okay. Okay. My my. <gasps> no, it's taken. God damn it! All right. Well, I might as well just say the other thing. Then if Pupper wears a goddamn sub. They, you know what? They don't know. They, they they still don't know. They don't know. But also, thank you so much for the gifts up. I very much appreciate that. So, the micro rave... The micro rave is a microwave, but when you put the when you put the food in, um, instead of just a normal light, it's got, like, party lights, and you can put music on it so it plays whatever music you want while it warms up your food. With, like, fancy lights and shit. That's it. You can play, like, Doom in there if you wanted to. If you're, like, I don't know. Nuking some chicken. I don't know. Burn! No! 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 You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Those are my only two business ideas for products ever, ever created. Also, thank you so much for the hype train again. Wait, what the hell? Chat. Do they? Did they take boost train away from me? Wait, why? Wait, why would they do that? What? What did I do? Was that just a test feature? Did it not work out? Why is it not a boost train anymore? That's a shame. Was it a boost train earlier? Boost train is random. For us, it was a boost train every single time since it started. But all right, that's fine. Whatever. Hey, it's still a hype train. That's still whack that you guys even start that. So thank you so much for fueling any of a hype train. Once again, you never have to do it. But thank you so much. It does go a long way for me. And um, yeah. Are we supposed to go fast now? I'm saying. Yeah, the first one I think was a boost train. So maybe they don't do more than one anymore. Um, But yeah. Oh my god, the guard. Do you think he's here? Who dares disturb my... Nah, okay. I, I think... I think yeah, careful. I'm being... Yeah, I think he's sleeping. Let's not wake him up. Oh shit, we could do more Minecraft. I don't know why I thought of that. Oh, because... 
We're in the goddamn Poripe area. The warden. Thank you for the gift sub to no more hype. It's always hype. Even if we fill one level, I'll go I'll go hurt. I promise I'll do that. I'll put a, I'll do it with reverb. But also thank you. Oh hell yeah, banger song right here. Oh my god. Wait, anonymous gifter? I'm, I I have to let this slide because these are gonna come on during the cutscene. It goes one by one for anonymous gifters. But thank you so much for the five gift subs. Well now I have to do the sound. <laughs> If it beats another level, I'll be even worse. But thank you so much for the five gift subs, Anonymous Gifter. That is insane. I very much appreciate it. Colored green. That's funny. I feel like we gift subbed that person once. But uh, thank you so, so much for that. I very much appreciate it. And with after the last sub here, we're going to go back to it. I just don't want to get in front of the... Uh, you know, I mean, if you do sub during the cutscene, that's fine too, by the way. I just wanted to make sure these go, all go through one by one. All right. Please, please tell me how do we break the curse on this one. This is the one. You need him to save your world. That's why, Princess. Please, you must help Link. Thank you for the gifts of Tomaniacal Gamer, by the way. Devil Hunter Wolf. They very much deserve it. They are very pog. And uh, thank you so much for doing that. Thank you for no more boost as well. Hell yeah. Oh my god, are you sensing the... She, she feels the Triforce energy. What binds him is a different magic uh, than what transformed him when he first passed the Curtain of Twilight. It is an evil power. It's that thing in my brain, isn't it? Look at me pretending like I don't know. Our world is one of balance, just as there is light to drive away darkness, so too is there benevolence to banish evil. Head for the sacred grove that lies deep within the land, guarded by the spirit Farron. Oh, you're gonna love this segment, by the way. Uh, there, there you will find the Blade of Evil's Bane that was crafted by the wisdom of the ancient sages, the Master Sword. Yup! We're doing this, finally. The Master Sword is a sacred blade that evil can never touch. Evil cloaks you like a dark veil, and that blade is the only thing that can cleave it. Oh shit, you're almost, you guys are close to a level two. Thank you so much for Midnight Twilight, Midnight Twilight Princess, who, by the way, best character. Thank you for that. You guys are going, thank you so much for all the gift subs, really, chat. Link, hero sent by the goddesses. Thank you for the $3. Please do that wed delay again. That was beautiful. If we hit level two, I'll go even crazier with it. But you know what? Just for you, Sanj, I will do one just for you as well. In a minute. Thank you so much. Like you, I've been granted special powers by the goddesses. Fine. Like, you can... You can get to the woods on your own, right? Oh god, we gotta do it without Midna? Princess, I have one last request. Thank you for Midna Gaming T Twitch TV. Jesus Christ, thank you, chat. Oh my god. And the gifts up to level 2 from Silver. Thank you, guys. Holy shit. Well, now I'm gonna do it. But just now, just now. Can you tell him where to find the Mirror of Twilight? I'll tell you what. If you, if you get to level 3, I'll give you another one that's even worse, worse. But thank you so much. Oh my god, Midna. Oh, whoa. Well, thank you. Midna, I believe I understand now just who and what you are. So she doesn't even know what Midna was before this. But also the Mirror of Twilight, huh? What's that all about, I wonder? Despite your mortal injuries, you act in our stead. These dark times are the result of our deeds, yet it is you who have reaped the penalty. Oh? Accept this now, Midna. I pass it to you. Wait. What are you doing? What are you doing? Why is the music getting pog? Don't you dare give subs in. No, Link, stop her! Give something Zant, how dare you, after what he did, but thank you. And that's it. Goodbye, Zelda. <laughs> how, how many of you didn't play this game see that coming? Clearly she sees Midna as someone incredibly important enough to do that. We can fix him. You can't fix Zant. That dude, that dude is, that dude is messed up hardcore. We go back, Link. Back to Farron Woods. Thank you for the gifts up to Zell Dead. Oh, I hate you. I hate you. <laughs> Zelda, I've taken all that you had to give, though I did not want it. 
Yeah. Pretty rough, right? Pretty rough. This game's dark, man. Midna, best goblin. Also true. All very much agreed. Thank you so much for the gift sub. All right, we got two Wes for level two and Sanji's donation. Because donations will count too. Why not? Oh, shit. A barrier. Hang on. We're not done yet. Did our boy put that up? Well, they took the castle. <laughs> the poor cat's inside. Oh god, you're right. Well, if, if we do it for anything, we're doing it for the cats too. Well, Zelda Gun is only a matter of time. True. True. Can't have shit in Hyrule. We literally can't have Hyrule in Hyrule with the way that uh, these enemies treat us. All right, here you go. Wait. No, sorry. I mean, wait. Wait. There you go. I'll go even crazier than that somehow if we hit level 3. But thank you so much for the gifts up to Midna Wife. <laughs> Very much appreciate it. I appreciate all of you. Thank you all so much for the support. For real, for real. Like, I, I absolutely... It always means a lot, as I always say. And it does help me continue doing what I love. And you guys are all very pog. Thank you for just being lovely lads. And lasses. And all in between. Ugh. Got the pig. What? Wow, One-shot pig kill. Okay, it's in Farron. So we gotta go this way. Going back home. Shady, where does Midna place in your short stack tier list? I... Huh? <laughs> I do not have a short stack tier list. But I guess she would have to be number one because she is just like one of my favorite video game characters. But uh, that is a question. That is a question. Oop. <laughs> Sometimes I love this chat. Sometimes I, 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 I never love this chat. I want to disown this chat. But at the same time, no, you guys are great. But also thank you for the gift sub to Oopy. That's that's a good one. Quality Oopy shit right there. Oh, we can teleport. We have Minda, don't we? How about the Tall Queen tier list? Two. So, uh, right, so S tier. Right after Rosalina. In fact, sometimes it might even be better than Rosalina. I don't want to spoil anything, but I know what you're alluding to. And I, yeah, that. Yo, Virtual Master, think of Switch to the Raid, dude. I very, very much appreciate it. Hope you had a good stream. Is this the Dark Zelda? It, one of many, but it is the it is the dark uh, atmosphere one, indeed. And it's really, really good. Hope you had a good stream, dude. Good to see you, as always. I'm going to heal up right here real quick. Actually, you know what, chat? I, I think I'm going to go grab those Reese's Pieces. I... I'm, 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 I'm ready for it. But also, thank you guys for feeling a hype train. I very much appreciate that. That was a second one tonight, and you guys are very lovely. Um, okay, look, uh, look, look at, look at Midna really quickly. And I'm gonna go grab, I'm gonna go grab it. Actually, you know what? No, I'm gonna put the BRB screen for VOD, so I know when to cut this out. Give me, like, two seconds. I'm gonna go grab it real quick. Let me get my Reese's Pieces. Be good. Chat can't hear me right now, but they're great. I lied, you can hear me. Hang on. So the snack bop top, also welcome. The snack was kiwis. But now I have Reese's pieces and plantain chips. Probably gonna do the I don't know what I'm I don't know what I'm doing first. Definitely not at the same time though. Thank you for the gifts up the streamer gone, by the way. <laughs> oh my god. Welcome back. Let me open up this Reese piece real quick. Hang on. I can play I can play while I open this. I can play with, with one hand. Here I go. 
Did anyone hear something? Are you guys trying to pretend like I'm not here? I swear to God. But also, thank you for the gifts up to River Frico. I very much appreciate that. Thank you so much for the gifts up to Streamer Back. What the hell? Y'all are y'all are on some absolute sauce. It is goaded, but you're on it. But what is that emote helm? I love that. What is that? Is it just a lad with a thumbs up? Just nice. I like that. <laughs> Welcome on in. I hope you're doing well. I have a question on behalf of Virtual. Oh, sure. Oh, is Virtual gone? Yeah, uh, go ahead. Uh, feel free. Feel free. Can't wait for Shady to get back. I swear to God, Chet. Hang on. Hang on. I'm unraveling this Reese piece. One thing I don't like about certain chocolates is that they wrap it so much where it's like, this is unnecessary wrapping. There's way too much. Never to guess up the Reese pieces. Very much appreciate it. Oh my God, it's all the... It's all the old rage emotes. Jesus Christ, the rage comics. That is wild. Who is Poripe? Oh boy. Chat. How do I even begin to tell them about Poripe? The legend. The absolute legend that is Poripe. I'll make this... You know what? Okay. Here, here, I'll, I'll do it in the best way possible. Or, or the most concise way. I had a dream. I had a very, very dumb dream. My dreams are really weird. But I had this one dream that there was this Minecraft player named Poripe. And he he was a farming Minecraft. Like, he, he only did farming in Minecraft, but he was the best one. And he would make... He, he made a mod called... <laughs> you know what? I literally just have the notes. He made a mod called Life on the Farm. Where you just... Where it's only farming in Minecraft. And then he, um, the other thing he did, it, it gets stupid. It gets stupid near the end. He would make entire overworlds, like just a big flat overworld, like the size of like a gigantic flat overworld and just make it all farmland. And he made a few of those. And then when he was done with them, he'd like stack them one atop each other just to like store them somewhere. And, um, he thought he was going to like, thank you for the resub to Poripe, by the way. He's probably like, what, two, two, three months now. Thank you. Um... He, he was going to put walls around all the stacks to make a farm world lasagna. This, it, once again, it makes no sense. It's a dumbass dream. And um, so he's going to close it off, make like a lasagna out of it, just to put them away somewhere, which we got fan art of, which is stupid. But um, I love it. And, uh, and then the last thing I put in my notes from that dream is that Attack on Titan, the final part of Attack on Titan Season 4 is going to take place on one of those lands because people started buying his farmlands for set pieces in uh, animes and movies and games. Which makes no sense because it's a goddamn Minecraft overworld. <laughs> but that's it. So he just became like a, a farming legend around here. I'm liking Poripe. He's pretty cool. We also have the ghost of Poripe. The ghost of Poripe is less nice, but Poripe Poripe, he's cool. We have a lot of fan art of him and his farmland lasagna. I think we even have Attack on Titan taking place on the thing art. <laughs> there we go. Get his ass. That was a dream you had? Oh, I have a million dreams like that. I was literally telling Chad about the one today where I was in a real life water dungeon doing an IRL stream through a contact lens for you all to solve the puzzles. And Noma was there and had to do uh, a photo shoot to get us in the next room. That was the puzzle. She had to pose for photo shoots for a photographer, and he would open the door for us. So, um, it was interesting. It was interesting. That was just from that. By the way, that was the nap that made me start my stream late. Because I stream, like, I was dreaming that I was streaming. So I was like, oh, I already started. And then I woke up and I was like, wait, what the hell? <laughs> just slept on my alarm. I don't, I don't know. I don't know how it was possible, but hey. Wish I had dreams like that. I, so I pretty much like 90% of the time I never have dreams. Like nothing's ever vivid. It's mostly because of the sleep deprivation shit. Uh, but when I do finally get like a good sleep, I end up getting one of those dreams. Is it the golden kiwi? Yeah, it's the golden one. And it was really good, Bop Top. My mom lo does this lovely thing. It, it's a parent thing. Where like you tell them you like something and then they go and buy like 50 of it sometimes. So I'll be like, yeah, I really like those kiwis. She's like, oh, and you're working out, right? I'm like, yeah. I look in the fruit bowl. There are fruits under there, but the whole top layer is all just mass amounts of kiwis. And I'm just like, oh god, I have to finish all this now. <laughs> but it tastes really good, so I'm not complaining. But oh my god. This is so good. Gold, go, yeah, golden kiwi fruit's amazing, dude. Absolutely, Sanj. 
I don't know what that was. It's I was trying to go. I was trying to like do a, a bird noise, but I can't again. It's rough having to watch a shop in this unpopular part of town. It's not even a part of town, but oh, poor bird. And I stole his shit. Oh well. Oh hey, it's the monkey girl. She can talk now, probably, right? Because we're a wolf. Oh. That's not good. What the hell? Oh, I forgot about these fools. Jeez. Sheesh. All right, hold up. I got you. I got you. Don't worry about it. Monkey. Monkey. I'm gonna have another Reese. Hang on. Did, did you save me? Thank you. Listen, since you're so nice, let me tell you something. <clears throat> there's a really, uh, there's a really pretty wooded area on the other side of this cliff. I climbed over there, but when I tried to get deeper into the woods, those guys attacked me. What's in those woods anyway? Oh, I, well, to people who know about Ocarina of Time and don't know about this game too much, you might enjoy this next area. So there's another section of forest beyond this cliff. All right, Link, let's go. Thank you for the gifts of the monkey girl weirdo. She's not weird. In fact, she's probably one of the more sane characters in this goddamn game. But also, thank you for the gifts, I appreciate it. I'll tell you what, she's way less weird than the goddamn kids. Those are some weirdos, let me tell you. And Baby Mallow? Actually, Baby Mal is one of the most normal, but he's also kind of like a gatekeeping... He sounds like a gatekeeping, like, backseat gamer. Like, he's the kind of guy that'll go, eh, pretty mid for everything. <laughs> you saved me. Thank you for the gifts up to you saved me. <laughs> Sanus Legend of Zelda character? I'm saying. Actually, that's Tingle. When you really think about it. Don't actually think about it, because he's not. But hey. <gasps> oh, okay, we're good. You guys want to sing a song with me? Bre you know, maybe it's a good thing you stayed anonymous. <laughs> Whoever that was, what do you mean breastfeeding Obama? What is that? I mean, I know what that is, but I like I don't want it. <laughs> That's t I can't do this. What do you mean breastfeeding of day? Well, thank you for the sub, but what? What? Is this the Requiem of Light, isn't it? This is Requiem of Light, I believe. Thank you for the gifts to mm, Monkey as well. Okay, I can't. Hang on. I got to pay attention to this. Thank you, guys. That threw me off real bad. Okay, so I, I had it. I just went too far on the next one. Next. Okay, I got it. Oh, my God, please. Damn it. Hang on. I got this. Yeah, I got it. I got it. I got it. Is this trombone champ? This is trombone champ before trombone champ. And it's so goddamn funny. For those who don't know, since we already gave it away, this other guy, this is Link from Ocarina of Time, the Golden Wolf. And you play songs that he knows. I think there's only like one song here that like isn't a canon song that he would know, but you know, still. Thank you for the, yeah, nah. I'm not even reading that one, but thank you. <laughs> there we go. All right, more Reese's. Hmm. There's two. Is it from Wind Waker Sands or is it from another game? I don't remember. Or Awakening? No, I doubt Awakening. Rest in peace, Ocarina of Time Link. Honestly, rest in peace. Let teachings of old pass to you. Take sword in hand and find me. Why do these Reese's Pieces have to... Like, you know you know what the problem is with this candy? It goes away in like two seconds. Therefore, I want more. And that's how they get me. Because I'm a slut for candies. Alright. You're... Are, he's just a long lake Hylia. Amazing. Alright. We'll catch you at some point. Mr. Linkman. There are two I don't reckon. Mmm. Oopy Dogman. Thank you for the gifts up to Oopy. Why'd he eat himself off the cliff like that? <laughs> He's just gangster like that. He's like, I'll just roll at the end. You might recognize the song eventually. You know what? Some of you might even know what this area actually is. Oh, there, there it is. There it is. That sound familiar at all? When I got here the first time, I got so emotional over this, man. Anyways, you might know where we are. At least from Ocarina of Time standards. Oh, so look, you play the royal song. Interesting. Interesting. Love this song. It's one of my favorite songs ever. Oh, God, please.
I'm not tone deaf. <laughs> what a familiar melody. Yeah, there you go. You guys got it. You guys got it. Lost Woods. So what else might be here? Since this is a sequel to Ocarina of Time, I wonder. I wonder if there's any characters or anything that are noticeable. Probably not, though, right, chat? I don't know. I don't play Zelda at all, ever. Oh, hey, Skull Kid. <laughs> Hi, Skull Kid. All right. Yeah, no one's here. No one's here. No one's here. Interesting, though, right? Oh, God. Stop. Stop it. Stop it. Oh, you don't have to. You don't actually have to get. Okay. I'm taking. I'm, I'm treating them like they're Twilight monsters. I can just dash them. All right, we're good. Skull Kid, you wee bastard. Honestly, and he's still being a bastard, clearly. There are more than one Skull Kid, by the way, but I, my head cannon likes to assume this is the same one. It just makes sense to me. There we go. It's gotta. It's gotta. That is the Toho Trumpet? I'm sorry, you guys saying that what he's blowing is the Toho Trumpet? Actually, it could be the same sound font. No, puppy! Uh, you know, it's a good time to get more Reese's. Actually, you know what, chat? There's only like three left. I'll just, I'll just, I'll just eat them all. It's fine. It's fine. I don't have a problem. It's fine. Why he got puppet dude, though? No idea. Homie's been uh, playing from his sack of tricks. Sack of tricks. Oh my god, this one... Oh no. Oh no, this one's attached to the wrap. Chat, it's attached to the wrapping. Oh, I can't get it out. I got it. I got it. Oh, I gotta do this again? Yeah, I speed ran it. Oh, they don't want me to do that. That nah, makes sense. <laughs> there you go. All right. Now's the time for one more Reese piece. <laughs> I'm so sorry, chat. Actually, this is the last piece. It's the last piece. There's only two left. You did your best, Twilight Princess Link. Now that I think about it, the Breath of the Wild is one of the only 3D Zeldas that didn't have a musical instrument. In fact, it is the only one that didn't have a musical thing going on. You think we'll get something in Tears of the Kingdom? And if so, what would it be? What would he play? Or would he sing? Or would he whistle into his ghost hand and make it play funny notes? The last piece always tastes the worst. In what world? The last piece tastes amazing. Because you always want more. You savor that shit. You savor that shit. Breath of the Wild has Cass. True. True. Cass, Cass himself counts as the music part. I, yeah. That is that. That is fair. Does he have an instrument Phantom Hourglass? Holy shit. Does he not? He does in uh, Spirit Tracks, but I don't know about... No, in Phantom Hourglass, he doesn't, does he? Play the automaton. Imagine. Oh my god, please. Got him. Thank you for playing that familiar tune. Apparently, I gotta kill you for it. I mean, you are being an ass. You could just not attack me, Mr. Skull Kid. Where is that? It's okay, Midna. I know. He's a little bastard. We'll catch him. We'll catch him. I think this was it. His arm is the automaton. Awful. But also, yes, I'm, I'm okay with that. No, stop, 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 stop. Oh my god, they're getting so close. I mean, I'm, I'm anxious. I'm anxious. Oh my god. I don't have health. I don't got health. Alright. <laughs> I'm not. Okay, what do you want, Midna? <laughs> I know. I know. I know it's what they do. Midna, please. You're being a Zelda companion for the first time during this playthrough. You can't be doing that to me. I gave you credit. I'm sorry, Link. I can't give credit. Come back when you're a little... Oh, my God. <laughs> Concussion. Come back when you're a little mm, richer. A theremin. Imagine him setting that, like, the theremin up. Putting on, like, a tripod. Oh, you're here? Yeah, he's here. That asshole's here. We've been new. She's just being helpful. You're right. Oh, my God. Please. 
She can help me by killing these things. Which she does, actually. But still, you know what I mean. Get out of here. Ropes? Bombs? Lamp oil? You're being a Zelda companion. Man, it's like Zelda's a companion from a Zelda game. No, she's not. Wait, did, does Frico not know that she used to be a Toho character? Frico, you didn't know? Oh, I thought you knew games, dude. That's that's a shame. It's a shame. Thought we could have had something in common there, you know? Imagine not remembering that Midna was a Toho character. Toho, three ho, three ho. Three hoes. And they're all me. I have learned that I know nothing. It's okay. I'm just messing with everyone. <laughs> I'm... It's okay. I'm full of shit. Okay, now he is in that room. Oh, boy. Rope. Rope oil. Lamps. B bomb oil. Chili oil. Please just buy one of my oils. I have so much oil. He's in the... Is he in the tree? Is that even possible? Oh, I see. I see. He's up. Okay. 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 I got this. I got this. When? 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 Just now. <laughs> cover yourself in oil? I'm ready to cover- oh, Yeah, I'm, I'm ready to- I'm ready to cover myself in oil. And jump in a furnace. Cause go my god, this segment. This segment with three hearts. Oh god, thank you for a checkpoint. It's not a checkpoint. Oh god. I'm gonna do it this time without getting hit. I promise. I don't even need health. It's fine. I got the strat down. I'm a speedrunner. Check this out. She was first in Toho uh, 7.9 Magical Twilight Girl. It's true. It's, tr it's true. I know games. I don't know Zelda. I don't like The Legend of Zelda, but I respect people who do because we are all different. Oh, wait. Was that a real answer? <laughs> I thought you were playing a part with uh, playing part of the bit. She, she was not a Toho character for the record, Frika. Just in case. I'll hold you on that. You know what's the funny part, Chris? I don't even remember what you're holding me for. My ADHD is killing me. But you know what? I'm gonna I'm 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 gonna I'm gonna go ahead and say yes. I promise. I promise, Chris. You have my word. You have my you have my blood oath. My blood pack promise that I will that I will do whatever I said I would. Oh god, it could be anything. She could be like, oh, you said you were gonna give me a million dollars. Backtracking real quick on this. Uh, never mind. Gru's minions. What about them? Thank you for the gift sub. I'm holding you to not get hurt. Oh, oh, you know what? Okay, yeah, you know what? You have the guarantee. Here we go. Let's do it. Gru's minions. I was like, what's a sminion? What is a sminion? Still waiting for my 10 mil. It's okay. Everyone's still waiting for the stakes I owe them to. I f that stopped being a meme a long time ago. I just realized. I, I had like a big habit of saying that back in the day. It was, if this happens, I'll give you guys a steak. If it doesn't happen, I'll give you guys a steak. We, we, were, we were almost going to have a steak emote at one point. In fact, we might have had a steak emote. I can't remember. I don't think we did, but yeah. I owe like 50 million steaks to people. A sminion? Sounds like a, a, a monkey. Oh, like Simeon. True, true. What about... S Samoans. Wait, no, that, that, that's the type of person, right? I was thinking of Samosas. Jesus. No, no, not 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 Samoans. Samosas. I'm lost again. I mean, thank God. If there's any place I need to get, if I, I have to be lost. I'm glad. I'm glad it's the Lost Woods. You know what I'm saying? Piss off. Do puppets at least drop health? Nope. On hero mode here, nothing drops health. You either get a fairy or a potion. Or a hot spring. Either, other than that, we are getting no health. But it's okay. No shots yet. You're lost in the lost woods. I know. I can't believe it either. I guess you really staked a whole lot on the line. I... You know what? That one was actually really good. Oh! I mean, literally anytime you guys drop a pun, they're usually really good. I just pretend I don't like them because I'm jealous. Because they're really good. So I'll be like, yeah, you know, kind of mid. I don't even say kind of mid. In fact, I I think I usually got I, I I usually humor you guys. I go blit sometimes, and that's it. But you guys are kind of you guys are kind of really funny. Oh yeah, choo choo jelly as well. Yeah yeah, choo choo jelly is also one that we can use. 
if we find those tools and get them. Let's see. There's a few more cool things in this forest, by the way, that I'm going to point out uh, once we get a little further. Oh my god. Geographically speaking. Because, yeah, it is a sequel to Ocarina of Time hundreds of years later. Or just a hundred? I don't remember. But you'll see. I'm out for the night. Yo, no worries, Sand. Get, get that good sleep, dude. Thanks for coming on by. Hope you enjoyed the stream. Hope to see you again if you did. And, uh, you know what? It's been really fun having you in on the Zelda stuff. Always a comfy time talking Zelda with you. So have a good one. Even if it's surrogate mother shit. <laughs> have a good night, man. Love Skull Kid continuing to harass Link through generations. Yeah. Yeah, it's kind of sweet, isn't it? It's sweet in the most unendearing way possible. No, it's endearing in the most cursed way possible. There we go. Night Sank. It's funny, I've called him Sank before, too. It's funny, you know, the, the syllables here could be for Porife. You know what I'm saying? Except it doesn't sound like that. Why are you stomping? What are you mad about? What? I, you, oh, you don't like me biting you. Yeah, that makes sense. Alright, let's do this then. If you want to play these games. Also, I don't know if it's a fun reference or not, but notice that, like, his face kind of looks like the moon from Majora's Mask. Probably just a fun little thing, but, you know, still. Pretty, pretty neat. Pretty neat. God damn it. I swore I bit him. Okay, I got him. I got him. I got him. Skull Kid, why are you like this? Why is he such a little bastard for years? Hundreds of years. Keeping that scrum low energy? Honestly, respect. You gotta respect them for it. Oh. No. Link. Stink. Please. Oh my god. That was brutal. God, really? Really? I can't believe it. He's such a cloin. Got him. It's a fun way to say clown. I've been saying it like cloin now. I heard Vinny say it once and I was like, that's good. That's good. I like saying cloins. It could also be money for clowns, like collect the clown coins, the cloins. Ooh. Ooh. We're gonna have a carnival show one day and call it the shit circus. I don't even know what that stream would be, but it would be great. Maybe. Ooh. The only time it's okay for Link to punch a child. I wonder, is there any children type characters that are awful in the Zelda series? Like genuinely like a villain or something. There's gotta be, right? Lord Farquaad? Remember when he was in a Zelda game? Alright, see ya. <laughs> Bye. Cool. Good. Good to see you again. Hate you. So anyways, uh, the, 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 the common understanding of this, and once again, uh, doesn't have to be true or not, but the common understanding is that uh, this area right here in the Lost Woods is the old castle town from Ocarina of Time. And they moved everything since then. You, you'll see why. There's a few other things that lend to that theory and make it almost pretty much canon. Um, also, the, the Master Sword and stuff being here. Uh, you'll, you'll see. You'll see what I mean. But uh, this is supposedly Old Castle Town from Ocarina of Time. Which became like the new Lost Woods. Isn't Vati kind of young as a minish? Yeah. No, that, 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 that could count, technically. Technically, sort of. Mallow is one of them. Mallow is the best child. Except for the backseating. And the elitism. And the gatekeep. You know what? Yeah, he might be pretty bad. <laughs> It'll be your birthday stream. What, the clown circus? Yeah, chat. Ooh, a broken chest. It's, it's, has someone opened this in the past, chat? Has someone opened that chest in the past? Interesting. Interdasting. Also, we're going to be stuck here for a while. I'm just warning you from now, I remember this, and doing this on stream is going to be way worse. Does this area look familiar to any of you, by the way? I mean, it's a little it's a little snazzed up, a little bedazzled, but does this look familiar to you guys at all? These ruins? It doesn't have to, but if it does, uh, reasons. Anyways, let's go. You're right, I rec recognize this map layout. Yeah, it, it also, yeah, it matches geographically as well. Temple of Tim? So you think it might be the Temple of Time, huh? Oh, no, sorry. You think it might be the Temple of Tim. I know someone who might hate Agatha. Agatha's cool. It feels weird saying that. So here's the funny... <laughs> I have an ex named Agatha. And... I mean, I'm Shady Cicada, so seeing a character named Agatha who likes bugs, I was like, hmm. 
And the funny part is too, like they were someone who could have caused like cosplayed her. <laughs> all right. Here you go. Get ready for the best puzzle of all time. And yes, you 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 will either do this in no time at all, or this will take me an hour. All right. We are guardians of this land. Guide us to where we once stood. Only then can you enter the true sacred grove. Okay. First move I'm going to make. I'm going to make this very unnecessary move. Because it's totally, it's totally, it's going to be a gamer play. You just wait, chat. You just wait. Okay. Now. Now, hear me out, okay? I'm going to make him go all the way up there. Oh, I can't. I have to jump somewhere. Damn, okay. We'll do this. Alright. Alright. They have asked though. Yeah, chat? <laughs> yeah, chat? On the right track. Possibly. This homie's gonna be chasing me now. Okay. Except they go opposite ways, so this could be a problem right here like this. Uh, this would have worked if they went the same way. But, you know, the game should totally spoon-feed me. I don't know why it wouldn't. How, how terrible for it to not spoon-feed me. What if I was a game journalist? I'd be stuck forever. I would have to cry and shit myself. How could they do that to me, huh, chat? <laughs> should we like this puzzle, but it's definitely not for everyone. Well, the funny part is I actually do love this puzzle. Me being stuck for an hour is only me warning chat in case anyone gets impatient. But genuinely, uh, uh, is it Corundum? Or Corund M? Corundum? Uh, I, I love this shit. Honestly, I think I like every, like, possible Zelda puzzle. They're all pretty. You know what? I have to start getting them to the platform. So maybe we start doing that now. <laughs> yeah! What was the. Oh my god, that was a laugh. That was a good laugh. I went full Mickey on that. That was dope. Okay, let's see. I can't even do it again. <laughs> I can't do it. I can't do it. I sounded like a Zelda NPC. <laughs> I really like that. All right. I just really like them hitting each other. All right. It's going to work, chat. I'm going to make this work. We can make it work. <gasps> nope. Okay. Shit, right, but it's gonna be opposite ways around. Unless... Unless... No, nah, I'm gonna mess this up. It won't matter. It won't matter. But it's it's still cool that we got, like, one there, you know? That's neat. That is very neat. Okay, hold up. Okay. Okay, make them crush the oopy? Hell no. Okay. I like the whole tone music, by the way. It's using a bit of that whole tone scale, and it's very, very funny. Oh, wait, hold up. It's still not going to work because they go opposite ends, but hold up. Okay. We're going to make this work. It's, it's going to eventually work out for me. You just wait, chat. You just wait. This is going This is going to be a swift banger in just a minute. I think I understand what I must do. No, wait. Okay, so what I want to do is... I, 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 like, I'm like i seeing the positioning that I want to have. It's just a matter of how I'm going to do it. So, I need to get homie up there. No, I need that homie to be on, like, the lower end. I need... Okay. Don't worry about it. I kind of believe in you. Thank you, chat. I, I like being kind of believed in. I do appreciate that. We'll get this. I know the positioning that I want. It's just a matter of getting it there now. Okay. So if I have, like, him up there, and I can manage to get homie down below this one, which would be kind of tough now. So let me corner that guy over there and get him some... Okay, I'll do the real estate this way. And then we'll... Sure. And then... Yikes. 
Okay, hang on. Hang on. I'm blind, it's so obvious. Yo, sick, dude. Okay. Although I feel like that's a bit. I feel like you're having a bit with me. <laughs> but maybe it is. Okay, let's see. Let's see. That's gotta be sarcasm. <laughs> There's no way y'all be starting the shit talk when I gave the disclaimer. That would be kind of sussy baka of you, as the kids say. All right, check this out. I might have gotten them in the wrong spots, but this might be it here. I got it. This is what I wanted to do. You see? Blind gamer, huh? Nah, I know you're messing. But I did it. I like the set. They, they just, they make ancient statue noises. And I appreciate that a lot. It's a bit, yeah, no, I had a feeling. I had a feeling. <laughs> Go now to the, you know what? Let me give them their voice that they had. Go now to the sacred place, beast. We yield passage to the sacred gate. Oh. Old statues just love to moan for no reason. When the man's going the platform's just right, I'm saying it's that perfect fit, Ushimimi. Also, how you doing? Welcome back. Hope you're well. You you just reached for an iconic moment in the game. So, uh, good timing right there. But also, I hope you're doing well tonight. Hope everything's been good for you. You all should go check out Ushimimi. She is a very, very lovely streamer. And also, the song that I made called Lumi uh, was the theme song for her on her streams. Every shady moment is it's iconic. Yeah, okay. All right. Are you guys ready for this? It's gonna. It's gotta play the song. You know the first part, where it has little do -do 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 sparkle noises. Please get the master sword. I will. Here we go. Oh, yeah, a stone came out of my head. Not the preferred way to pass a stone, but there is no preferred way. Anyway, sorry. Here you go. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. I love it. Every Zelda game, it just it's so good. The sword accepted you as its master. Out of all the links to have a Master Sword, I feel like this is one of the more deadly ones. <laughs> this thing is the embodiment of the evil magic that Sans cast on you. It's definitely different from our tribe's shadow magic. Careful, if you touch it, you'll turn back into a beast. This thing is too dangerous. It's probably best if we leave, uh, just leave it here, huh? But on the other hand, if we kept it, you'd be able to transform into a beast anytime you wanted. See, no more bug quests. We can be wolf any time. Yeah, since Santa was kind enough to give this to us, we should be as thankful and use it as uh, all we can. I can't read. If you need it, just call me. I want to keep a low profi profile, so I'll hide in your shadow when you're human. But I can change you whenever. You can be a wolf anytime you like. Also, thanks to this thing, you can warp whenever you want by switching into wolf form. Fast traveling. Yes, baby. Let's go. Hey, but listen, Link. I've got a little favor to ask. Would you mind coming with me to find something called the Mirror of Twilight? It's hidden somewhere in Hyrule. Yes, the Mirror of Twilight. Our last potential link to Zant. You know I'll do it. You know I'll do it, Midna. Yeah. Yeah. Let's go. It also just feels like it's the longest Master Sword. I mean, they're all the same size, but it just feels long in this game, and I like that. All right. We're busted now, and we got a little more time before art. But, <laughs> by the way, chat, did you know, if you're new here, at the end of every single stream, we do have a fan art segment. Uh, the community makes art for the games that we play and the jokes that we make, and we play some of the chill Nintendo video game music while we go through it. That's going to happen in just a few minutes here as well. Um... If you're interested in catching that, you know, feel free to stick around. Also, uh, we do have a Discord. You can see a link right there. Thanks to Frico. Thank you, thank you. 
if you also type exclamation mark discord if you miss it just in case you can also get a link through that you can join you get to uh, you get to know when i go live you could talk to me and the lads about video games anime so much stuff on there but also you could submit your own art to be shown on stream just make sure it's related to me the stream or the game make sure it's not something you drew in 10 seconds uh in like ms paint for attention and you could submit up to five pieces of art per stream so if that sounds like it's down your alley uh come on down there you go there's the speech all right there you go. The, 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 like, transforming anytime is such a fun, like, feature of this. There we go. Give me your soul. Rip out the ball. Just one. Gotta hit the sack. Yo, no worries, Azur. Get yourself that goddamn good sleep. And thanks for coming by, as always. Hope you do the stream. All right, let's get the hell out of here. What do we... What, what do we have to do? We just gotta find the mirror of Twilight, right? But, like, let me let me talk to Minda and see what's up. I knew a place like this existed within Farron Woods. Okay, we just gotta leave for now. All right, we'll just teleport out. Windwaker Link is shorter than the others. Windwaker Link is an absolute baby. He is a small scrimblow, and I love him. Give me your juice. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Let's go to Lake Hylia. I want to go. Um. I wonder if I could get to the wolf from this part of Lake Hylia. Maybe, right? Let's see. Legend of Insanity Wolf. <laughs> it's me. I, I, I'm the Insanity and Insanity Wolf. My brain. She is gone. Okay, let's see. I probably can't go up that path. It's probably like the flight. Yeah. Okay. Um, what to do now? Maybe if I go to Telma's bar, I might find something there. I think it's kind of a werewolf in this game. Yeah, pretty much. Minus the whole full moon. Like, he, he's he's a werewolf. Sands the full moon. You know, let's write, let's write it down. Let's write it down and actually get to that wolf. Or else I'm going to forget. Are you reading Gotta Hit the Sack After Ripping Out a Ball is kind of, uh... <laughs> <laughs> yeah? Yeah? Ooh, Zora's Domain music. The classic. <laughs> as heard in such classic games as Ocarina of Time, Majora's Mask, and Breath of the Wild. But not Wind Waker. No, they're all gone. <laughs> Sorry. They all became birds! I like you can see the messed up castle from here. Man, some of you guys missed an amazing glitch, by the way, to those who came late. We had a chandelier shit out a Lizalfos corpse. That's the best way I could word that, but that is exactly what happened. Are the Zora not afraid? Nah, they don't care. But they will be afraid if I transform, which is why I have to do it out of sight. It's just Hylians. Hylians are weird. God damn it. Come on, I gotta be out of sight now. Yeah, hi, I'm just teleporting wolf. Don't mind me. Oh, are you, are you serious? Are you serious? Is mayonnaise an instrument? All right. Fish became birds. The prey is not a predator. All shall fear the Rito. Honestly, what a power move. All right. What's the way to this dank ass wolf now? What is the way? Probably just down this river, yeah? That way? Hang on a second. But yeah, it, it's, it's looking like it's about time to end. Oh, it's not that way. It is the one with the gate. How do we open said gate? Oh, no. Oh, God. Wait, what? How do we... Oh, no. What's the deal here? Do I got to talk to our... Do I... I got to talk to Lady, I guess, maybe. We got to find a way to lower that gate. Have a realistic Zelda water. Um, I yeah, I, it's Chris Bushy. I would absolutely, I would absolutely slurp some of that up. For real, for real, on God. Hey, can you raise that gate? Mm -hmm. hmm, a customer. Sorry, but we're temporarily closed. Open up. Open the goddamn door. All right. What the shit? Oh shit. Okay, we're doing this, huh? If you transform here, they'll get scared. All right, fine. I'll use my sword. I have the master sword, so that should do a lot. Um, it looks like it's by Lake Hylia, but actually out the south gate of Castletown, by the way. Wait, really? Oh my god, girl. 
You know what? I guess that would be freaky to see. All right. Maybe I don't blame her for that. But oh my god, girl. <laughs> Please. Please. No. Out, of, out you go. Out you go. This means Shady can see the horrors of Roll Goal. As soon as she goes back in business. Absolutely. Absolutely. Are you good? Are you good? Oh, that scared me. No shit. That was almost like curdling, like blood curdling scream in a Nintendo game. Except for a Peach in Mario Strikers 1, which is terrifying. Uh, who are you? How can you keep your cool fighting monsters like that? I don't know. You just push B. Uh, wow, you. Wow, what a champ you are. Well, what are we standing around j jawing for? Come on inside. What is jawing? What does that mean? Are you nibbling? Are you just like biting the air? What, what, what does it mean to jaw? Talk about scary. I thought I was done for. Things have been getting pretty crazy around here, let me tell you. So thanks for earlier. My name's Iza. I rent boats here. Well, I used to rent boats here, but then we had a rock fall and damn the river up. I thought it said a Rick Roll. Man, I could sure use a helpful guy around at times like this. A strapping, handy guy. Be a big help around here. Oh, gee, I sure hope you find that guy. I have to go back to beating Octorox. All right, fine, I'll help. Really? You're a lifesaver. Well, do you think you could do something about that rock? I'll give you some bombs and arrows, so just put them together and shoot bomb arrows at that thing. Okay. <laughs> okay. Fine. I'll uh, make it. We'll make it X. Now we'll make it. We'll make it R. That works. Cool. Second pack of bombs. Let's go. Let me go, girl. Uh, she gonna sell you oil along with her pet bird. I wish. Hey, hurry up and take out the uh, raw. All oh, right, right, right. Let's do that right now. Okay, I got it. I got it. I got it. Sorry, lady. Babushka. Jean reminds me when British folks say chinwag. Yes. British folks say chin. I'm sorry. British folks say chinwag. Yeah, you did it. Well, my gal tells me there are still some rocks blocking the way along the river, so you should take care of those too. Here's the boat. Hop in. All right, let's do it. Now, it's a teensy bit dangerous down river of here, so don't leave the boat, okay? One of our part-timers is waiting down there, so you can get the details from her. And when you're done, you can keep that bomb bag and everything in it as a token of my appreciation. Yo, hell yeah! So, be seeing ya. Sweet. She really did just give us a whole bomb bag. This was worth it. And unlimited arrows for this part. It is a thing. Chobble? Chobble is a thing? That... I... No other word is as good as trouble now. Whoa, I gotta steer the boat? Oh, shit. Okay. Oh, my God, I can't steer. Oh, my God, the drifting. Okay, wait, this is actually kind of neat. I forgot about this. Whoa, whoa. This sounds like a Pikmin song. Oh, crap. Oh, God. Yeah! Swerve for it. Can we? Yeah, this is a fun ride. I'm enjoying this. Where's my Zelda VR, huh? So I can throw up while I'm on this ride. Please, give it to me. What a peaceful stream. Yeah. Whoa! Yeah, peaceful. Still peaceful. Still peaceful. Or a Mario Sunshine song? Oh, absolutely. I could see that too. You're right. The percussion very much lends to it. What is this camera angle? Is this the wrong way? Oh, it's, an, it, it's a roundabout. It's a roundabout. I won't need it. Don't talk to me. I'm moving right now. Ah, you come up to request the shop owner, haven't you? Well, I'm here in pl uh, part time for now. I'm sorry we troubled you so. You see, these rocks are blocking the natural flow of the river. How are you doing this? Did you freeze me in place? All I need to use is your bomb arrow to destroy the blockage. I I I would have I would have never known. Thanks, Mamir. That's my new thing now, isn't it? Jeez, it's just all from Mamir. Shady hi, it's hi, it's on my calling of your streams again. Yo, welcome back, Blue Shrimpy. Hope you're doing well. Thank you for almost a year's worth of subs. You did it. Thank you. And the water's already been, uh, begin to flow. Then I shall guide you to the mouth of the river. Follow me. Thank you so much for the resub. And I hope you enjoy these, uh, the bits of the stream. Oh, God. And almost a year as well worth of subs. Thank you so much. Nice. That didn't hurt. Hell yeah. Let's go. Love her colors. She does have cool colors. The Zora in this game probably had my favorite Zora designs. I know I'm saying that when Sidon and Mipha exist. Actually, you know what? Sidon and Mipha exist. Never mind. I take it back. But honestly, their designs in this game are amazing. And the Zora mom, the queen, absolutely looks like a really pretty design. Shrimping aside, a pretty design. I can't get any of these rupees. 
Never mind. Never mind. God, God gamer. <gasps> oh, God, Jesus, I made it. I made it. Sonic Mifu would actually look really cool in this style, though. Oh, absolutely. That would be a cool thing to see, for sure. Wait. Wait. Still molding that they never made. They, they, they never made Twilight Princess 2, and they were planning on it, chat. They were planning on it, and you know what it became? Do you know what that project became? Link's crossbow training, which honestly is better. I, I, I actually genuinely love Link's crossbow training, but still, they were going to make Twilight Princess 2. But then again, they were going to make Wind Waker 2 as well, and it ended up being this game, which I'm very happy about. Oh god, please. You need to catch up and tell her she has a hole in her wallet? Yeah, or, or, or silver. We just take the money and run. Good job out there. She won't know. You've truly done us a great service. Now the shop can finally reopen. When we were closed, my boss's temper only got worse and worse. It was a rough time for us all. Oh, and another thing. I don't suppose she promised you anything special for doing this, did she? Just that bomb bag, right? Yeah, she tends to bribe people with whatever's lying around. She's so stingy, really. It's all right. I'll let, uh, I'll let her know you kept it when I get back. Yeah, you know what? Even if those didn't lead to the wolf, this was worth it. Absolutely worth it. Now, if you'll excuse me, come visit us at the shop anytime. How you doing that? There ain't no string. Oh my god, the boat's alive. His name is Bodhi. I love him. Actually, his name is... Boat... Botronicus. Boat... Botronicus... Thick, thick body. Botronic is thick body. Wait, hold up. What? Oh, I see what you meant by the south exit of Castle Town. I see what you mean. Okay, yeah, you're right. All right let's go get that real quick. It's just the uh, the the whole thing was weird me out there. Botronic is thick body already has a Zelda wiki page. <laughs> you see, you see, iconic ass, iconic ass name. Boat. Oh my god. I wish you said Botrude right before I said I would have stolen that. Absolutely. That's a good one. But now he's Botronicus, unfortunately. Maybe he has, a, like, a cousin named Botrude. And Botris, which is my version of Boris, which isn't as good as Botrude. God damn it. Y'all are too clever. Transform into human. Human. All right, I'm going to go get that uh, Link thing. No! No, God. Oh, God, here we go. Greetings, Mr. Link. If you got As a letter tradition, I have to do a different voice every time he shows up, so here you go. I came to deliver a letter. It's a letter from Telma. <laughs> well, my business is concluded. I work tomorrow. <laughs> his vocal, his larynx just dropped. Wait, mail from Telma. Wait, that's actually important. Hold up. Uh, let's see. That might be the story. This is Uku. They came so quickly. Link, there's some folks I want you to meet. Uh, so come to my bar right away. These guys will be powerful allies for you. Here, me. Come by. I'll be at the Castle Town Bar. Yep, that's the story. They came so quickly. You could have said something like, I have friends for you to meet. I, they're just saying they came so quickly. is just like, I don't care about how fast their arrival time is. I don't know who they are. Are you scared? Are you that surprised that they showed up that fast? Maybe. Maybe she likes that they're, like, um, uh, uh, punctual with their times. But, like, if I, if, if I had, like, a party of people and I was like, yo, yo, my new friend Dan, you know, I, I got, I got, I got a bunch of lads coming over. If you want to come over for the party, too, like, you're invited. I'm not going to go, yo, they came so quickly, man. You got to see them. <laughs> Me ripping into video games. Imagine that. I'm, I'm, I, you know, I'm just joking around anyways. I'm not, you know. Excuse me, I'm terribly sorry, but... Well, having a customer in the store with shoes as filthy as yours can make our clients uncomfortable. We hope that you will come back once you have some, uh, some more polished footwear. What the hell? Excuse me, Mr. Goddamn High and Mighty. You're standing outside a goddamn store. What's, what, what do you do? You just stand. You just stand and berate people. You got nothing. You got nothing. Are about to see someone I may have shrimped for a little. Wolf Link? The Golden Wolf? I, I I know what you're saying. Maybe. Possibly. Pablo pa pa Pablo Pablo? Poblessly? Possibly. 
There's gonna be a line here, isn't there? Nope, never mind. South exit. Uh, there are some cool people on that team. If that's what you mean, yeah. Can I take a guess on who on who it is, Justice? Is it Harry Potter? Or is it not Harry Potter? For some reason, I was like, let me just take a wild guess that it might not even be that. But is it Harry Potter? It is Harry Potter. Okay, I got it. You see? You see? You see? I'm a genius. Let's see. Um, so he is here somewhere. Thank you for the gifts up to Pablo. My guy, my boy. Newbert, my man. Thank you for the gifts up. There he is. I hear sparkly bug, but I don't ha I have no net. Agatha is very displeased. Don't bite my brains. Don't bite my brains. Ah, my brains. It's exactly where I didn't want you to bite. Now I can't remember math, but I think it used to be my favorite color. We meet again. The next is the greatest of hidden skills I've taught you to this point, and it may test the limits of your endurance. Do you still wish to master it? If it's the one I think, then I very badly want this one. But before I get, uh, begin, I must test to, uh, you to ensure you have mastered the last skill I taught you, the backslice. Now then, come at me. So yeah, to those who don't know, this is Link from Ocarina of Time. I'm not lying. This is Link from Ocarina of Time, which is really cool to see. And freaky. But that's the reason he can also become a dog. Excellent. It appears you are certainly capable of performing my lost art. Very well. My fourth hidden skill is please be Helm Splitter. Yes! I love this move so much. Let it be hewn, hone, hewn, hone, hone, hewn into your mind. Still don't know how to pronounce that. You know what? I need to know. About to learn the shoe cleaning technique. Could you imagine? Now, since you're a filthy little mongrel, let me show you how to be classy, Link. Me, a forest fairy boy. <laughs> okay, I gotta know how to pronounce this. Hewn pronunciation. Hone hewn. Let's see. It is hewn. Wait. Uh. Hewn. It's hewn. It's hewn. Okay. Got it. Helm splitter like Virgil. It's it's. I'll tell you this. It's a. It's pretty amazing looking. It is impossible to circle around to perform a backslice against fully armored enemies that move swiftly in combat. Against such foes, you must first use a shield attack and make them flinch, but then quickly pass a. You will leap into the air over the enemy's head and greet them with your blade by immediately striking from behind. Please add this to uh, Tears of the Kingdom as well. Please and thank you. Look at that. Look at him being all skillful and shit. This is the Helm Splitter. Show it to me. Alright, game on. Arcana Time Link got tall. Mm. God, I love that move. Oh. I was supposed to hit him. I was supposed to hit him after. Alright. Wait, no, stop. Hang on. I'm, 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 I'm Gucci with it. There we go. <laughs> hmm, impressive. Do not miss your chance to land a helm splitter with A after your shield attack. Does every Link have the ability to become dog? Technically speaking, they could. They could. I will say that one of them became a bunny rabbit. The fourth hidden skill, the helm splitter, has been passed on. But that wasn't the Twilight Realm. That was the Dark World. But yeah, Link became a bunny. There we go. There are still three hidden skills for you to learn. Do not neglect your daily sword training between now and the time you've come to learn the next skill. May we meet again. Buni. Buni, even. He becomes a Buni. Not gonna lie, that segment hurt my soul where he becomes a bunny. Still good, though. Okay, I'm going to talk to the members, and then we're gonna get to the art. Bunny Boy Link. Yeah, there's a Bunny Link. But he's like a full-on bunny, like not like anthropomorphic. I mean, he is, but like he's not like half human, half bunny. He's just a full-ass bunny. In case you were wondering what he looked like. And he's pink. He's like a pink bunny. It's kind of amazing. Please. There you go. Uh, has he ever been anything else, chat? Has he ever been another animal? I'm trying to remember. I think those are the only two games. But I could be wrong. He becomes a 2D painting. But that's not really an animal. He can also become a fish, rock, and nut. That's true. Ocarina of Time Link was the one who could um, wear the souls of many and change into their forms. So if the Dark World turns you to the opposite of what's in your heart, so Courageous Link became a timid rabbit, why did Ganondorf become a, a covetous, greedy pig monster? 
So, it's funny because I think they retconned it to where he became a pig monster as soon as he had that Triforce on him. But that is really funny to think about. Like, before that, like, the, actually, I think even with, I think they, even back then, it was still the Triforce. But you're right, I think it said that, didn't it say that the Dark World transformed him? I can't remember now. You bring up a good point. Becomes a fairy in Zelda 2. You're right, he does turn into a fairy. You're right, I forgot about Zelda 2. Holy shit. And that was a, that was a broken ass one too, right? I think. I think it only ever lasted like a screen, but you could go through an entire screen with it, which is great for that game, because that game's hard. Yo, Postman? Mm, what to order, what to order. I do believe I'll start with the meat. I got the meat sweats. Sorry. Oh. I was trying to make them creepy. Hot fairy link. It's more like just like a tiny little two-bit fairy. Oh my, if it isn't Link. I don't know why I don't know why I still gave her this accent. I'm so sorry. You made it. How you been, honey? Mercy, you have a good time, and I was just talking about you. Hey. Hey everyone, introduce yourselves. This handsome young man is the infamous Link. There's Harry Potter. You remember what I told you before, honey? There are those uh, these are those friends I mentioned, the one who are trying to help deal with all the troubles in Hyrule. Actually, there's uh, one more of us, but there's uh, been a disturbing turn of events in the Eastern Desert, so he's gone to check it out. He's an older man named Aru. If you happen to <laughs> if you happen to meet him, definitely take the time to talk to him, okay, honey? That looks like what a dog would say, like Aru, Aru. Well, you come all the way here, honey, so why don't you relax a bit? Why don't you be sociable and talk to these folks? They're a jolly bunch. What was that sound? I was just trying to pronounce the name, you know? You know? You need an adult because of this lady? What, because you see boobs? I hate to break it to you, Helia. A lot of people have boobs. I know. I know. <laughs> it doesn't always have to be a lewd thing. Ch chat. Leave the internet. <laughs> oh, hello there. You must be Link, correct? I'm Shad. Wonderful to meet you. Like Shady? Telma uh, told me that uh, all you've been up to, you're rather formidable. I'd rather not, I'm afraid. Or I'm I'm rather not, I'm afraid. Well, I'm formidable at book reading, but I lack, shall we say, physical skills. That said, if the history and legends of Hyrule are the, uh, your cup of tea, I'm your fellow. If you're curious, just ask away. Okay, can you tell me what Tears of the Kingdom is going to be about? Do you know about the Zelda timeline? Do you know about the Hyrule timeline? Because I do. Did you know that um, uh, in Ocarina of Time, there's a split timeline? And at this moment, as we're doing this, uh, Wind Waker is also happening at the same time. And there's another me, and he's small. Like, really, really small. You're talking about... Never mind, he's talking about the Uka. I don't want to know about that yet. I don't want to know about the Uka ever. In the Oracle games, there are rings you can wear to uh, turn into enemies, but you can't do anything. So oh, I forgot about that. Right. You become like a moblin and a like-like and all that. I do remember that. It's Ashe. I grew up in the mountains with my father, who was a knight in his own right. He taught me the arts of war as though I was his son. Of course, lessons in common courtesy were not part of the regimen. So forgive me if I come off as rude, yeah? Listen, before I blab both of your ears off, I want to tell you something. Snow Peak, the mountain to the north of Hyrule, is unlike any mountain I've ever known. By the way, the Snow Peak area has my favorite dungeon in the entire game. It's actually one of my favorite dungeons in all of Zelda, but that's not... We're not doing that yet. I don't know much yet, but things happen there that happen on no other mountain I know of. Evil controls it. As soon as I know something more, I'll tell you. Until then, you should stay away, yeah? She's kind of pretty. Oh yeah, no, she's pretty. Her hair is kind of funny to me, like just the bang shape. But... Like, she's great. Like, honestly, all of the designs are top tier. Hey, this guy looks familiar, doesn't he, chat? Or maybe not. But he looks familiar, doesn't he? Hmm. And doesn't want to talk to me. Interesting. Interesting. Hi. That old codger. This is the Lake Hylia studying the desert. All right. Mark it. We're going to go there real quick and then start. Well, let, let's at least get to the desert. And then we'll call it uh, a night and do the fan art. Those are cute jeans. Oh, her, her, whole, her whole outfit absolutely slaps. I think I'm going to give stuff to a Shay, by the way. She deserves it. She's very pod. Like Noma size small. Oh, you're talking about small Link. Yeah, small Link is Noma size small. Which is like really small. It's okay. She can't hear me. She's she, she, She's been gone for a little bit. It's fine. It's fine, Chad. Okay, let's see. And yes, I am saying that see if she shows up, but I don't think she will. 
So now's my time to just drop Smallma. Smallma. VTuber miss Smallma. Okay. The desert, huh? Don't think she, uh, she's even referenced in Breath of the Wild. I don't think a Shea is referenced in any other game than this one. Oh god, no. Oh wait, never mind. He's not an asshole, right? He, this bird's fine, right, Chad? I think. Squawk, hello. Hello, I'm Bloom. I'm really excited about the latest attraction here at the lake. Want to hear about it? Nope. Oh, I see. Okay, no, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'll be nice. I'll be nice. I'll be nice. Oh, was it something? Yeah, let me listen to the rules. This attraction's all about popping balloons as you move towards the goal. It's stupendous. The balloons are worth different. Oh my god, he's actually really nice. Damn it, I'm sorry, Birdman. The balloons are worth different amounts of points. Watermelon's one, orange's three, and strawberry's ten. That's pretty much how I'd rate them, too. Oh, and if you break the same type of balloon twice in a row, and you get double the points, but only up to ten times. If you hit a wall and fall off, then you get no points. That's right, zero points for you. Yeah, that's what that's the score chat gives me when I tell a joke. Press B to start off from the beginning. You know you can get something if you get over 10,000 points, right? Not that you ever will. Okay, wait, hang on. Well, the game starts as soon as you fly into the air, yeah. All right, cool, man. Oh, you thought I was going to play your game. You thought I was actually going to play it? Nah, I I'm good. He hates this bird. He hates this man. Thank you for the gifts of the small ma. Small ma. Ma, who is small? Wish these lads would have been used more, not the bird. I'm going to say in the others. Yeah, they have a lot of potential, which is why Twilight Princess 2 could have been... Uh, very, very poggers. And that Wii U tech demo, don't even get me start on the Wii U tech demo. With the high res goddamn Twilight Princess looking like next gen. I'm still so sad that wasn't a reality. Alright. Alright, can you take me to the desert, homie? Hey, you're back. So, fella, I guess you like the ride, huh? Not a tad bit of, not a bad bit of fantastic king. The height of excitement, the thrill of launching to the heavens, the very peak of flying fantastication. It can be yours, fella, for a limited time and without waiting in line. It's a paltry ten rupees. What do you say, buddy? Am I want to give it a shot? No. You want? You got our cannon for me to repair? Oh no, I, I don't. I don't. I guess I gotta find the lead. Heading off. You know where he's next? Have yourself a damn good one. Hope you enjoyed the stream. Hope to see you again if you did. And uh, get yourself that goddamn good gamer sleep. That you deserve. Thanks for coming on by. Okay, he's got to be here somewhere, our boy. Hang on. Oh, wait. The flag is right. There's a flag on the map. There is a flag on the map. Plum. Plum has no need to speak to humans. You know what? I take it back. You're an asshole. I hate you. I, I love that bird. I can't. I can't. Maybe he's had a bad experience with every human on Earth. You know? Just one human shouldn't be enough to make you not want to talk. But, you know, it, maybe it's every human. Hey, Shady, I'm playing Pokemon Street Dungeon. I just had Scyther draw me. Want to be named after a Scyther? Yes, please. <laughs> I would love to be in a Luna game. In a Luna save file. Absolutely do that. I would be honored. Any other Pokemon uh, I should keep in mind for you? Just the first three gens? Uh, I also don't mind being a ghost type like Gengar or something if they have those. But I'm totally fine with being a Scyther as well. Any ghost are fun like little scrimbly bug types. But Scyther is great. Oh my god, he's not a friend. Why did I think he was? Please. That bullet bill is not unique to the remake, no. But that is a fun reference, isn't it? It's funny, I didn't even see it. I totally forgot that was a thing until he pointed it out. Yeah! Don't think I'm getting Gengar anytime soon. Scyther it is then. Hell yeah. I'm all about it. I'm all about it. I'm savvy. Okay. Where... Where is this homie? Wait, like... Wait, what? The flag's here. He's gotta be on top of it, yeah? But how? How do I... Oh, there's a ladder. Look at me asking questions and being promptly answered by the game. Imagine, imagine a game being good game design. Oh, sorry, yo, <laughs> sorry, Corona. We we have a uh, we have a, a link blocker, and I guess it took your Stanley Parable thing as a block link. But I saw it. I saw it. Um, I thought it was about time for you to arrive. I am Aru, which sounds like Rauru, which probably has no link, but you know. Uh, Master Link, is it? 
You do know Telma, don't you? I'm Aruru. A Aruru. I am part of the group that Telma kindly allows to meet at their bar. I've heard about all your deeds from her. Now, you being a courageous, courageous youth, you have likely heard of the strange events in the desert and come to investigate, no? Or am I mistaken? You do know, don't you, Master Link? The Gerudo Desert once held a prison built to hold the worst criminals this land has ever known. Oh, right. Yeah, we're going to the Gerudo Desert. The criminals who were sentenced to death were sent directly to the underworld by a cursed mirror that was kept in the prison. Interesting. Now that, uh, that's what we're looking for. Now that prison is condemned, and even the road leading to the desert is impassable. This desert at world's end, it still holds the cursed mirror and the malice of the doomed inmates. These old bones know that the evil currently plaguing Hyrule is related to this, uh, related to this wicked place, so I've come to learn the truth. Master Link, I must ask, what will you do now? Don't tell me you plan to enter the desert and confirm my suspicions with your own eyes! You mean, like, play the video game? No, I, I'm absolutely gonna do that. Is that so? Then good old Aruru will help you out. You see Lake Hylia below us? A man named Fire runs an amusement ride of sorts there. Give him this. The memo to fire me off to the desert. Let's go. See, long ago I saved this man, Fire's life, and now he cannot refuse me if I ask a favor. Oh shit, okay. If you uh, if you leave the rest of the fire, all will go well. Alright. Uh, guess what you say when I chat with you? My scythes are honed to ultimate sharpness. That's perfect. That's something I would say. I would absolutely bring out, like, an edgy anime line like that. My scythes are honed to ultimate sharpness. I, it'd either be that or, like, I'm a pro gamer. Wait, did we do this, Stone? We didn't do- okay. Alright, one last thing. One last thing, and then we'll go to the desert, and then we'll do art. I'm running this a little bit late, but it's fine. I don't have nothing to do right now. Okay. What? Oh my god, that is so much. Show me again. Uh, down, middle, up. Down, middle, up. Down, middle, down, up. Down, middle, up. Down, middle, down, up. Down, middle, up. Down. God damn it, really? What was the timing on it? Jesus, hang on. Show me again. Show me again. Okay. Oh, yeah, no, I got that. Oh, it's down. It's up. It's up. It's back up. We don't have to go middle at all. Okay. I don't know. Are they trying to do... Is it that one? Is it Nocturne of Shadow, or was that, like, what botched... What was that? <laughs> oh, I love Umbreon. I feel you on that Umbreon love. All right, here we go. Let's try it. It is Nocturne of Shadow? You're still playing TP? Just for a little more, but also, good morning, or good, good wake up. Good brain awakening. Hello, Nat. Wait, what? No? This doesn't sound like Nocturne of Shadow at all. That that was just its own thing. Confusion. I don't know if that was it. But alright, we got him anyways. We're good. We're good. Hey, those are some familiar symbols up there. Hmm. Interesting. Hmm. How quaint. This problem's probably its own thing. Yeah, I'm imagining that one's one of the Oh my god. Oh, he's out. Okay, he's out where we're going. Probably is that. Alright. Let's go. Back those pillars. All, all that. You know, I wonder if that's going to show anything later. I don't know. I don't know video games. I've never played them. Alright. Imagine making original music. Kind of cringe. AI music. And selling it. Oh, by the way, speaking of which, by the way, I'm joking about that, of course, but... Uh, there are conventions that are now trying to sell, like, put up kiosks to sell AI art. <laughs> I think one of them were getting, like, clowned on at a convention recently, because, every, like, everyone's, like, taking a picture to, like, don't buy art from here. It's, like, literally AI. What is video? What is a game? What is a game? Oh, God, I paid him for- I gave him the- I showed him the wrong thing. Chat, I- Shit. Do I have to ride that now? I think I messed up. Here, look at this. Okay, now we're good. Wait, what? No, later, later. If you want to... 
All right, let's do the mini game one more time, lads. One more time. Deserved? Absolutely deserved. What a, what a, what a, what a, like, absolutely awful thing to do. And remember, like, this AI doesn't come from, like, just no, out of nowhere. It takes stuff from other people's art and puts it together. So it's literally stolen art at the same time. Like, you can't, you can't be selling shit that you didn't make. Like, if you have no talent, just, just practice. <laughs> just practice. But we've had this talk before of no talent people trying to be important in some way in the worst possible way ever by doing something like that. And it's like, just, just pick something up. Just do it. Just do it. Stop thinking like a crypto bro and like actually do something fun with your life. <laughs> Here we go. Let's do it. As an actual artist, that's so embarrassing. Oh, yeah. If someone starts selling like AI music, I'm going to lose it. Not really. I'll just be like, well, that's stupid. But you know what I mean? It's pretty bad. We have to play this game once at the end of every TP stream. Now, yeah, it's looking like tradition. Lord. Worst tradition ever or best? Who knows? This guy's eyes, though. That guy in general is just amazing. I love these cloins. Like, I did a line specifically for this guy to say, no, don't show me the quest item right now. You have to go into the cannon. Yeah, like, they knew I was going to make that goddamn mistake. I hate everything. Why am I so gangster at this game now? I changed my mind. Never mind. I'm not good at it. I lied, chat. There's a Poe here. Might as well. I keep stalling. I don't want to end it yet, but like, I gotta. I gotta. Chicken? Oh my god, is that a Kapap Corp? Hey, cat, by the way. By the way, exciting news. Is that a squirrel? That a little squirrel? Oh, it's a chicken. Right. Uh, exciting news. I got my website, finally. Like, my domain name. I uh, I am the owner of ShadyCicada.com now. So I could finally start getting that merch store together. Um, and I am the proud owner of ShadyCicada.ca as well. Speak to the chicken. I hope you'll come again. Oh, that's cute. What the hell? Even he's part of the game. Like, they're not doing it against their will. That's actually really cute. They're all part of the business. All right. Let's see. That it'll ever be sold. Uh, I doubt they will ever be sold. Well, I mean, AR, AI art used to be shitty, too. And then gave it, gave it a few years and it was great. There's no way they can't do the same with AI music. I, I honestly think they're going to make it sound palpable at some point. Um, but we'll see. Now, the problem with that is that it could sound like a MIDI thing, but people already make MIDI, so it's going to be like, oh, man. Is it going to be harder to tell if it's fake or real? Who knows? We'll see. From old Aru, huh? Oh, well, I guess I ought to do what the old coot says. Oasis flight, right? I gave him, like, a gruff, like, I was like, so here you go. Uh, one of our secret... I don't remember what I gave him. Anyways, secret options not available to the general public. It sounds all paid for, so what do you say? You want to go? Yeah. All right, then remember, next time you gotta pay. Sweet swelling buddy of mine, one for Oasis, fire in the hole. I should have gotten some fairies and potions. Who cares? Let's go. Manifest merch ideas? Yeah, actually, to those who are... Uh, I, so, here's the thing. So, I'm gonna be hitting up some people for uh, merch ideas and stuff. Commissions, of course. But if anyone does want to make little ideas and stuff, we do have a merch channel. If you want to submit an idea. That, once again, though, that that is time that is time and talent out of your out of your life. So I don't want to make people do that. But if you would like to propose something, and if I do like it enough, I'll 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 buy it off of you. But once again, there's also the chance of me not buying it. You know what I mean? But uh, I I pinned a few things I would like to maybe do. Forgot to DM you again. No, don't worry, don't don't worry. I still have to make the announcement that I'm looking for artists. Um, there are some that I'm planning on hitting up on my own as well too. So, but yeah. I will, I will pay for that. AR is basically just intensified stolen art. No, it's 100% that, okay? Like, it's it's infuriating, and I really hope it dies out, or... Because it's going to get so good at some point, where it's going to be hard to tell, and that's when it's going to be, like, a bit of an issue. But we'll see. Hope it doesn't happen for all types of art. I hope, I hope just hope... I, we don't need it. We really don't need it. For memes, sure. Wait, Link. There's a really funny one I want to tell you guys about in a minute, but let me get past this first. Before we go on, there's something I want you to hear. Do you remember what the spirit said about the few shadows? What do you think happened to the uh, magic wielders who tried to rule the sacred realm? I mean, we know about that story already. They got banished to the Twilight Realm. They were banished. They were chased across the sacred lands of Hyrule and driven into another realm by the goddesses. And Zant said his people were being oppressed, so I wonder. Put two and two together. Oh, this, this is one of my favorite songs. You're not going to hear a lot of it now, but later. Hmm. It was another world entirely, the antithesis of Hyrule, where the sun shines bright. 
Look at the sky in this area. Its denizens became shadows that could not mingle with the light. So if you guys don't know, when those lads got banished um, during the, the war, they became like dark, you know, dark beings. Eventually, most came to call it the Twilight Realm, and from it, none could return to the world of light. They were forever doomed to live in the twilight, fitting in the half-light of dusk, mere shadows of Hyrule. There's another running theory that they actually used to be the Gerudo. I don't really necessarily think so, but that would be a fun thing too. They do have the hair color. Uh, this is the history of the twilight as it was passed down from our ancestors. But who knows what they look like before this. Do you understand what I am? I'm a descendant of the tribe that was banished to the twilight realm. I put two and two together. Oh yeah, they did see Minna's Lament, Nat, and it was great. It was a peaceful place until Zant took control of the Twilight Realm and transformed all the Twilight into Shadow Beasts. Yeah. Not the sounds. It's clear to me now that he somehow gained the great evil power previously unknown to our tribe. In any case, I was sent from there and could no longer get into the Twilight Realm without his power. I think they're the same tribe that made Majora's Mask. That, that was my head cannon, but it could all be put together. Uh, but there's another tale told by my people. I do like the idea that they could have been Gerudo and like Shika and stuff too, like like bad, like Yiga type people. Though the goddesses forbade us to return to the World of Light, they left one link between the light and the darkness. And no, it's not Link. <laughs> Something called the Mirror of Twilight was passed to the protectors of Hyrule. It's our only path to the Twilight Realm, and we must get there. It, yeah, like, look at the eye on her helmet right there. And tell me that's not the exact eye from Majora's Mask. And I'm not even trying to do copium. If you put that next to the Majora's Mask eye, it's quite literally, like, the same thing. Uh, it could just be a fun thing, too, though. You'll come with me, won't you? I, Link's smile in this game is just so endearing. That's all he has to do. And you know he's on your side for, like, life. <laughs> Love, Link. Anyways, the funny thing I wanted to mention is that someone was like, this is my take on Makima from Chainsaw Man. And it looked nothing like her. This dude quite literally typed Big Boob's Redhead like 50 times into the AI generator and made, like, some shitty AI art. That's the other funny thing about the Crypto Bros trying to sell the art. It's always got to be like, I put this together, so beautiful. And you know they type like anime girl big boobs every time. Which like, okay, yeah, sure. I, 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 like, no complaints. But at the same time, really, dude? Like, really? You have the option to use AI and make anything out of it. And you all type big boobs? Because they've never seen them in person. <laughs> I, th that might be ac 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 accusatory. But you know it's true. Crypto bros? Come on. Lads like that? Nah, come on. They're spending all the time. They could be, you know, seeing things like that to make AI art and try to sell it. Because they want to get that bag with no talent. Um, I was thinking for the gifts up to Zant's wife, which I hope, I hope, I hope there is not one. Zant does not deserve a wife. Zant doesn't deserve love. <laughs> is that a P-hat? Also, I don't know if Kay is still here, but Kay, uh, in the in the desert in um, Breath of the Wild, I don't know if you ever found a place called Arbiter's Grounds, um, but this game actually shows more of that place, which in, in Breath of the Wild, it looks like ruins. So, I mean, I'm not going to spoil anything, but if you want to know more about that area, if you do remember seeing it, this game actually like gives it gives it to you. Crypto Bros is the type of people to type grass into an AI art gen because they can't understand why they keep being told to touch grass. Yeah, they, just, they don't know what it is. They're like, what is grass? I haven't explored Gerudo so much in Breath of the Wild. It, it, it's okay. Gerudo's a really hard one to fully explore. 100%ing that area is rough. You can get sand boots, by the way, to like run faster in there and snow boots to run faster in the snow, which are like desperately needed. Uh, I need to complete that one of the Barbarian. Oh, the Barbarian one is so cool. I love that one. The um, the one you find in the mazes. Yeah, what is it called again? Is it literally just called Barbarian? I can't remember. But yeah, it's the one that belonged to the ancient Farin tribe. Yeah. There's theories behind that too. There's theories behind the people who made that. Like the race that made that and then suddenly disappeared. 
are uh, going to be very prominent in Tears of the Kingdom. Wait till you hear about the Zonai stuff, okay? There's this big theory about this ancient race. Because there is an ancient race that, like, aren't in Breath of the Wild. But they clearly have been there. And a lot of their architecture is in the Tears of the Kingdom trailers. And they seem to have a lot of ties to, like, very important things. Anyways, I'm going to save here, chat. We're going to call it here. Next dungeon and stuff will be next stream. This stream, like, these, this is going, like, pretty damn smooth. A lot of games I've been playing recently, I've beaten in, like, two streams. I forgot how, like, nice and, like, padded out this game is. And it never really feels like big filler to me, other than, like, the tears stuff. But, like, we're past all the collecting the tears thing, so... We're pretty much in, like, a good home stretch for, like, good, good, good shit. Also, me, it just gives Link the Desert Vo outfit because naked. <laughs> yeah? It's funny, the, the Vo outfit, uh, that's the guy one, right? Yeah, I wanted to, um... I wanted to do a... <laughs> I wanted to cosplay a Gerudo male and just wear that outfit and, like, have red hair. I thought that would have been cool. One day. But yeah, I'm, I'm very pumped to see what's uh, gonna come up Tears of the Kingdom. You guys know it's, it's what, under, under 180 days now. We're hitting that mark. We're getting there. When you think about it, it really is, what, like, half a year from now? Which isn't that, like, long. These months go by really fast. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed. We're going to get to the fan art now, which uh, if you have never seen it, uh, feel free to stick around and check it out. It's actually one of the most fun parts of these streams. Sometimes it's very fun and amazing. Other times it's really cursed. Other times someone draws one of my wives and it makes me very happy. <laughs> what do you mean? An anime waifus? I'm definitely not into that. Are you kidding me? Pretty ladies, please. No, but like actually. <laughs> All right, let's do it. And we'll come back to some more Zelda this week. Probably even tomorrow. We'll see. I might do something different tomorrow as well. I, I don't know yet. I do have to get some work done as well. I do have to make uh, a song for YouTube. I have one in mind and hopefully it works out. But if not, I don't know. I don't know. I probably have some backup songs that I've always wanted to release. Yo, Cobalt, thank you for the 31 months as well. I very much appreciate that, dude. And uh, I hope you continue to enjoy your stay around here. We're about to get to the art. So I hope you enjoy. But thank you for almost three years worth of support, dude. For real. Are you poly? What do you mean, like, uh, polyamorous? In terms of 2D waifus, yes. In terms of relationships, I actually don't know. I've never been against the idea of being in a poly relationship. Um, but at the same time, I think the monogamy is kind of a, a dope deal for me. Alright. 2D waifus, nah, I don't like that. Blushes. Yeah, exactly, Kay. Wait, <laughs> you just wait. You just wait. Without saying too much, there is a form of Midna, the buddy character I have in this game. There is a form of her. I don't want to say a lot, because I don't spoil nothing, but there is a form of her that is, like, ultimate waifu for me. Anyways, hang on. There we go. <laughs> Rosalina from Mario. Pyra from Xenoblade. Yuni from Xenoblade. Mio from Xenoblade. I really like Xenoblade. I really like the Xenoblade characters. They're great. Anyways, let's get some of that art going. <laughs> Why do people not like the Zonai? No, they like the Zonai. It's more so it got brought up in like, it, 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 it's not as bad. It's not as bad as some people are putting it, even in chat. Like it was like, to me, it was never annoying. I feel like it's, it's annoying if you're like way too hard into it, which is funny because I'm hard into it, but like it never annoyed me. It, it's, it's, a, it's a solid thing to talk about. Like it's quite literally like the, one of the biggest things we have to go by from the lack of information given to us in the Tears of the Kingdom trailers. So I think it's okay. Um, but yeah, it became a point where like for fun, I was like, oh my God, this might be a I thing. Um, but I only did it as a joke because I knew some people would get annoyed, but I, I don't, I don't care. I think it's, I think it's cool. Um, and like, what else are we going to talk about? You have dehydrated Ganondorf, you have Zelda falling off a cliff and arm, and then you have that, which there is a lot of already in Breath of the Wild. Um... Want to make art of you drifting in a boat initial D stop and on the energy? No, nah, no worries. No worries. That sounds amazing, though. Let me get some music for you guys, and we'll uh, we'll get going on that. I've been watching Mume, uh, the Hololive streamer. She's playing Resident Evil 7, and she is so f she's not get jump scared by a single thing. It's amazing, and she's so funny about it. She saw Mia sleeping in the cage. She's like, why are you go why'd you go missing for three years? I found a new girl. She treats me right. And then she like, starts shaking the cage. She's like, she doesn't hear this. She's deaf too. And I'm like, oh my God, you turned this into like a domestic like dispute when it was supposed to be like horror. And it's so funny. Like I really, I'm really enjoying her uh, playthrough of it. There's also one line she drops where like she picks up a gun and she makes Ethan sound like really snarky about it. Uh, it's right here. What is it? Okay. Don't take too long. Don't take too long. Yeah, I got the gun. 
It's like he says, okay, okay. fine. Oh, wait, whoops. Fine. Okay, fine. Fine, Mia. You want to be that way, Mia? <laughs> Fine. I don't know why your voice just kills me there. And then everyone was like, are you good? Are you okay? <laughs> you want to be that way, Mia? It just, it kills me. I love Mume. She's so chill. She's just a little owl VTuber. All right, let me, let me get some of that music going. And I know we got some owl fans in here. In fact, we have another owl VTuber in here. So there you go. Owl VTubers are uh, always top tier. Alright, guess we're starting with some Phoenix Wright music in here. Alright, give me a second, let me get the art. Owl? Yeah, she's an owl VTuber, Luna. And just like you. Um, And yeah, she's like super, just super, super chill. <sighs> Alright, one second. Stretching. We do got some art of all kinds. There is some Zelda. There, I okay. I, I I glanced really fast and I saw Mickey Mouse. So I'm I'm very excited because I already know what that's gonna be about. Um, give me a minute here. Thank you for the gift sub to Mume. <laughs> I don't even know if that's real. I don't think Mume has a Twitch, does she? She streams on YouTube, yeah. But still, whoever that is, thank you. Well, they made their account in 2013. Jeez, sheesh. Um, but thank you so so much for the gift sub. Give me a second here. Oh, I'm looking at the old art. Never. Mind. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Okay. We got... Oh my god. I probably won't be able to name all of these. I don't recognize some of them, but they're all very cute. So I'm going to... I'm, let's take a look at them. One second here. The first piece of art comes from Retro. Actually, the first few pieces of art are from Retro. Um, and it's Balloon Guy Cosplays. Our little man. And uh, this is Bay from Hollow Live. The Australian streamer, Australian VTuber. She's great. And once again, another fun fact, by the way, which, by the way, first of all, this looks amazingly cute. I love the little mousetrap on the ear and everything. This is super, super cute. Um, if you guys don't know, the artist that uh, designed Bay is the same person who was designing the characters in the current Fire Emblem coming out. Same person. Which makes a lot of sense when you look at the hair now. It's like, oh, now, you know what? I get it. I don't even mind it. I think they're doing a great job. But this is lovely. Good, good job, Retro, on that. Very cute. We have uh, uh, Ina. I believe it's Ina. Uh, who I think she is also very, very chill. I don't watch a lot of her stuff. In fact, I don't think I've ever watched anything of hers. But she seems really, really cool and amazing. I got to check her out more. I think there are a few arts before these. Okay, once I go through this, I'll back up a bit. And I will, uh, I'll take a look. Oh, you're right. Jesus Christ. Sorry about that. I got mixed up. I didn't see the date change. We have stuff from like the 10th and all that too that I haven't seen. Thank you for letting me know. Ina's so good in art. Oh yeah, Ina's art. Okay, that is something I've seen. Her art is like genuinely fantastic. Um, Yeah, her community is also very nice from what I've seen. The last time I saw anything about Ina was when she was trending on Twitter for the, the whole back angle thing. Um, this next one is... See, this is one I don't know. I don't know who this is. But this is very, very cute. Is Are there any like maid types with like little... Uh, bow ties, or is this not a VTuber? Is this just a normal maid outfit? Either way, that is very, very cute, and you did a lovely job with this. Ina and Gura are your favorite? I think mine are, uh, in, in, in the first gen at least, it would be, like, uh, Calliope, Mori, and, um, Ame. But I, G Gura, Gura is really, really funny. Love her too. They're all fantastic. Just a random maid. That is very cute. Very good job with that retro. And then we have... Oh, this is, um... I feel like this is Noma's favorite on Hololive. Isn't this fu uh, Fubuki or whatever? Or am I wrong? It could just be a cat person, but... That is super cute. What is this song? It sounds great. Oh! Right! It is Xenoblade 3 music! Let's go! Play Xenoblade. Play Xenoblade. Do it. But anyways... That is Fubuki. Okay. Very, very cute. That is, I love that one. A little cat balloon guy makes me very happy. Love me little cat balloon guy. Great stuff. Um. Uh, yeah. It, it can, hang on, we, we got a bit more. Hang on. Uh, we have... <laughs> now we got streamer friends. Uh, here's balloon guy's Imamura, which very cute. I'm glad to see it finished. It looks very good. And you got his outfit down pretty much perfectly. Um, great. Great job on that. And I'm sure Emas would be very happy to see it too completed. Great stuff. Also, like, Balloon Guy's face on this one is adorable. 
Speaking of adorable, we also have another streamer friend, another VTuber friend, actually. Uh, it's Balloon Guy as... Uh, I almost said Navi. <laughs> Avi, Avalorosma, the Banui VTuber. Uh, VTuber, V... I can't speak tonight, as always. Um, but she is very, a very, very wholesome last two. Please check out Avalorosma. But that is very, very cute art. Great job, Retro. What is this? Where's the real shady? What did you do to him? Oh, because I didn't get the Xenoblade? Listen, listen now. Is a Rosalina song? Okay. My wife gets her own music. What can I say? Uh, next up comes from Pan Plants. Uh, they said, here, take it. I can't think of what else to type. And then they played baseball and looked hot. Wait, what is this? Oh, because I said Twilight because of the title of my goddamn... I forgot I named it that. I forgot I called him Edgar instead of Edward. <laughs> Oh, the old art. Right, right. Let me back up after this. Sorry, sorry. My brain's broken. I'll go back after this. Um, I think the Twilight movies are awesome. If you don't think that makes me sexy and cool, don't freaking talk to me. I am not even kidding. Bella, where the hell have you been? <laughs> is this is this canon now? Is Twilight Princess Zelda a fan of the Twilight books and movies? Oh my god. That is amazing. <laughs> Pen, that is a th this is very very good. Also, just her expressions on it are fantastic. The shirt kills me. I think the second one kills me more for some reason. I don't know why, but very 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 good work. <laughs> As always, I have to try and read that book. Hang on. I have no idea what Twilight is about. You know what's funny? I do to a degree, because back in high school, everyone when I was in high school, the first book came out, and everyone was like in love with it, and I was like, oh shit, well I better get on the hype and see what this is. That is the only book, and I mean, I was a teen, so I was edgy with it, but that was the only book I ever threw in the garbage. <laughs> no offense to Twilight fans. I just, I hated it. I was like, what the, what the hell is this? This ain't vampire. Uh, let me go back to the older art now. Great job, Pan. Thank you so much for the lovely art. Yo, Mario 3 music? Okay. Now, I don't remember exactly where. Okay, I, I think I know. So, the first... Okay, we got we got art from Taffy Cat here. They said, I'm having slight art blocks, so I made a thing while listening to Body of Thorns. I think I... I don't know. Actually, no, I didn't see this, I don't think. But that is so freaky. I love that. I love that. That's amazing. Um, if you guys don't know, Body of Thorns is my last song release, which I'm really happy people are liking it as much as they are. It, it actually, funny enough, the YouTube video is also uh, growing really fast. For someone who's taken like a three month break, it's like, it's kind of insane. So um, that is really sick art. I love the line work on it, the menacing face. It's super spooky and well done. And uh, honestly, I, I would have used this as the goddamn album art. You did an, an amazing job, Taffy, as always. And I hope you get over that art block um, soon, sooner than later. You will, but um, fantastic thing to work on, even with art block. That looks amazing, dude. Uh, Taffy has another thing here. It said, pulls out gun, shoots. I think I like murder now. <laughs> that, that is beautiful. The music almost fits. But yeah, he's a little menace. He's a little menace. He's not looking to kill. He just thinks the gun is neat. It makes loud boom boom noise. We might have to confiscate it from him. What do you have there? A gun! But very good work. That animation is so, so d well done. And like the art style is giving me, I don't know what vibe it's giving me, like what game I'm thinking of. But it looks absolutely amazing. Great job as always, Taffy. Like it's so smooth. Very, very good. I, seriously, thank you all for not only just making art, but for making just such amazing animations as well. Also, this uh, gif is called Shady Gun Shootin' Tootin' for the record. But keep up the amazing work, Taffy. Um, next up is from Retro. I, oh my god. I hate and love this. I'll tell you why I hate this. The soup. A and the lean. I hate you for that, Retro, but also very, very well done. This is, uh, Balloon Guy eating some, uh, just having a meal with Noma. And that is very, very cute. Love the art in the back as well. I love the little Noma out in, like, the marsh or, like, the beach or wherever that is. That is super cute. In fact, you just making Smolma is very happy. Noma told me to do it. Don't ever listen to Noma. Don't you dare do that ever again, Retro. You kidding? It's it's Noma. I almost said Mona. <laughs> but no, really. Lovely art. Thank you so much for sharing. Um, Very good work. Next up, we have art. Or we have a shitpost from Metasonic. Uh, here we go. 
Shady, damn, I wish this was a Pokemon. We'll, meanwhile, Shelmet being sad. Who the hell is Shelmet? Who is this? What, what, what gen is? I, I do not, I, I legit chat, I'm not lying. I don't know what this Pokemon is. Gen 5? What is that? Black and white? Or is that... What? What is this thing? I love it! Gen 5. I was unaware of this look. And me too! Look at him! Look at him! That He's cute as hell! And that's such a good name! I love Shelmet! Oh my god, wait, what did I become? Oh shit! Little edgelord. I love that. Okay, yo, alright. I can vibe with that. Alright, you know what? From now on, I'll remember Shelmet. Alright, you, you, you've enlightened me, Metasonic. It is black and white, okay. I still have to play those games. Maybe one day I'll stream it. I hear it's one of the best Pokemon games in terms of story, so... Uh, anyways, next up comes from Pan Plants. They said, I asked my cat... I asked my cat to watch Chainsaw Man with me and she ran away. Guess she doesn't like boobs. Also, watching Chainsaw Man as an ace person is interesting. Yeah, I feel like the last episode might have been hilarious for you. Um, th there was... The, <laughs> the first few seconds in, in, in... The first few minutes of the last episode of Chainsaw Man is interesting. I watched it with Noma and we were like... Well, she was more like, oh my god. And I was like, yeah? It was interesting. Anyways, from Pan Plants, we do got some... Oh wait, actually, Noma's gonna love this if she hasn't seen it yet. Oh my god. It's Chainsaw Man, Shady Cicada, Noma Art, and Chat Chain. I only want you to answer with subs and hype trains. Oh my god, it's Makima. Um, I believe that's a Makima Chat Chan, right? And I got me my, my Denji outfit. We got a we got Noma as power. And Balloon Guy as goddamn Pochita with a guitar head. This is one of the best things I've ever seen, Pan. Like, legitimately, this is one of my favorite pieces of art I've ever seen you make. This is so cool. This is so cool. You even gave him, like, the Pochita eyes in the face. That is so, so cute. So trying to design a guitar, man. Oh, my God. If you do it, Pan, please. Yeah, <laughs> please. No, no pressure. But if you ever end up doing it, you have to show that. Oh, my God. This is cool as hell. I'm going to send this to Noma. But also, if you don't know, if you're in Noma's uh, Discord... I think she's streaming tonight, and she does check art. So if you did want to share it in her server, um, if you do, if you're in there, like absolutely go for it. I think her wait, are her eyes like jellyfish? Her eyes are jellyfish. I think that's really good. The attention to detail is fantastic. Great job, my god. Also great. I love me. <laughs> I love me my chainsaw man. So I'm really happy to see that. I'll have to join. Yeah, absolutely. I might be raiding her. If she, actually, no. I might actually no. She she should be on by now if she is streaming. Our time zones are a little different now because we're on saving. So she's like 16 hours away from me. So she's 9 p.m. She should be online. Anyways, uh, we got more art. Give me a minute here. From uh, Pan again. They said, Frommy, sorry. Frommy, sorry. Frommy, sorry. You're not going to get any complete art tonight. You know what? For <laughs> Oh, my God. <laughs> maybe maybe it's a good thing. <laughs> he didn't complete it. I'm kidding. This actually, this is actually amazing. This has to do with Zelda tonight, because everyone kept calling the frog mini boss Frommy and Filth, like Milf. I, I I hate it. Like not this art. I hate what you guys did. This art's fantastic for what it is, and I was absolutely expecting some Frommy art. So you know what? Good job. G good on you, for actually making a unique design out of it. Legitimately, this could be a cool ass character in something. So very good job. Um, you feel no like F I L F, but now her name is Filth. Pen, you know what you drew her you drew her so i guess her name is filth oh no but very 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 good work i even love the uh the addition of the head things on her head or whatever the antennae antennae great work next up comes from retro and they said we, we have a wood woodzard shady wood oh like a wizard a woodzard very cute very cute my first thought is not a good first thought I'm not gonna lie, because we're so close to Christmas. I really thought about p putting this on. I was like, this would generate some good heat on the bonfire. I, I, at the fireplace. But I won't do that. Of course I won't. I love him. L Wizard Woodwood? Also, Woodwood fan art? Let's go. A Woodzard. I love that. Very cute. I won't put him on it. I won't put him on it. I swear. I swear. He'll be hanging next. He'll be hanging out next to me 
while we while we smoke a fireplace. Although he might not like that. I don't, I'm not really sure. You will log. Yeah. <laughs> Excellent job on this uh, retro. Very good. And uh, man, I'm actually, I don't usually care too much for Christmas. Like, I mean, I'm sorry, the stuff leading up to Christmas. Because I, I don't like carols and all that, like Christmas music. But I, I'm actually kind of excited for it in terms of like just, you know, for family and friends. But also like with you guys during the month. It might, it could be a lot of fun doing some Christmas things. A special Christmas thing. Like how we do like Halloween things, you know? We'll see. Anyways, great job, Retro. Next up comes from Falconhawk. They said, Shady sings happy birthday to chat. Also, noodle arms. Through the fire and the flames we carry on. Oh my god, amazing. It's true. It was two people's birthday in chat today. So I played them some very, very shitty happy birthdays. And we got a cake there. Very cute. I, I, re I love the little chat chan, by the way. Also, like, you drew the eyes really well. Those are some very nice eyes. Um, so great job on that. Very, very cute. And uh, happy birthday to, I believe it was Chim Chim and Traveling Web. Happy birthday to both of you. You're both very lovely and talented. Um, good job, Falconhawk. Next up comes from Pan Plants. They said someone called BPS, Bee Guy Protection Services, full of sea bat. <laughs> oh, wait, that's, that's right. The sea bat button's gone. I have that instead. Yo, yo, F Zero. By the way, I love this. That is so cute. That is such a cute piece of art. What a little, what a little man, a little friend. It's okay. It's okay. We'll unfull him of sea bat. We'll fill him with, we will fill him with happiness and joy as we always try to. But very, very cute art, as always, Pan. Thank you. Um. Oh wait. Whoops. There we go. We also have a little uh, balloon guy piece from Retro. Very cute. Very, very cute. I like that. I like that. That is a good goodbye emote. Absolutely. So he, by the way, he can form fingers if he wants to. He, because, you know, he can change his shape at times. I think that's lore I already told you guys about, but he can do that. It's just his preferred shape truly is... Bloop. Or no, sorry. This, this is his OG shape. His most stable form. But yeah, very cute. Uh, next up, we got another pan plant art. It said Shady being real and drinking milk. I hate you. I hate you for this. I hate you for this. D good choice on clothing and, and, and really cute drawing of me. I hate you for this. I Milk sucks. Okay, I know. I said it. I said it. Milk as an ingredient? Pod. Milk makes me sick. I'm lactose intolerant. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. And now I have a placebo effect, so if I try to drink, like, soy milk, I'll still, like, lose it. You're chugging it down? I don't want to. This is not a real Shady. He's an imposter. He's an imposter. God damn. But also very, very cute and well done. Good, good stuff, Pan. Thank you so much. Me and you both, brother. There you go. I hate drinking milk. Pilk is okay. From the artist who made this art. You better get out of here. You need to... Oh, oh my... Oh my god. Oh my god. I don't know what to say about this next piece of art. I'm going to read what they said first, and then I'm going to show you the art, okay? This comes from my mom said it's my turn on. They said, I had to do another one of these, but whatever. A series. Uh, the first piece is Shady during Splatoon. We have Filth and some chat -apede. So we have chat -apede, Filth, and me, which I'm, I'm glad about me. The other stuff I'm a little concerned about. They said, I actually finished one of my finals at just the right time and had to de-stress a bit by drawing fan art. I always enjoy doing these, but I and I also enjoy your reaction because I can always show and have you say it good. <laughs> no, but seriously, thank you so much. And chat, enjoy some content. You see, I, I, I honestly thank you for those words. And I'm glad to, I, I'm glad you enjoy your time. You enjoy making the art. And uh, I'm sure chat very much enjoys it too. Even when, well, it's this. Okay, first of all, that Splatoon one is amazing. That is 100% me. 100% me. I love that. The filth? I'm a, li I'm a little- I'm a little concerned. I'm a little concerned how you drew the anatomy so well. I- you know what I love? You know what I love about my mom said it's my turn on? There is- they, they have- they have the potential to draw some of the hottest shit in the world. I'm saying that for real. And yet we get this, and I'm not even complaining because it's hilarious. That is that is how that is what you do as an artist, you know? When you have that talent, you be chaotic, because you can. 
And that's why I love my mom said it's my turn on. And here you guys go. You guys said you like Centipede Chan. So there you go. Now you can be a bug introducing yourselves. I'm not going to lie though. Chat Chan in that in, in that little like bug outfit going on there. Because it looks like it's an outfit. Kind of adorable. You can even see like the slippers there where, like, <laughs> where, where it's like pants meeting shoes. Very cute. I like that. But oh my god. Oh my god. Well, you know what? Amazing work. Amazing work. 10 out of 10 design. Also, they said, I got a letter from the walls addressed to you. It is scratched and barely intel intelligible. It reads as follows. Keep your, doors keep your doors open. I need to see you sleep. Don't listen to the wall. I don't know what that means, but I'm sure it's fine. Thank you, my mom said it's my turn on. That's not that's not foreboding at all. No, no, of course not. Uh, great art as always, though. You are a lovely person here, and it's been a pleasure having you here. I was given the ability to create, and I will make it the world's problem. Exactly, Luna. I did that with music. You guys have heard me make troll music. Children babies? I did it because I could. Um, Great work. Next up comes from Falconhawk. They said little scrimblo sketches of Bee Guy. Oh my god. Oh my god, these are fantastic. What is the- Oh my god, the brain one. Oh my god, that brain one. He's kind- It's actually kind of cute. I love how it's flopping over. I- Okay, I- I the, the, Okay, the Jotaro one too? Jotaro one is amazing. The violence one is funny as hell because he looks- He partly looks like he doesn't want to do it. <laughs> He's like, Violence! I love that. I love the upside down one here, but I think my favorite out of all of these is 100% this big eye one here. This little guy, I love him. You said what? I love that. But also, I, I mean, the I am always watching one is, is kind of the focal point here, isn't it? Which, uh, great as well. Great as well. Wait, Among Us? Oh my god, they are Among Us eyes in the violence. Jesus. Is this Monster Hunter? This is Monster Hunter, right? Yeah, it is. 100%. I love these. These are fantastic. The upside down face is also a favorite. And of course, you can't go wrong with the Jotaro. The red party hat becoming Jotaro's hat. Very, very well done. I love these. Good stuff, Falcon Hawk, as always. My god, that watching face is going to haunt me for the rest of my life. <laughs> you, it's getting to a point where you guys are perfecting the Amogus eyes where I'm like not noticing them. That's kind of beautiful. The heart one is so cute. I love the heart one. He's so happy. He's so happy to be lifting that heart. Honestly, any shoutouts to Cicada Love are always a always a good time. Great, great stuff. Thank you so much. Um, next up comes from Small Angel Nana. Good old Naniel. Um, and they said, Uwu believes in you. Oh, wait, I can finally give context again. It's been so long since I've described Uwu to people. Because we haven't gotten art of her in a long time. If you guys don't know who Uwu is, beautiful drawing, by the way. Oh, my God. Absolute wife. Uh, she is... So, there's a lot of OC characters in this stream. Or, in like, in our streams, in this community. Uh, Uwu is one of them. And she started in Tomodachi Life, which is a game with Miis. And it's, like, basically like The Sims <laughs> with Miis, kind of, but not really. Not at all. Uh, not at all. But you get, they get to interact. And so, someone made me in one of their games... And then they made a wife for me. Or I like, got married to this person named Uwu. And her face looked like an Uwu. Uh, which is why, you know, her eyes are like most, closed most of the time. But she has her eyes open. And they're very pretty too. But she's my wife. We had three kids in that. And we have fan art and like fan stories. And she's in Metopia as one of the main characters and stuff in the streams. She's great. But look, she believes in me. That's great. Let me get the ref. <laughs> get that reference. Get that reference. Also, if you type Uwu in the stream art channel... You should get Nana's uh, reference sheets because Nana perfected all of those. Like Nana is the one who made uh, not not the uh, Tomodachi life stuff, but Nana kind of cemented a few designs as well. Um, actually, a lot of chat did their own, but you know, you know what I mean. Like Nana actually has like these reference sheets um, with like I think color palettes and everything. It, it's neat. Um, but here's the second part to it. <laughs> Help! Do you think she still believes in me, chat? I, I I like to think she still believes in me. But yeah, that, that boss fight was a little rough for my own incompetence. But hey, I I did my best, goddammit. I didn't. I really didn't. But that that's amazing. Very cute. Screw you, Morpheal. Dumbass boss. Get, getting a rewormed. I hated it. Hated it. Can't wait to watch Tomodachi Life Miitopia. So here's the funny part. So Miitopia VODs will be up. Uh, I've never played Tomodachi Life. So, uh... Like, this was someone else doing it on their game. But I will... I, I myself will be doing Tomodachi Life soon. Um, since it doesn't look like we're getting a port, I'm going to emulate it. I'm sorry. I mean, I'm going to play it legit. 
and we'll uh, we'll get on that. Next up comes from Pan Plants. You're not gonna like this one, chat. You're, you're actually you're gonna you're, you might love it. The detail is amazing. But from Pan Plants, we have Bread Slut. Because I said I was a slut for bread, so I guess Pan Plants went ahead and made. To match Egg Slut, which by the way, Egg Slut is a real restaurant, by the way, chat. I'm not even lying. If you Google Egg Slut, you will get the menu. But also, oh my god, Pan. Oh my god, the pose and everything. I mean, she's killing it. Sure, why not? You know what? Go off. Do you, uh, Miss, Miss, Miss Bread, Miss Bread, Miss Breddington, Miss Bread, Breadlass? But also, oh my god. The way you carried the textures over to the limbs to make it continue looking like bread is blowing my mind. A uh, very good piece of art, though. Even the background, just full of hearts and stuff. Actually, wait. Roses too? Flowers? My god. You went all out on the background. Jeez. I came across Egg Slut in Singapore. Yeah, see? It's real. Okay, confirmed. My mates call me Uwu instead of my name because they say I look Uwu and is and you're in Uwu mood. Are you kidding? You know what? You give Uwu vibes, Kay. Like, in terms of just mood in general. I can see that. I can see that. <laughs> this is lovely, Pan. I've hit my limit. This is it. I will never create again. No, you have to. After this, you have to do it to continue your legacy, but to also atone for your goddamn crimes. Very good work, though. We got a bit more art. This sounds familiar, too. Why does this sound familiar? Because it's Zelda. It's when you open... Right. Skyward Sword. Play Skyward Sword, everyone. Um. Next up comes from Falcon Hawk. They said Mickey Mouse... Oh, boy. Here you go. Mickey Mouse pisses to mark his territory. I did ask about this during the raid. <laughs> I marked my territory. <laughs> I can't. Okay, to those who missed it, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I got a raid. I got a raid from Maniacal Gamer, and they said something about, like, finding lucky something. Lucky charms, lucky tears, or whatever. And um, I was like, what is that? And he was like, oh, you have to find uh, territory that Mickey has marked. And I'm like, that just makes it sound like he pissed everywhere. So there you go. Yo, more Zelda music, Wind Waker. Let's go. Let's go. Uh, this is lovely, though. I hate it. Oh, Lucky Emblems. Thank you. Luck what did I say? Lucky Charms? Uh, they're after me. Lucky Charms. Very, very good work, though. <laughs> I love this Falcon Hawk. Even though, like, oh my god. He looks so confident about it, and that's what I hate the most. Actually, there's a lot of art. Holy shit. Okay. Great job, Falcon Hawk. Thank you. Next up comes from Retro. We got a little uh, bee guy being pet. Remove that label. That is not lean. It's grape juice. But other than that, very cute. And so I can't think of a name. Have yourself a damn good night, dude. Thank you so much for coming on by. Hope you enjoyed the stream, as always. And this art is very cute, Retro. Thank you so much for sharing. Much appreciated. Um, wow. Okay, yeah, I gotta keep I gotta keep going. Hang on. Hang on. There is a lot. Um next up comes from Cameo, and they said Shady's children. Oh my god. Oh my god! Cameo, you did them all! Oh my god! And I made these all up on the spot. B okay, I gotta say, Blippis is a favorite. Blippis, Blorbo, Shmor- Oh, man, I love Shmorvin. We got Woodwood, of course. Schlieb! He's just a little guy. Svensson! Oh, my God, they all, they all look like their names. Plibson, Mario, I literally said Mario. That did happen. That did happen. They kept track of all of them. I did do that, too. Oh, my God, he even looks like that. Scorn, Scorn is killing me. The detail on that face and the cowboy hat. Oh my God, Scorn. <laughs> well, I mean, I wonder. I wonder who the villain is. They're gonna pull a twist. The villain's gonna be Schlieb, and Scorn's gonna be the edgy good guy. Who knows? But oh my God, and of course, Balloon Guy. Of how could I forget? But wow, I love how Plibson's just like a bowl of soup. This is genuinely such a wholesome drawing. This is very well done, Cameo. I did, not, I, I did not expect someone to take down all the names I said and then make art of every single one of them. That is a lot. The villain is eb -eb 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 prop. You know what? If Cameo says it, the artist themselves, I am willing to believe them. I mean, they have the goatee and the weird-ass hairstyle and the beard going on down. Yeah, they, they have it going on. They do got villain looks. Mario is killing me, too. That is fantastic. But, like, the detail on all of these are great. I love this so much. Like, I, I cannot stress how much I love this. And Scor Scorn's killing me. You birthed a bowl of soup? Imagine that, huh? How did that happen? I think Schmorbin is my ultimate friend, though, now. I, I, I'm kind of in love with Schmorbin. 
I, I thought he was a Diglett at first coming out the ground, but then I saw his little arms and legs, and I'm like, that's even better. He's just a tall boy. I actually clipped you naming the children. Oh, did you? Oh, boy. They're going to be chronicled now. Someone's going to make art of, like, Schlieb next stream, and they're going to be like, it's Schlieb, and I'll be like, who's this? <laughs> and chat's going to have to remind me. I Very good. Yeah, it is an upside down. I noticed his leg sticking out of his head, so he's an upside down balloon guy. But I love it. So, so cute and excellent job. I'm, 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 I'm saving this one just for uh, possible just like lore reasons in my head. Because Balloon Guy does have a race. They are called Hiptums. And they do come in many shapes and sizes. And Chad has made their own. You can even make your own Hiptum Sona if you must. Your Hip Sona, if you will. Uh, Balloon Guy is... I mean, he, he's his own guy. But if I had to be one, I guess I would also just be Balloon Guy as a Hiptum. Uh, but yeah. They, they, can, they can just be like this. Very, very good work. Cameo. Uh, hang on. Next up comes from Toby. They said, Cat boy for the stream. Also, I'm sorry. I know your hair is probably short now, but I get used to drawing your hair long. That's fine. I mean, like, like Pan draws my hair long, too. And I love how, like, I love how it looks. Um, I, either way, I swap between hairstyles anyway. So they're, they all have, they're all, they're all my history. <laughs> um, also, good perspective plus guitars hard. Why did I attempt this while I got silly sleepy brain? I don't know, Toby, but your art's amazing. And I think you did a fantastic job with this. But yeah, it's Catboy Shady with a guitar. Which, honestly, you made me look kind of pog. I'm sorry for giving you cake. That's okay. I've been working out again. And um, I've been working out every part of me. <laughs> so this could be true. This could even be true right now. But you guys wouldn't know. I'm not showing you. Uh, but very, very, very good job on that. Oh my god, the cicada, the, the balloon guy ass. Why would you do this? I didn't even notice that. <laughs> that is so good. Oh my god, I love it though. I love it. Very, very good. Very good art as always. I even love that you gave me a little hole for the tail. Perfect. I have a funny story about this, by the way. Also, yes, Kay, please make your own hip tum sona if you must. That would be super cute to see. Um... Also, I love, what are those, bananas on my shirt? Oh, what is that? A fish in a bag? A sausage? A, a banana. It's gotta be bananas. I love the cute little shirts that you make. Um, I will say, so there's a chat member who comes in here. I think she came from Noma Streams originally. Uh, Nyan Yamari. You've seen her before. Um, legitimately, she thought my whole thing was that I was a cat boy. Like, that was my shtick. Like, I go as cat boy. Like, if I had to be a VTuber, like, that's me. And she's like, I'm confused. Everyone calls you a cat boy. So, like, are you not a cat boy? <laughs> And I was dying. I had to, like, tell her the truth. I'm like, okay, no, no, no. Here, here's the thing. It's a joke. It's a bit. But I also don't mind it. <laughs> but now it's becoming canon that people are thinking I'm just straight up a cat boy. And it, it, it's amazing. I love it. But also great art, Toby. Keep it up. We have another piece from Toby, actually. They said, can't believe Nintendo made him an oopie boy canonically. This is so crazy. <laughs> oh, my God. That's real good. We got a, we got a wolf, wolf boy link. A fusion of both, which honestly, I that that is that is a cool design. I like that very much. Also, the eyes you drew, very well done eyes as well. Um, that is that is great. Very very good job. Oh my god, we made it canon. You guys gaslit it into reality. <laughs> I can't believe you all. Yeah, the fangs and everything like this, like the the detail and even like the ear, like all of this is just fantastic, Toby. Once again, so you know, never be sorry again, or I'll actually fight you. I don't know, you said sorry in there. I think it was per perspective. In fact, you didn't say sorry. Oh, you did say sorry about the hair thing. Yeah, don't worry about that at all, please. You do amazing work. Um, Next, it comes from Silver. Noted. Yeah, I, I will fight. That's right. Got the fist up. I'll fight. <laughs> uh, next, up comes from Silver. Sarah Geos, they said, Link is ready for the water temple. Look at our men. Look oh my god, the floaties. The goddamn floaties make it for me. That is fantastic, Silver. Very, very good and very cute. <laughs> I'm not even gonna lie. I think I needed it. I think I needed the floaties for that fight. Like, for more feel as well. I needed to get away more. Or, you know, slice the goddamn tentacles. It can't be took me that long. But very good work. Very cute. Why does it sound like it's going into, like, an Animal Crossing melody and then doesn't? Oh, Curb. Oh, right. I gotta play more of this. Excellent stuff. The floaty drip. Next that comes from Blue Shrimpy. Oh boy. Speaking of shrimpy, I feel like people are gonna shrimp over this one. Um they said from blue so from Blue Shrimpy they said, so I heard Bunny Boy Link and uh quick drawing eyes emoji. 
<laughs> I didn't see this one coming, but I will say, as always, Blue Shrimpy, your art style never ceases to amaze me, and it's always a pleasure to have you in here. Um, I know it's been a while, like you said, but you are more than welcome to come by and make some art. And there you go. If you watch the VOD for this, or if you're still here, you are still here. Okay, there you go. You could see chat shrimping. <laughs> Listen, we need eye candy on all sides for all for chat. It can't just be waifus for me. Also, you just you did a really like look at the face, like the drawing, like that is the the detail on the hair and the face and the expression is so well done. Like you draw Link like how I want to actually see him in a cartoon. You know what I mean? Very good work on that. Dang, fishnets takes forever. I, I can imagine bunny suits taking a while. Um, hey, fun challenge idea. Make a make bunny suit Rosalina for me, everyone. <laughs> and true form in the... I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Um, next up... <laughs> oh my god. Next up is another one from Small Angel Nana. Nanyel themselves. They said the fact that there hasn't been an uwu for a while now. I have to manifest her into the minds of everyone here. Yes, more uwu. More uwu. There she is. We got more art of her. The wife. The wife. And... That's right, with with the reference sheets that Nana has made, uh, they all have their own little, like, hip tum sona, basically. They're hip sonas. Um, that's a little uwa balloon guy. Balloon girl. Balloon. Just balloon friend. And, uh, yes, she is, she is proficient with, like, some big-ass weapons, which makes it even, uh, more wife-like. <laughs> what a weird way to say that. I'm just saying she's great. And, uh, this art is fantastic. Very good work. That outfit update, too, it's bussin'. Absolutely amazing job. And yeah, I've, I've missed Uwu as well. I missed I missed this arc of Shady Cicada stuff. And it will come back for Tomodachi Life and other things. But I'm glad to see the art coming back. Once again, art of these OCs like her, Flogurt, Algonquin Jerry, AJ, who is still real. I know. Um, and the kids. If I get fan art of any of those, they're welcome for any stream. Like, these are always fantastic to see. Very, very good work. Um, Nana, as always. Honestly, one of my favorites from you. Good stuff. What is this song? It sounds dope. Tekken, of course. Of course. Good shit. But yeah, great job. And we're getting close there. Oh, you know what, Retro? All right. Yeah, I'm about that. From from Retro, we have Mume. Mume Balloon Guy, which, yes, I literally have a Mume stream on that I'm going to go watch while I eat, like, tonight. She's right here. <laughs> I love Mume. So, great job on that. Another very good owl tuber out there. Uh, and finally, to finish it off, uh, from Silver, Silver said, So, B guy can morph his limbs, huh? I hate it. I take it back. I take it back. I take it back. I hate this. <laughs> I take it back. But also, well done. I hate you, though. Oh my god. Look at his face, too. It's like he knows what he's doing. He's like, Oh, yeah, yeah, I can morph with anything. Let me show. Let me. Let me show you. Let me show you real quick. Hell no. Hell no. But also good job of drawing the limbs themselves. Um, but like just just never again, Silver. Never again. I will put you in actual jail. <laughs> oh wait, we have one more piece of art. One more. Um from Nana. They said my hip tum sona is just a wad of hair, an afro, if you will. Oh my god. <laughs> we actually have our first hip sona already tonight nana i love this that is super cute i love the face too oh my god there you go nana as a hip sona very 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 well done i love that face so much oh my god i would hug this one super fluffy you need to make one go for it do it it reminds me of when we did snurp sonas back in metopia and that was so fun so hit me with it if you want you can even add legitimate or or cringy attributes if you want to like uh likes uh edginess hates john from fifth grade like if you want to do that too you can but yeah very good um always busting with the art nana always a pleasure to see it and uh i i'm i'm really glad i'm really glad you uh you came around and made some art as always for real and what a lovely one to end with yeah um great job everyone 